A battle raged at the end of the first tournament. The forces of Earthrealm were facing their greatest challenge. has been spared, but Shang Tsung is a poor loser. This is Goro's lair. It is one of Shang Tsung's traps. You must find your way off the island before it crumbles into the sea. Make your way to the Wuxi Academy. Here, Kang! <laughs> <laughs> 
This is the way off the island. It is another of Shang Tsung's servants. I do not serve Shang Tsung. was his hunger. Once all he could see was under his control, Shao Kahn turned his attention to Earth. But the Elder Gods had created a mystical tournament to protect Earth, known as Mortal Kombat. Shao Kahn could only lay claim to Earth if his champions were victorious in the tournament. Thus far, Earth's warriors have triumphed, saving Earth. But some fights only require a lone victory, and all can be lost with a single defeat. You have ensured peace for Earth once again this day. But there is no power in these medals apart from the knowledge you must carry into every battle. That no one is a champion alone. If one of us is in chains, none of us are free. If even one succeeds, the victory is ours. Liu Kang, you have defeated the sorcerer Shang Tsung. You have saved this realm as your forefathers did from his evil. You are Earthrealm's champion and hero. Thank you, Master Raiden. When next the tournament is fought, it will be my ancestors that are honored. Sonya Blade, you were a warrior before the tournament began. But here you have been tested and triumphed against enemies beyond Earth's measure. Thank you, Master Raiden. I know you have your chief officers to report to. But know that you will always have friends here, and warriors willing to help you in your future missions. Sir! Johnny Cage. Lay it on me, Raiden. Bow, you idiot. Despite your natural shortcomings, you have proven yourself a valuable ally against Shang Tsung. You have the respect of myself and the Shaolin Order. Master. Ah, Kung Lao. Family honor is not won in a single day. It is won all the days of a life. It is won in fidelity and faithfulness. It is achieved through perseverance. There is not a warrior here that would have survived if you had not warned them of the traps in Goro's lair. Your family has been honored. Your friends honor you as well. For the moment, you have earned rest. Enjoy the peace you will find walking these grounds.
to our world. Even their blood and rotting bones are like an acid to this realm. You must send them back to where they came from. Defend the Academy! Keep them off me while I close the front gate. the Elder Gods. You are violating the rules of mortal combat, you traitor. Do you trust me? Listen to my words as you continue your exercises, for you will need to remember them later. Shang Tsung is not as defeated as we had hoped. I faced him while you fought the attacking mutants. More, I believe he now defies the Elder Gods themselves. Baraka could not have come with a legion of mutant scum had Shang Tsung not been aiding him. With his defeat in the Mortal Kombat Tournament, he will be anxious to prove himself superior to you and take his vengeance. This will make him reckless and more dangerous than ever. I had hoped you would have time to heal your wounds in the tournament, but I was gravely mistaken. You must go to Outworld. We must take the battle there if we are to save Earth. I am weary after the tournament. But rest is a luxury afforded only to the dead. Of course I will go to Outworld. And what of you, Kung Lao? What do you say? Of course.
Take the portal to Outworld. The portal to Outworld. There may be a warning. Warning? All magic carries warnings, Kong Lao. We must be cautious. But isn't this Shang Tsung's magic? How can we trust his warnings? I know how Shang Tsung thinks. I will not have as much power in Outworld. But here, I have the power to make the way safe. If I had let you enter before, you would have been pulled inside out. This is what I can offer you in the conflict to come. Master Raiden, if I am to die here, then it will be for the honor of my family. Very well. I believe that I will be of great assistance to Liu Kang. After all, your magics are too limited in Outworld. That is correct, Kung Lao. But I can still give you my knowledge of this place. I will try to hide my presence from Shang Tsung. I dare not attract his attention and therefore endanger yes, you. Yes, Master Raiden. And should you encounter Sonya Blade in this realm, be cautious. This place changes even the most honorable of warriors. She may no longer be a friend. Your presence here is still a mystery to Shang Tsung, but you cannot defeat him alone. There is an ally here who may be of aid to you. Her name is Kitana. Kitana? She is a native of Outworld, and a powerful ally against those who threaten Earth. Can we trust anyone who comes from this place? You said that if we... This realm was not always as you see it now. It was once a place of indescribable beauty and purity. This world was corrupted by secret evil alliances. Be careful that the same does not happen to you. You must guard your heart, sometimes even from your allies. Yes! of Shao Kahn, the eternal emperor of Outworld. And you are enemies of this realm, and therefore my enemies. Isn't she supposed to be helping us? Yeah. Ah! This is not over, mortal! She is under a holding spell. She is being controlled. You must release her from the spell and set her free.
not let me go without a fight. Ugh. Here, let me help you. Thank you. Who are you? I am Liu Kang. I come from Earthrealm. This is Kung Lao. We are here to stop Shang Tsung from attacking Earth. Shang Tsung? It is not Shang Tsung that wants Earth. Not Shang Tsung? You better take a look at this. One of them is dead. The other is only stunned. Jay? You killed her! She was my best friend and you killed her! Don't touch me! I should destroy you for killing Jade! She tried to kill us. I am sorry. You were under a spell of some sort. You were trying to kill us. Where am I? How did I get here? Maybe this one can explain. And do not look under the veil. Let me go! Explain yourself. Jade was my... Kitana's best friend! Until Jade was forced by Shao Kahn to hunt her down and bring her back to him. We were given a spell to control her. Shao Kahn? Isn't that your father? I do not blame you for this, Jade. I blame the man that forces me to call him father. The one who killed my true father and stole his throne. I blame Shao Kahn for what he did to my mother. What is it? I am remembering a lot now. Where's Reptile? Who? Reptile. If Melina is here, so is Reptile. They are inseparable. I am certain that they have both been charged with hunting me down. Wait! There is more to this than we know. Raiden would tell us if there was. You need to think more about what is happening, and less about this girl you just rescued. Master Raiden. Raiden. Kung Lao, Liu Kang. I have discovered that Shang Tsung has somehow used the Elder God's magic boundaries to make Outworld vulnerable. I do not understand. You can weaken him by winning victories against Shang Tsung's assassins. It means that your every battle here affects Shang Tsung's power directly. You must fight until one of you is victorious. It is the only way to save Earth. We will be in competition with each other, then. Shang Tsung's power will be divided between you. That will make him vulnerable and incapable of attacking Earth. Raiden, who is Shao Kahn? Where's Kitana? He is not to be concerned with. Kitana is still regaining her memory and trying to understand the effects of the magic she was cursed with. You two must concern yourselves with saving Earthrealm. Through the portals you will find more battles, more ways to weaken Shang Tsung. So what do we do? This is what Raiden was talking about. If we defeat Reptile, Shang Tsung will be that much no. weaker. I will defeat Reptile. You can watch. That is what Raiden was talking about.
This place is enormous. I'm still trying to make sense out of what Katana told us. Do you see Reptile? No. You check over there. This is very good. Master, why do you say that? You are feeding the soul tombs. This is all we hoped for. How is this going to save Earthrealm? I thought we were here to stop Shang Tsung. I... Yes, Master Raiden. Something is wrong. Yes, but I am certain Raiden will let us know when it is time. Raiden. I fear, Liu Kang, that Kung Lao, no matter how much he desires to serve his ancestors, is becoming a liability to the tournament. Master Raiden, it is this place. Evil spirits swim in the air, searching for souls to nest in. You are the Mortal Kombat champion. You will need to remember who you are if you are going to defeat Shang Tsung. The soul tombs are a source of Shang Tsung's power. You must destroy them. I can trust only you. You are the champion of Mortal Kombat. You alone are strong enough to resist the corruption of this realm. Yes, Master Raiden. Kung Lao. Trust what you know. Your ancestors will guide you. The soul tombs are the source of Shang Tsung's power. Hey! 
What purpose does suffering serve? Here it serves a terrible and awful purpose. When someone perishes here, their soul and essence are collected and trapped in a place known as the Soul Tombs. These tombs are a source of Shang Tsung's power. The Black Dragon mercenaries came to rescue their leader, Kano, but were swept up in Shang Tsung's manipulations, just like we were. Master Raiden? Shang Tsung did not have the power to defeat you in Earthrealm, but here, here he hopes to reverse your victory in mortal combat and take Earthrealm after your defeat. So Shang Tsung gets stronger every time we enter combat, and even more powerful every time we win? How do we fight that? Do we stop fighting? Stop killing? No, your journey must move forward, but there is a repository of souls that adds to Shang Tsung's strength. Go and destroy this soul tomb, and Shang Tsung will begin to lose his power. Shang Tsung! Souls aren't even worthy additions to my power. Kill them! <laughs> Hurry! We have to destroy the soul tombs! I wish Raiden would warn us. If it is not Hellbeast, it is Baraka. 
We have done just as you suggested, Master Raiden. I see. I think this place is getting to Raiden. Look! Who is... Is that me? You have failed to win the Mortal Kombat tournament. Take your place as my servant. I should have won. I was betrayed. not you. Remember what Raiden said? They are our ancestors. Raiden said triumphs and failures. I wonder what happened. <laughs> what was that all about? I do not know, but I get the feeling that this is something Raiden wanted us to see. I hope you are not telling me to trust in what I do not know again. No. We are part of an ancient mystery. That is all. I will not let you tell my father that he no longer controls me, Melina. He is a monster. Everyone he touches becomes like you. Land, to seek help from Goro. The Wasteland? Get help to do what? To kill me, you idiot. And then to kill you. Why does she hate you so much? She is my clone. As long as I am alive, it is as if she is not real. A soulless husk. If I die, my soul and identity before the man that calls me daughter will become hers. Shao Kahn has spells that will allow her to claim my very existence. Then we have to stop Melina before that can happen. I knew you were going to say that. Warriors. We are here to stop Shang Tsung. Will you help us? I'm sorry, I can't. My clan needs me, and they must know that we have been betrayed by one of our own. But know that I too am opposed to Shang Tsung and everything that is wrong in this place. Know that the enemy of your enemy is your friend. Thank you. I love doing something for nothing. Do not be a fool, Kung Lao. Nothing is done for no reason. We are here to secure freedom for Earthrealm, and for this realm as well. We you know what they say about a cold day in hell. This is it.
did you do that? Yes. Why did you do that? Sub-Zero is dead. He died after the Mortal Kombat tournament. Raiden told us Scorpion killed him. So who are you? The man you saw die was my brother. And I am not even certain he is truly dead. I came here to avenge him and believe that he may still yet live in one form or another. I've been told that if I can find some vestige of his power, I may find him. Why think everyone is an enemy? Everyone in this realm is an enemy. Even those that I once called friends and allies on Earth now hunt me and want to kill me. Why have you come to the Wasteland? To rescue his girlfriend. For the last time, she is not my girlfriend. We are here to stop Shang Tsung. There is a warrior named Kitana, an ally. She is in danger from her clone Melina and a creature known as Goro. I know of Goro. They say he cannot be beaten in combat. Still, he has not faced me. Your friend, this ally, does not stand a chance against him. I see now that I may have been wrong about you. You could have killed me, and you did not. I heard the Red Dragon Clan speak about another prisoner they had. Do you think they might have been talking about Kitana? If they have her, you will need to go further into the Wasteland and cross the Sea of Blood. The souls of those who die here are put to other purposes. The bodies are added to this Lake of Damnation. How do we cross it? There is an old boat near here. I could repair it for you. I will take you there and face Goro. Destination. The exit must be up top. We need to get there somehow. If our paths cross again, or I find Goro, I will keep my oath. You cannot help me. Go. Scorpion has escaped to the Nether Realm. Gone. Like he was never here at all. It is Goro. Wasn't so soon supposed to take care of this. Take down Goro. I am the Mortal Kombat champion. I am Earthrealm's champion. What? What? I think you had better start doing what I tell you. Do you have any idea what you are talking about? Only what Raiden should have told you a long time ago. You should not turn your back on me, Kung Lao. <laughs> nice try, Shang Tsung.
I am not so certain I want you anywhere near me. That is exactly what Shang Tsung desires. Listen, Shang Tsung is trying to turn us against each other. Back in the academy, he was impersonating me. He can morph into anyone he wants. I didn't know it was Shang Tsung at the time. I tried to warn you. And then I realized if someone could look like me, he could look like either of you two as well. So I followed you through the portal, and waited, and watched. So how long was Shang Tsung posing as Liu Kang? I think it was when we were separated while fighting Goro. I suppose that means we still have to rescue Katana. A girl? Is she hot? You will find Katana elsewhere. I have something else for Johnny Cage to do. Follow me. Shang Tsung's defeat is close, but there is one more defense you will need to stop him. You will find this key to Shang Tsung's defeat in the Nether Realm. The entry to that realm is at the portals. survive in the nether realm. I thought only evil or tainted souls could enter this realm. What do you think has happened to your souls every time you have killed while on your quest? Your souls have become tainted. You must be strong enough to not let that control you. You know, Raiden should not be able to do that. What? I thought he could not use magic in this world. Who's that? Don't take another step, or I'll stop you myself. Sub-Zero? What happened to Scorpion? I thought you were after him. I... was. Scorpion is still here, but I will not allow you to face Noob Saibot. Noob Saibot? For all we know, this could be Shang Tsung. He is trying to keep us from getting the key to save Earth. Do not worry. He does not serve Shang Tsung. He is possessed by one of the Elder Gods. There is more here than just Shang Tsung's attempt to invade Earthrealm. The gods are involved. How do you know Noob Saibot is not part of this? Because I... I think he is my brother. If you want to stop Shang Tsung, defeat Scorpion. Where is he? The Nether Realm is infinite in size, but Scorpion will find you if you are here in this realm. If your brother is possessed, how can you help him? He will most likely try to kill you again. I will find a way to free him. That could take a long time. As long as it takes. Finding Scorpion should not be as hard. He wants to kill you.
certain about Kung Lao. He seems different. Strange. Johnny Cage told me that Shang Tsung was impersonating him. Do you think he is now masquerading as Kung Lao? I had not considered that possibility. Be on your guard, that is all. There is a door that would lead you to the foundry. You must find it to defeat Shang Tsung. to do you much good here or against me it's you kung lao raiden told me you'd be here soon raiden he's been guiding me through this place i've been sent to rescue agent sonya blade sonya blade is here that's what raiden says you know him better than me how long have you been here i don't know time is different in his realm it feels like weeks and raiden has been with you the entire time pretty much he says he has little power here the best he can do is see pieces of the future and act as a guy. I have to keep going. I've been sent from Earth to rescue Sonya. I am concerned about Raiden, Liu Kang. I am not certain we can trust him. Raiden was right. This is not Kung Lao. This is Shang Tsung. This is my chance. I will not be fooled again, Shang Tsung. What? Listen to me. You are not to fight each other. Shang Tsung has deluded you. He has been tricking you into feeding him soul after soul. You have been empowering him. He has been masquerading. No! Raiden? Master? Shang Tsung? You insult me, Flea. I am Shao Kahn. I will be your death. Follow if you want to defeat Shang Tsung. Follow me if you want to die at my hands. Stop. 
big time, buddy. Who? Yeah. Who? Tougher than he looked. Thanks, guys. Yeah, thanks. Although I nearly had everything under control. It was my honor to be of help to you. Yes, it was no problem for us. But now we must go and face Shao Kahn. Listen, I wish we could stay and help, but I've got to get her back to base for treatment. You fight with honor and you care for your friends. I could not ask for more than that. Go in peace. Hey, look us up when you get back to Earth Realm. Come on, girl. Let's get you home. Girl? You're lucky I can't take you down right here. Okay, hands up. If I can't stay to help, maybe this will come in handy. What happened to Raiden? Silence! Your presence here is unwanted, uninvited. But like all who come to this realm, you serve me whether you are aware of it or not. No, we do not. Where is our master Raiden? Ah, your master. You know his voice so well, yet know him almost not at all. Your master is here. He wants to see you. He has another lesson for you. Master Raiden, the... <laughs> he is possessed. Shao Kahn is controlling him. Whatever hold Shao Kahn has on you, Master, fight it. Thank you. Thank you for serving me so well. Oh, no! again. It is only right that this victory be mine, and mine alone. We destroyed your soul tombs. You should not be this strong. Is that what your master Raiden told you to do? <laughs> oh! As I said, all within this realm serve my will, even those that seek to betray me. I do not understand. Shang Tsung impersonated your master Raiden and led you on a quest for power. The more you killed, the more powerful he became. He meant to use this power against me to become the supreme ruler of Outworld. Now. What am I to do with you? My people have spoken! And a king must, if only once every millennium or so, listen to the will of his people.
There is something in you that makes me feel like a conqueror again. Our friends! Where are our friends? You can earn their freedom. Defeat me and they will be freed. Kung Lao. Kung Lao. Liu Kang. What now, Master Raiden? Shao Kahn has been destroyed. You have brought life and prosperity, not only for Earth, but for this realm as well, my warriors. And you have freed the spirits of your ancestors from their inability to lay their lives down for each other and work together. You fought bravely, Liu Kang. Thank you, Katana. So what happens now? I will try to rebuild this realm according to my true father's wishes. I meant between us. Whoever said anything about there being an us? She's hot. And she picks Liu Kang over me? What's wrong with this picture? Hmm. <laughs> Maybe I have time to find that clone of hers somebody mentioned. Did I really free my ancestors? This was the plan of the Elder Gods, Kung Lao. This was the reason you were allowed to follow the enemy's plots. What the enemy means for evil, a greater force will always turn for good. You have freed the past and future. Well done, champion of mortal combat. Now come, it is time to return home. Forces of good and evil have been locked in eternal battle over the control of Earthrealm. Some seek to use the tournament to destroy all that is good. Others seek vengeance, power, or eternal life. Time after time, each individual threat has been vanquished, and Earthrealm has enjoyed relative peace for many years. But there is concern that Earth is once again in peril. And this time, the threat of evil has two faces. It is now known that the sorcerer Quan Chi has escaped from the Nether Realm. Since his escape, Quan Chi has unlocked the secret of the ancient Moonstone. 
discovered the ancient undefeatable army of the long forgotten Dragon King. And most disturbing of all, formed an alliance with one of our deadliest enemies, Shang Tsung. With their combined strength, they plotted to overpower the only two beings who could prevent their total domination of the two realms. The first was the Emperor of Outworld, Shao Kahn. In a false show of allegiance, they sprung their attack. They then traveled to Earthrealm by way of a mystical portal known only the sorcerers and deities. There, they confronted Earth's mightiest warrior and champion of mortal combat, Liu Kang. It has been Shang Tsung's desire to consume the soul of Earthrealm's greatest warrior. With Quan Chi's assistance, he achieved this goal. Liu Kang is dead. They have since returned to Outworld and are using the souls of conquered warriors to resurrect the Dragon King's undefeatable army. Should they succeed, they will have the means to conquer Outworld and eventually Earthrealm. They will be unstoppable. I can no longer stand idly by and watch this evil consume the world. I have relinquished my status as Elder God to return to Earth and lead you all to battle against our old adversaries. We must act now. We must stop this deadly alliance. It was not by chance that this struggle came to be. The blame falls squarely upon my shoulders for giving evil the chance it needed, and therefore fulfilling an ancient prophecy. Raiden's Earthrealm champions had failed to stop the Deadly Alliance from fully resurrecting the mummified army of the Dragon King. In the end, only Raiden himself stood between Earthrealm and total destruction. Defying the Elder God's wishes, he alone challenged Quan Chi and Shang Tsung in mortal combat, Earthrealm's last hope for freedom. fought well against the two sorcerers, and it seemed as though victory was at hand. But the combined might of Quan Chi and Shang Tsung proved to be overwhelming, even for a Thunder God. Raiden was defeated. The Deadly Alliance had won. Their victory was short-lived. As suspicion and lust for power overcame both Quan Chi and Shang Tsung, the former allies turned on each other. The deadly alliance was no more. Quan 
Shang Chi defeated Shang Tsung and reveled in his conquest. But it is said that there is only one true ruler of Outworld. And that ruler had returned. Sacrifice was in vain, for the blast had little effect on the Dragon King. Now Onaga has what he needs to shape the realms as he sees fit. I was the fool who brought him this power. Only I can destroy this threat, born of deception. Shang Tsung, I will win the Mortal Kombat Tournament and free Earthrealm from your tyranny. Is that so? Then it seems I will need a stronger opponent to defeat the great Kung Lao. Goro, fight! <laughs> Shujinko, the one Master Bo Raicho mentioned. I've seen you around before. You and your friends are always pretending to be famous warriors in that park over there. My name is Apa. Master Bo Raicho asked me to show you the other schools where he teaches martial arts. Follow me. Here it is. This is another of Master Bo Raicho's classrooms. I think he's starting another lesson right now. You should go inside. I will wait for you out here. You are finished. Come on, let's go to the next class. Here it is. Master Bo Raicho says you are interested in becoming a real warrior. If you are going to be the best, you will have to train hard. It is not easy, but it is worth it. Go inside to watch the next lesson. I will wait for you.
great job. You are getting good at this. Now follow me. Move along. This bridge is off limits. The next class is beyond this bridge. We need to pay the toll to get across, but I have no money. We must find some other means to pay the guard. You are right. The guard of the bridge must be hungry. Please take this ham to him. Ham. I love ham. Thank you very much. I do not know what you said to the guard, but it worked. He is gone now and we can cross the bridge. Let us go to the next lesson. Here we are. As usual, I will wait outside. I've already learned these lessons anyway. You are halfway done. Just one more training room before the main school. The bridge is clear now. Follow me. Whew. I'm getting tired. Go on inside. I will still be waiting for you out here. You're back. Now let's try a few more advanced maneuvers. Follow me. Last stop. The Earthrealm Academy of Martial Arts. Most of us call it fight school. This is where students learn the more advanced techniques. Some of the best warriors in Earthrealm have studied here. I am training in Tai Chi these days, but I hope to learn many more fighting skills. Someday, I want to be the greatest warrior in Earthrealm. I will show the real Shang Tsung who is the best and kick him all the way back to Outworld. Anyway, I have to go to class now, but I will see you later. I hope you decide to join our school. Bye! I am sorry, Shujinko, but I cannot let you pass these gates. Why not? The walls of this town are here for a reason. To protect the citizens from foreign dangers. You are too young and inexperienced to venture outside. Return when you can prove to me that you have learned enough and I may let you pass. Yes, Master Boraicho. I will continue my training. Greetings, Shijinko. Who? What are you? Do not be afraid. I am Damashi. I am an emissary of the Elder Gods. The Elder Gods? Yes. They are the power that made this world possible, as well as many others. I have come to you on their behalf because they need your help. What kind of help do gods need? The Elder Gods are in need of a champion. One who could complete a quest to save the realms. Shujiko, will you accept this quest to save all that exists? You will be a true hero. What if I refuse? Then I will find another. One of your friends, perhaps. The one who pretends to be Shang Tsung. No, not him. I will be your champion. What must I do? You must traverse the realms in search of items of great importance. But Master Bo Raicho will not let me outside the walls of the town. Not to worry, Shijinko. I will bestow upon you a great power. The ability to absorb the fighting skills from any fighter you encounter. This will give you the edge you will need on your quest. Go now. Return to Master Bo Raicho and show him you are an experienced fighter. I will, Damashi. Thank you. I will not let the Elder Gods down. Back so soon? I thought you had returned to the school. I am ready to prove that my combat skills are good enough. Oh, very well, Shujinko. Show me. Shujinko wins. Flawless victory. Thank you, Master Bo Raicho. You show great potential. I... I would very much like to train you myself. 
Perhaps I can mold you into the next great defender of Earthrealm. Train me personally? I would be honored. But first I have tasks to complete outside the gate. Not a problem. I train all my advanced students at my home down the road. Meet me there later and we will resume your training. I will see you there. Goodbye, Master Boraicho. Goodbye, Shujinko. Shujinko, I see you have passed your test. Yes, Damashi. The power you gave me to copy other warriors worked well. I really felt as if I could fight like Master Boraicho. He was so impressed that he offered to train me personally. Excellent. There is much you can learn from him. But first, you should begin your quest. You must find six items of great importance. The Kamido. Think of them as tools of the gods. There is an impending doom that threatens the survival of all the realms. With these tools, the Elder Gods will vanquish this menace. Where do I find these? Kami Dogu. They have been scattered throughout reality. Each one lies hidden in a different realm. The Elder Gods are unable to retrieve these items themselves, and therefore must elect a champion born within the realms to collect them. They have constructed portals and the Nexus to aid their champion in his quest. Once you have found the first Kami Dogu, I will show you what to do. Until then, good luck with your search. Thank you, Damashi. Greetings, Shujinko. It is good to see you again. As promised, I will now impart to you my most powerful techniques. I am honored, Master Boraicho. I train my most promising students here at my home, away from prying eyes, to assure that my secrets are known only to those I trust. Now, let us begin your training. Congratulations, Shujinko. You have completed your training. It has always amazed me how quickly you learn. You have excelled far beyond my other students these past five years. It is as if you have been granted a gift by the Elder Gods themselves. <laughs> I'm grateful for your kind words, Master. And I am grateful for all that you have taught me. You have learned much as my pupil. But my training can only take you so far. Experience is the ultimate teacher. To further your training, you must venture into the world. Through your journeys in this realm and others, you will attain enlightenment. May I suggest, for your first adventure, that you help me find my warrior's medallion. I seem to have lost it. Very well, Master. I will help search for your medallion. May I ask where you saw it last? I seem to recall having it a few nights ago at the docks. Perhaps you can begin your search there. I will stay here and look around the house. Farewell, Shuchinko, and good luck. Farewell, Master Boraicho. This must be the dock that Master Boraicho mentioned. I should ask if anyone here knows what happened to the medallion. Excuse me, but have you seen Master Boraicho's warrior's medallion? He says he last remembers having it somewhere around here. Oh yes, he left it here a few nights ago when we were drinking Outworld wine on the dock. I put it in my waterhouse for safekeeping, but some brigands attacked me and stole the tackle box in which I kept my key. Attacking an unarmed fisherman? What cowards. Is there anything I can do to help? If you could get my key back from the brigands, I could get you the medallion. They usually do not stray far from the beach. I will return with your key, fisherman, and these brigands will know the fist of Shujinko. I thank you, young man. Uh, who is Shujinko? Would you happen to have seen the old fisherman's tackle box? That old fossil? Perhaps he should keep a tighter hold on his possessions. Wait, do you admit to taking it? What business is it of yours? The only way he will get his tackle box back is if he can take it back. 
He is much too old and weak to do that. Keep to your own affairs and you will live a lot longer. I have returned with your key. The brigands will not likely harass you further. Splendid, young man. Come inside and you will find the medallion. Thank you, young man. When you see Bo Raicho, tell him I will drink him under the table when next we meet. <laughs> Shichinko. It has been five years since you began your quest for the Kamido. Have you made any progress? I am afraid not, Damashi. But I have learned Master Boraicho's fighting styles, and I have recovered his lost warrior's medallion. I was on my way to return it to him. I see. That is quite an impressive artifact. I suggest you keep the medallion for yourself. Do not return it to Boraicho just yet. Such an item will give you credibility among master warriors. I will do as you ask. Good, very good. I must leave you now, but you will see me again. Good luck on your journey. Stop, infidel! Only great warriors are allowed to enter the Lin Kuei Temple. I am a great warrior. I have been personally trained by Master Baraicho and have been awarded the Warrior's Medallion to prove warrior's it. Warrior's Medallion? You are truly worthy of the Lin Kuei. We could use a warrior with your ability. Step inside and you will be trained to fight as a Lin Kuei. Your teacher will be none other than Sub-Zero himself. You have finished your training. You are now a Lin Kuei warrior. For your first assignment, the Grand Master has commanded that you join our forces to the West. They have reported finding an unknown artifact that may greatly benefit our clan. We must secure it before our rivals do. Your password is Ice Dragon. Go now. Do not return until you have succeeded in securing the artifact. As you command. I wonder where I am supposed to meet these Lin Kuei. It must be somewhere right around here. Halt! What is the password? Ice Dragon. Excellent. You must be the courier we had sent for, and a new recruit if I am not mistaken. You are just in time. There are Red Dragon not far from here, and they know we have this item. Take it to the Lin Kuei Temple. We will distract the Red Dragon to aid your departure. I will leave at once. Damashi, I have joined the Lin Kuei. I have learned Sub-Zero's fu- That object you carry. Yes, it is as I suspected. Through the ignorance of the Lin Kuei, you have acquired the Earthrealm Kamidoru. I have? You must find the portal to the Nexus. When it opens, walk through to continue your quest. But the Lin Kuei- Must I remind you that your loyalties are to the Elder Gods, not to the Lin Kuei. Continue with your appointed quest. Yes, Damashi. I understand. Shujiko, raise high the Kamidogu. Place. This is the Nexus, constructed by the Elder Gods to aid their champion on his quest to save the realms. To aid me? These portals lead to each of the realm that conceals a Kamidogu. Each time you recover a Kamidogu, you must return it to the Nexus and place it on that altar. 
Doing so will unlock the portal to the next realm for you to search. Which portal will open first? Place the Earth Realm Kamidoru on the altar and you will know. It would seem that the Elder Gods wish for their champion to search the Nether Realm next. I must warn you, it is a dark and evil place. I will be on my guard. This place, it feels dark. As dark as every heart that inhabits it. Normally, your presence here would not be possible. Only evil resides in the Nether. So how is it that I am here? Perhaps your time with the Vim Kuei has left a small stain of corruption on your soul. Corruption? But you must not dwell on that. What is important is your quest. Most likely, the Netherrealm Kamidoro will not be found within the walls of this city. You must venture deep into these wretched plains of hell if you are to recover it. This is not going to be pleasant, but I will complete my task. I am Shujinko. Pardon my intrusion, but you do not look like a demon of the Netherrealm. I am Ashra. I was once like the others before I found the means to purge myself of the evil taint that permeates all who reside here. By slaying demons with an enchanted sword, I will gradually transform into a being whom this realm cannot contain. Eventually, I will be free. And how is it you exist in this place? You do not seem to belong here yourself. I am from Earthrealm. I see. Be warned, Shujinko. The Netherrealm is quite hostile to outsiders. If you are to survive against its denizens, you will need special skills. I offer to train you in the art of combat that will be most effective here. I accept your most gracious offer, Ashra. Then let your training begin! I have now shown you the techniques for fighting the demons of this place, Shujinko. May this knowledge serve you well. Thank you, Ashra. I believe I am ready to brave the depths of the Netherrealm. Perhaps a test is in order. Meet me at the temple outside of town. I will find you a suitable opponent. We will see if you have indeed learned all I have taught you. I look forward to this chance to test myself. So this is the demon known as Ashra. Your notoriety extends as far as Outworld. Many of Shao Kahn's Netherrealm allies have fallen to your blade. Thus, he has sent an assassin to deal with you. Yes, I am aware of the demon known as Ermac. I welcome his arrival. Until then, you will serve as combat practice. That Tarkatan was not a pure demon, but a mutated hybrid of demon and mortal races. There was not much to gain from his death. Were I to defeat the powerful demon Ermac, however, I would surely ascend from this place much sooner. If while on your quest you should encounter him, lead him to me. It is here that I am most powerful. If I see him, I will do as you ask. What manner of beast are you? I am no beast. I am Shujinko from Earthrealm, and I am in search of a powerful demon. I have an acquaintance who wants to deal with him. As commanded by the Emperor Shao Kahn, we search for a powerful demon as well. But we are bound together by sorcery, and the lower planes of this realm drain magical power. Our bond, our strength, is fading. We fear that we will not have the strength to destroy our enemy. Why do you say we and our? We will explain later if you help us. There is not much time. I will most certainly help you. What must I do? Help us find a soul stone. A large red monolith covered with ancient runes. We can replenish the magic power that binds our souls together and continue our trek. Do this for us and we will reveal to you our knowledge of combat as payment. I will search for the soul stone. This appears to be the soul stone that warrior mentioned. 
I must inform him of its location. Greetings! I have found the Soul Stone. It is to the east, not far from here. We must go there immediately. Come, we will reward you once we have regained our strength. Yes, this is it. A Soul Stone. We can feel our strength returning. What exactly is a Soul Stone? Many ages ago, the first sorcerers toiled for the Elder Gods, linking the realms with portals. The lower planes of the Nether Realm are quite hazardous to beings of magic. Beneath inhospitable places, they erected soul stones, which restored their energies as they worked. Why did the sorcerers build the portals for the Elder Gods? They were built as a defense from some unforeseen cataclysm. We do not concern ourselves with such myths, however. Now we will honor our promise and impart to you our combat knowledge. Prepare yourself, as the power of Ermac is revealed. Ermac, the demon you seek, does it have a name? Her name is Ashra. She has slain many of Shao Kahn's Netherrealm allies. For this, he has commanded us to destroy her. Interesting. She is looking for you as well. She believes you are a demon and will combat you to purify her soul. Her misconceptions are of no importance. You must reveal to us her location. She is near a temple to the northwest. She is waiting for you. Then we must leave at once. At last, I will defeat the demon Ermac. Your death will bring me closer to purification and ultimately my release from this realm. We are no demon. Surely you can sense that we are not of your kind. Nonetheless, there must be some evil residing within you, or you could not have entered the Nether Realm. Enough! You have killed many of Shao Kahn's allies in your quest to purify your soul. You will pay for your insolence. Is this the sum of your might, Ashra? It will take much more to defeat us! And more you shall receive! Damashi! Damashi, where are you? Who dare summon me to this? Oh, Sh Shujiko. It has been many years since last we met. Why have I not seen you in so long a time? I take precautions to avoid this place. It drains me. If my avatar were to stay here for too long, or descend too far into the lower plains. I could be trapped here forever. Your avatar? I do not understand. I am without a physical body and am only able to appear to you by extending my spirit into the realms. It is my hope that I will one day return to the physical world. Until then, I must guide you as a simple apparition. And how goes your search? I have found the Nether Realm Kamidogu. So it seems. Well done, Shujiko. Return to the Nexus and place the Kamidoku on the altar. Champion, stand down. You leave me no choice. Prepare to be destroyed. Yes, Damashi. 
I am unharmed. Who was that warrior in the Nexus? I am not entirely sure. I could sense that he was quite powerful, but I did not recognize him. He referred to himself as the Elder God's chosen warrior. Does he think he is their champion? If he thinks this, then he is mistaken. As I have said before, you are their champion. You must continue your search in this realm, the realm of chaos. Chaos? The nature of this realm is one of constant turmoil. The beings here oppose order and structure. Chaos is their religion. You there! Stop where you are! You must fight if you are to enter the realm of chaos. May I challenge the Infiltrator? I have been endowed with powers from the Elder Gods themselves. I may be able to drive him off for you. I admire your fighting spirit. You are most welcome to confront him. Are you the Netherrealm Wraith who haunts this holy site? Another fool has come to challenge me. So be it. As I told the others, I have taken this patch of dead terrain for the Brotherhood of Shadow. We shall see, Spawn of Hell. Black wins. You have two choices, stranger. State your intentions, or hear the shattering of your spine. I wander in search of holy relics, madman. Do not block my path. Ah, a wanderer, eh? I am Havoc, a cleric of chaos. I would never think of confining a spirit such as yours. Thank you, Havoc. I am Shujinko. I am a newcomer to the realm of chaos. There are many newcomers as of late. Satan guards men, for instance. They seek to restrict the flow of our water. Something we hold is sacred. Water was not meant to be controlled. Its shapeless, fluidic nature is a blessing. I make you an offer, Shujinko. Take these four Chaos Pendants. Defeat each of the four Satan invaders and place a pendant around their necks. The pendants will shatter the bondage of order and reveal to them the perfection of Chaos. Only then will they cease the enslavement of our water. Do this for me, and I will teach you the ways of chaos as well. Who are these Satan Guardsmen? They are soldiers of an oppressive realm that have come to impose their order. They seek to control and alter our water supply for their own ends. Their presence here is offensive. I will do as you request. Only if it suits you at the time. I would not have it any other way. May chaos break the rules that bind my friend. You do not appear to be a Sadon. Did Havoc send you? Yes. He has asked that I defeat these intruders and place these pendants around their necks. I have been trying to sabotage this facility, but thus far the invaders have foiled my plans. If you could reduce their numbers, I would have an easier time crippling their pumps. I will try. Where are they now? There is an invader in each of the four corners of the facility. I will meet you here when I am finished dealing with them. These premises are off limits. You have done it! You have converted the Satan Guardsmen to the ways of chaos! Havoc will be most pleased! He waits for you in the town to the south. You have converted the Satan Guardsmen to the ways of chaos. 
They shut down their facilities and came here for guidance. I proposed to them a mission in their home of Satan, the realm of order. They have already embarked on the quest. I thank you for your assistance. You said you would show me the way of chaos if I were to free their minds. As if I would honor a deal? You should know better than to bind a man of chaos to his word. I will free myself of this oppression. Fight! Well done. Well done? You tried to kill me! Nonsense. How could I teach you the way of chaos if there was an agreement, a structure to the lesson? Oh, I think I understand. I was learning from the unpredictable nature of experience, not from a structured tutorial. I did not realize you had no intentions of harming me when you attacked, and therefore I learned to adapt to what I perceived to be a real threat. You are correct, except I would have killed you if you had given me the chance. I was quite serious. Because you have survived my assault, however, I give you this key to an ancient labyrinth. May it unleash chaos upon your journey. <laughs> Yes, I found it in a labyrinth not far from here, but I feel strange. I feel like I have changed. Indeed, you have. Many years have passed since you first entered this realm. I suspect the labyrinth you encountered contains some time-altering agent. Time has passed, but you have not perceived it. Many years? By the gods. I do feel older. It must have been that strange liquid I stepped through. That is a distinct possibility. It matters not. You should return to the Nexus and place it on the altar. You have done well, Shujiko. The Elder Gods will be pleased. about this realm. This is the domain of the Emperor Shao Kahn. Emperor indeed. He is a thief, a deceiver. He is not the rightful lord of this realm. There was a time when he was much like Raiden is to your Earth realm, an advisor, but he abandoned his position and stole Outworld for himself. Who ruled Outworld before Shao Kahn? A powerful military commander, Onaga, the Dragon King. In that age, Outworld was unified. Under Shao Kahn's rule, however, Outworld has become a dangerous and chaotic place. Be wary as you continue with your quest. I will keep my eyes open, Damashi. Look at what we have here! Another straggler for Melina to sink her teeth into! I do not wish for trouble, but I will defend myself if necessary. I must warn you that I am quite skilled in the art of combat. Is that so? We will see how long you can endure my attacks. I will sharpen my teeth with your bones! Impressive! You survived my assault! You are a great warrior. There is much we can gain from one as skilled as you. I thank you for your kind words, Melina. Perhaps you would be interested in assisting our cause. 
Recently, the walled city of Lei Chen has defied the rule of the Emperor Shao Kahn. He has sent us, his Tarkatan forces, to take the head of the overlord there. We would like to complete our objective without incident, but we will use force if necessary. Would you act as our voice and convince this fool of an overlord to surrender his life to Shao Kahn so that his subjects will be spared? What if the overlord refuses to surrender? Everyone in the city will be slain. The city walls are strong, but they will not hinder our assault for long. This is a most uncomfortable position for me. But if it means the citizens will be spared, I will see what I can do. You have our word. Bring us the head of the Overlord and we will spare them all. Are you the ruler of this city? Yes, I am Overlord Zafiro. State your business. Shao Kahn has sent his Tarkatan horde to attack my city. That is precisely why I am here. I have come to you with a message from the Tarkatan forces outside your walls. You have my attention. Go on. Shao Kahn has offered your people amnesty. Under one condition. You must surrender your head. My head? Unacceptable. I will never surrender myself to Shao Kahn. Not even to save my people. The Tarkata grow in number outside the walls of your city. It is only a matter of time before they overwhelm your military and destroy you all. For the sake of your people, I strongly... There may be another solution. If word of our struggle were to reach Sado, the realm of order, their elite guardsmen may give us aid. If I can find that realm, I will tell them of your plight. Excellent. You will need something of value to offer as payment. My city has been overtaxed by Shao Kahn and therefore I have nothing suitable here. But. There are rumors of a priceless object hidden somewhere in the living forest. If you can locate it, give it as payment to the Saden for their assistance. Please do not delay. Not to fear. I will bring help. Who are you? What are you doing in the living forest? I have been sent here to search for a valuable item said to be hidden in this area. You are too late. I have already found it. My queen sent me to secure it from the tyrant Shao Kahn. It seems I have located it just in time. Die, Outworld Mutant! I did not realize it was the Kamidoku. The overlord of Lei Chen had asked me to offer it to the Seiden Guardsmen as payment for their assistance in defending against the Tarkatan hordes. It belongs to the Elder Gods and must be returned to them. You will place it on the altar with the others. But I have given my word that I would bring back help from the Realm of Order. How will I broker a deal with them if I cannot offer the Kamidoku? The point is moot. You cannot enter the Realm of Order without placing this Kamidoku on the altar. If indeed you wish to aid the Overlord, I suggest you offer the command of this city to the Satan Militia. Their principal philosophy is one of order and control. They will have little interest in defending a city unless they occupy it. Furthermore, they will not resist the chance to thwart Shao Kahn. But the Overlord did not give me the authority to... What he wants is of no concern to us. The Kamidoku is not his to use as a bargaining chip. Broker a deal with the Sade that you feel so compelled, but do not lose sight of your primary objective. Return the Outworld Kamidoku to its rightful place in the Nexus, and continue with your quest. I will do as you ask, Damashi. Tread carefully for the 
the Satan Guard enforces the law without mercy. But I am new to this place. How am I to abide by their laws if I do not know them? This civilization has been built upon the concept of structure and organization. Deviation from this ideal is not tolerated. I cannot stress enough that you must avoid any entanglements in their legal system. I believe the likelihood of that happening is small, but I will heed your warning, Dimash. Please excuse my interruption, but I am Shujinko, champion of the Elder Gods. I bring a message from the King of Lei Chen requesting the aid of your guardsmen in Outworld. I am quite busy, champion. Get to your point. Lei Chen is under siege and in need of reinforcements to help defend it. Overlord Zephyro has offered to give control of his city to your realm if your guardsmen come to Outworld and defeat Shao Kahn's invading horde. Shao Kahn? Long have we battled against his minions. It would benefit all the realms to further suppress his advance. I am Commander Hotaru. I would pledge my aid to the Outworld city, but I still have work to do here. Help me end this riot by defeating the leader of the Resistance, and I will defend this Overlord. I would think a champion of the gods could end this uprising with ease. I will assist you however I can. Excellent. We will first need to train you to be a Satan Guardsman, for you may not partake in an assault unless you are a deputized member of the Guard. That is our law. Then let us begin my training. Follow me. Congratulations. You are now an honorary member of the Satan Guardsmen. Go now and defeat the leader of the Resistance. His name is Darius. When you have completed this task, meet me here. As you command. Are you the warrior known as Darius? And what if I am? If you are the leader of the Resistance, I have been ordered to defeat you in combat and bring this riot under control. You have found your man. I am Darius. I look forward to resisting arrest. defeated Darius, Commander Hotaru. Well done. It seems the rioters have been demoralized. Your service is no longer required. As promised, I will now depart for the city of Lei Chen in Outworld. Thank you, Hotaru. I will meet you there. Jinko, you have returned. It is good to see you again, Hotaru. It seems the city is no longer under siege. I drove off the invaders. They will most likely regroup and resume their assault, but I will stay to protect the city as long as is needed. I have taken control of this city in the name of order, as we agreed. However, King Zephyro seemed not to recall that arrangement. Men often do not recall the details of bargains they make out of desperation. It makes no difference. The agreement is binding. As punishment for his forgetfulness, I have stripped him of his position. I now rule this town in the name of Sado. Uh, congratulations, Hotaru. Now, if you will excuse me, I must see to its governing if I am to keep this town under control. Come with us, human. Do not resist. You are outnumbered. This is the Overlord's emissary, the one who brought the Satan warrior Hotaru to defend the walled city of Lei Chen. I have lost many Tarkatan warriors to your treachery, human. You were to convince the Overlord to surrender, not bring him reinforcements. He would not surrender. I did not wish to see his people suffer for his decision. Whatever quarrel you may have had with Overlord Zephyro, you had no right to punish them as well. Shao Kahn's order is all the right I need. Overlord Zafiro defied him. When Shao Kahn discovers that our assault has failed, our punishment will be severe. I should allow my whore to rip you to pieces. Yes, allow your soldiers to do what you are too frightened to do yourself. What? I am Baraka, 
leader of the Takata. I fear no one, least of all a human. Then face me in combat. If you are so sure of your strength, kill me yourself. But if I emerge victorious, you must complete one task for me. <laughs> Agreed. My warriors will enjoy eating your flesh when I am done with you. You have defeated me, human. I would not have thought it possible. Tell me what I must do. And tell me quickly before I change my mind. You are a powerful warrior, Baraka. I ask that you teach me your fighting techniques. A great warrior I am, human. I will show you why I am the most feared Tarkatan in the Shao Kahn's army. Enough! I have shown you enough of my combat skills. I must keep some techniques to myself. I thank you for what you have shown me. I will command my troops to allow you safe passage from our encampment. Go back to your portal and never return to this realm. Yes, I will leave this realm at once. There is nothing more that I need here. I was about to continue my eternal quest, but I cannot remember what it is. A spell has taken my memory. Please find me a potion to restore it. Holy men ambushed me and forced me to guard a dragon egg. But the dragon has been reborn, and I am now free. Please find a potion to restore my memory. Shujiko, I bring the tidings. What do you mean, Damashi? You have sacrificed much in your service to the Elder Gods these long years. Therefore, they are granting you that which you have desired since your childhood. A chance to compete in the Mortal Kombat tournament in Earthrealm and defeat the Sorcerer Shang Tsung. I do not know what to say. How did they know of my dreams of defeating Shang Tsung? Long ago, I watched you from afar as you played with your childhood friends. It was quite clear that you worshipped the warrior Kung Lao. But unlike your hero, you will be more than a match for Shang Tsung. You have absorbed the fighting styles of many great warriors. Now is your chance to fulfill your dream. Thank you, Damashi. I will return to Earthrealm at once. Please excuse my curiosity, but why do you cover your eyes? Are you blind? Yes, due to the treachery of the sorcerer Shang Tsung. You have met Shang Tsung? He preyed upon my desire to prove my superiority in combat. He promised to show me the location of a powerful sword that would complement my skills. The sword was entombed among the souls of my warrior ancestors. Shang Tsung consumed their souls to increase his power. The experience left me blinded. Is the sword from your tail the one you now carry? Yes. The sword guides me. Over the years it has shown me the way to use my other senses in combat. Most impressive. You are truly a warrior of distinction. Now I have but one goal. To slay the sorcerer who blinded me. Doing so will free the consumed souls of my ancestors. If you provide me with his location, I will teach you to fight without your eyes. I am to enter his Mortal Kombat tournament. When I find him, I will return to you with any information I uncover. My search for Shang Tsung will continue here in the north. I suggest you look in the southwest. This is sacred ground, stranger. I am Nightwolf. I must ask you to leave this place before your evil taint defiles the sanctity of these grounds. I do not understand. I am Shu Jinko. I assure you that I mean no disrespect to your people. I sense corruption in your soul, Shu Jinko. A spiritual contamination that I have never before perceived. I feel no touch of evil, but my travels have taken me to many worlds. Perhaps it is a result of my journeys in the Nether Realm. It is possible. If you will allow me, I may be able to purge this contagion from your being, although it will take many years to accomplish. Many years? It will delay my quest, but I suppose I should take advantage of your offer.
have accomplished much since beginning your spiritual cleansing, Shujenko. Though the taint of evil continues its hold on you, my training has given you the ability to control it. I am grateful for what you have done for me, Nightwolf. I wish you luck on your journeys. You are always welcome in the lands of my forefathers. Greetings, stranger. I search for experienced fighters to take part in a competition. Do you know of any? I am quite adept at many fighting styles. Who are you? What is this contest you speak of? Shang Tsung? Long have I heard tales of your foul deeds. I am Shu Jinko. Since I was a boy, I have dreamed of winning the Mortal Kombat tournament and ridding Earthrealm of your tyranny. Is that so? Then it seems I will have to test the great Shu Jinko. You are most welcome to compete, but only if you can prove that you are worthy of such an honor. Fight! Night Wolf wins! Most impressive, Shu Jinko. You are indeed worthy to compete in the Mortal Kombat Tournament. I will enjoy consuming your soul when you lose. I do not think so. It has been my greatest desire to win Earthrealm's freedom from you and your master, Shao Kahn. Of course, I am not the only one who seeks your defeat. I request that an acquaintance of mine be allowed to compete as well. He too longs to challenge you. <laughs> Would this acquaintance of yours be the blind swordsman Kenshi? He has been searching for me for quite some time, has he not? You know? There is little in this realm that escapes my attention, though I must admit I was surprised to learn that he had survived our previous encounter. Return to him and inform him that he is welcome to face me on my island in the Lost Sea. The tournament is fast approaching, however. He must hurry if he wishes to fulfill his quest for revenge. Shujenko, it has been many years since last we met. Although I have sensed Shang Tsung's presence on many occasions, I have not been able to locate him. I have found him, Kenshi. He has invited us both to his island to face him in mortal combat. He has been watching you. He knew that you were searching for him. I had suspected as much. This explains why I have never been able to find him. He was always one step ahead of me. I thank you for bringing me this news. I will now teach you to do battle without the use of your eyes. Now that I have fulfilled my promise, I must leave for Shang Tsung's island. I only hope he has not been defeated before I arrive. Indeed, you have a long-standing vendetta with Shang Tsung. But I have dreamed of entering the Mortal Kombat tournament since I was young. You will have to wait your turn, my friend. If he is still alive when I am finished with him, you may take your revenge. We will see, Shujinko. I will meet you on the island. Shujinko, I return to you because I sense that some change has taken place. You are different in some way. I have undergone a spiritual cleansing. The warrior Nightwolf had detected an evil stain upon my soul. He was unable to remove it completely, but he has given me the ability to suppress it. This is an unfortunate turn of events. Unfortunate? An evil stain has been cleansed from my soul. My sense of awareness is as heightened as it was when Master Bo Raicho trained me. The taint you refer to allows you to enter realms otherwise inaccessible to other beings. You will need to regain it in order to continue your quest. I suggest that you return to the Nether Realm. It will restore the impurities needed enter the more accursed realms. Once your quest is finished, you are free to cleanse your spirit once more. I cannot believe that you would ask such a thing of me. Surely the contamination I am already forced to carry is enough to access- Do not question my order, Shujiko. I never promised your quest would be pleasant. You must fulfill your obligation to the Elder Gods. Return to the Nether Have you forgotten the Mortal Kombat Tournament? I was on my way to Shang Tsung's island to compete. I understand your disappointment, but your dream of defeating Shang Tsung will have to wait. 
For now, you must fulfill your destiny. I... I will do as you ask. Be gone. This portal is not for use by mortals. Who are you? I am the Thunder God, Raiden. This ancient portal has been activated. I must secure it to prevent intrusion from other realms. Lord Raiden, I am Shujinko. I am the champion of the Elder Gods. It was I who opened the portal. Champion, you say? I think not. A champion of the Elder Gods would possess the might of ten warriors and could fight with his eyes closed. It is highly unlikely that you possess such abilities. You seem to possess much strength and skill, Shujinko. Forgive me for doubting you, but if the Elder Gods have indeed unleashed their champion, they must be concerned that the end of the realms is near. Your presence might be connected with the Mortal Kombat tournament here in Earthrealm. Have you come to aid us? I did come to fight for Earthrealm in the tournament, but I have recently been ordered to the Netherrealm. I am sure the Elder Gods have their reasons for redirecting you at so crucial a time. It may be that the Shaolin have already chosen their representative. In any event, I will keep a close watch over the tournament's proceedings. Shang Tsung is a treacherous sorcerer. If he wins this time, Earthrealm will belong to Shao Kahn. If you need my aid when I am finished with my task in the Netherrealm, search for me. I will gladly assist you. Thank you, Shujinko. Good luck. Unless you have knowledge of the sorcerer Quan Chi's whereabouts, do not waste my time, stranger. I have no knowledge of this Quan Chi, but I may be able to help you find him. I am Shu Jinko. I have explored this realm before and have become quite familiar with it. I have returned to the Nether Realm once again to absorb its impurities. I will likely be wandering these wastes for some time to come. If I discover this Quan Chi, I will relay to you what information I can, for a price. It would seem that you have already regained some of the Netherrealm's dark taint. What price do you ask? You are obviously quite powerful in this realm. If I were to learn your combat skills, perhaps I would absorb enough negative energy to lessen my time here. Teaching you the dark rage that has consumed me since my death will only serve to delay my vengeance upon Quan Chi. I refuse your offer. Delay you it will but you will also gain an ally to aid your search. You will likely find Quan Chi sooner if I search with you. Your argument has merit. Very well. I will teach you my combat skills. I warn you, however, the rage of Scorpion burns deeply. I did not realize that such all-consuming hatred was possible. Quan Chi killed my family and clan, and then deceived me into believing Sub-Zero was their murderer. I have been corrupted by Quan Chi's wickedness. Now it is his turn to suffer. It is a heavy burden you carry. And one that will be lifted once I have destroyed the evil sorcerer. Go now and search for Quan Chi. I will remain in the Nether Realm until he is found, Scorpion. Who are you? What do you want? I am Shujinko. I am searching for the sorcerer Quan Chi. You have found him. I do not recognize you as a brother of Shadow. Who has sent you? I sent him. Scorpion! You thought you could elude me here? In the lower reaches of the Nether Realm, my strength increases while yours fades. I will make you suffer for killing my family and clan. I will torment you forever, sorcerer! Back! 
Stay back! I command you! Come here! Did you hear that? It sounds like battle! Come, we will feast upon the loser! Shujiga, I sense you have regained enough of the essence of this realm to continue your quest. I encountered a ninja specter named Scorpion from whom I absorbed much rage. Well done. You may leave the Netherrealm. Thank you, Damashi. I do not wish to remain another moment longer. Mortal Kombat has always been, and always will be. For millennia, the forces of good and evil have been locked in eternal battle over the control of Earthrealm. Some seek to use the tournament to destroy all that is good. Others seek vengeance, power, or eternal life. Time after time, each individual threat has been vanquished, and Earthrealm has enjoyed relative peace for many years. But there is concern that Earth is once again in peril. And this time, the threat of evil has two faces. It is now known that the sorcerer Quan Chi has escaped from the Nether Realm. Since his escape, Quan Chi has unlocked the secret of the ancient Rune Stone. Discovered the ancient undefeatable army of the long forgotten Dragon King. And most disturbing of all, formed an alliance with one of our deadliest enemies, Shang Tsung. With their combined strength, they plotted to overpower the only two beings who could prevent their total domination of the two realms. The first was the Emperor of Outworld, Shao Kahn. In a false show of allegiance, they sprung their attack. They then traveled to Earthrealm by way of a mystical portal known only the sorcerers and deities. There, they confronted Earth's mightiest warrior and champion of mortal combat, Liu Kang. It has been Shang Tsung's desire to consume the soul of Earthrealm's greatest warrior. With Quan Chi's assistance, he achieved this goal. Liu Kang is dead. They have since returned to Outworld and are using the souls of conquered warriors to resurrect the Dragon King's undefeatable army. Should they succeed, they will have the means to conquer Outworld and eventually Earthrealm. They will be unstoppable. I can no longer stand idly by and watch this evil consume the world. I have relinquished my status as Elder God to return to Earth and lead you all to battle against our old adversaries. We must act now. We must stop this deadly alliance. Greetings, champion. I have need of your assistance. Raiden, whatever I can do to help you, do not hesitate to ask. My time in the Netherrealm is concluded. Shang Tsung has allied with another sorcerer, Quan Chi who has escaped from the Netherrealm. Escaped? I had just seen him there. Quan Chi possesses an item created by the Elder Gods, an amulet that acts like a key. He understands only a fraction of its potential, but enough to use it to escape from Hell. Is it a Kami Dogu? It is not a Kami Dogu, but it is connected to them by its function. I am surprised that you would not know of it. Nevertheless, I am preparing an assault on the two sorcerers in Outworld. 
Though they have already killed Earthrealm's greatest hero, Liu Kang, I am gathering together the few warriors I feel I can trust to attack this deadly alliance at their stronghold. Can I count on you to help? I will go to Outworld to assist you any way I can. Excellent. It would be good to have a champion of the Elder Gods on our side. That's far enough. Stop where you are. Is there a problem, sir? Name's Kano. By order of the sorcerers Quan Chi and Shang Tsung, all denizens of Outwear will submit to the rule of the Deadly Alliance. I am not a denizen of Outworld. I have traveled here from Earthrealm. Makes no difference. My men will take you to the town of Sundown. Quan Chi and Shang Tsung have a job for you, mate. And if I refuse? Do you really think you can combat us all? No, I suppose not. Then shut up and follow me. What's your name, anyway? I am called Shujinko. Well, Shujinko, welcome to hell. Along with all the other peons of this town, you will be constructing a palace for Shang Tsung. One that is large enough to house his army. Don't even think about trying to escape. I would hate to have to kill a villager because of your defiance. Do you get me? I... I understand. Good. Now make yourself useful. Get to work. You are not from this town. Who are you? Why have you been enslaved here? I am Shujinko. I am from Earthrealm, on a quest for the Elder Gods. I have been instructed to return to Outworld to confront a growing threat here. I seem to have found it. I am Li Mei. My village was the first conquest of the Deadly Alliance. They have enslaved my people. For this, I will kill them in due time. What is your plan of attack? The Deadly Alliance have offered to free my village if I win their combat tournament. I have accepted their challenge, but I intend to use the tournament as a way to get closer to them. I will attack when they least expect it. Bold words, young one, but perhaps a bit foolish. What makes you think you can defeat them both? I will concede that I am not ready to confront them yet, for I desperately need additional training. Perhaps I may be of some help. Over the years I have absorbed much combat skill. Then you must teach me, Shujinko. Help me to save my people from oppression. I will teach you what I can, Li Mei. But I do not approve of your intention to combat the two sorcerers alone. I believe that course of action will end in misfortune. Thank you for your training, Master Shujinko. Please accept this token of my appreciation. I thank you for the gift, Li Mei. Perhaps your confrontation with the sorcerers is not necessary. I know of someone who might help to free your village. His name is Hotaru. He once saved the walled city of Lei Chen from the Tarkatan hordes. I will journey there and ask for his assistance. If you think he can drive out the Deadly Alliance, then by all means, find this Hotaru and tell him of our plight. I will do my best to convince him to help. The guards are watching. I must not draw their attention if I am to escape your village. Goodbye, Li Mei. Hotaru! It is good to see! You have violated my ordinance. You were to go indoors when the toll sounded. Ordinance? I just recently arrived. I had no knowledge of any ordinance. Ignorance is not an excuse. I am placing you under arrest for disregarding the laws of this city. Your trial will take place in the realm of order. What is this place? Why have I been taken from my cell? You are about to enter the judicial court of the Realm of Order. You have been brought here to defend yourself against the charges brought against you by Commander Hotaru. After all these long years, justice will at last prevail. Surely I will not remain imprisoned for a law as frivolous as a curfew. I would not be as confident if I were you.
I have no desire to converse with a criminal. Am I not innocent until a court arrives at a verdict? We shall see. These were the guards I was sent to dispose of? Fah! Surely you could have slain them yourself. Why have you killed them? Who are you? I am Dairu. An associate of yours was concerned that certain obligations you have to him are not being met. I was contracted to remove any obstacles you might be facing. Tamashi, I cannot believe that he would instruct you to kill these men in order to free me. Not instructed, paid. Mercenaries do not work for free. This Tamashi offered me generous compensation to free you. Do not be so sure of your chances with the judge. I was once a soldier among their ranks until I was unjustly imprisoned. You would have been incarcerated for decades for this seemingly minor charge, I assure you. I cannot say that I approve of your actions, but I suppose a certain amount of gratitude is in order, Dairu. There is one other matter. I am to give you this key to the courtroom door. I took it from one of the guards. I will leave you now, but if you ever have need of my services, search for me in the realm of order. Just remember to bring plenty of coins. Shujinko, I am disappointed with you. Hotaru! I thought I had trained you to appreciate order, to obey the law. Now I find that you have killed two officers and have broken into a courtroom. I did not kill those men. An assassin named Dairu. Now you are consorting with known felons to free yourself. Had you simply waited for your trial, you would have no doubt been found innocent. In fact, I had come here to testify in your defense. Now it seems that you will be facing a sentence of death. If it has come to that, I have no other choice but to resist arrest. Assassin, yes. I do not understand how you could condone such an action. Are these the methods of the Elder Gods? I am not an Elder God. I am merely your guide. In any event, do not presume to judge my methods. You yourself have done many dishonorable things during your lifelong journey. To answer your question, however, the Elder Gods would not have objected to the methods applied. I may have done questionable things during my service to the Elder Gods, but I have also grown much since my quest began. I cannot believe the Elder Gods would not take exception to such brutal tactics. The Elder Gods do not directly interfere with the realms, nor do they judge the events that occur therein. Their duty is merely to assure that the realms exist. And my quest plays some part in their duty? I will not explain further. All will be revealed in time. Take the Kamidoru to the Nexus and continue your search. <sighs> yes, Dimashi. I will do as you ask. But I cannot help but feel disenchanted with the quest. Someone else? For what purpose? 
You have never fully revealed to me the true significance of the Kamidogu. After all these years of searching, I feel I am owed an explanation. <sighs> if it will serve to emphasize the importance of your quest, I will tell you what I can. The Kamidogu made possible the creation of reality. The Elder Gods used them to split the consciousness of the One Being into what we know as the Realms. I do not understand. What is this One Being? Before the creation of the Realms, there were only the Elder Gods and the One Being. The One Being fed off the Elder Gods. It consumed them. A war raged in the timeless void until six Elder Gods forged the Kamidogu and used them to splinter the One Being into the many realms. I am humbled by the scope of what you have revealed to me. Still, I am left to wonder why the Elder Gods have needed my assistance. As you know, you were called by the Elder Gods to retrieve the Kamidogu and deliver them into Seiki. What you do not know is that the Elder Gods have detected a plot whereby an individual sought to exploit the Kamido and merged all the realms in an attempt to gain ultimate power. That individual may be here in Edenia. He must not be allowed to find the Kamido. It would seem that the Kamidogu are quite powerful. Dangerous weapons in the wrong hands. I thank you for being forthright with me, Damashi. I have no doubt that you will succeed, Shichiko. You have served the Elder Gods well. You... you emerged from the portal to the gods. How can this be? I am Shujinko, champion of the Elder Gods. I am searching the realms for artifacts that will aid in the fight against evil. My quest has led me here. I am Princess Kitana. If you are the champion of the Elder Gods, perhaps you can aid us in our struggle. There was a time long ago when the Emperor Shao Kahn merged Edenia with Outworld. For millennia, he ruled the Combined Realms, until my Earthrealm allies and I won Adenia's independence. Now Shao Kahn has again invaded this realm. He has learned that a powerful device lies hidden somewhere within our borders, and may have sent his forces here to find it. Shao Kahn? He must be after the Edenian Kamidogu. This situation is worse than I had suspected. How may I be of help, Princess Katana? My mother, Queen Sindel, has been taken captive. I cannot free her myself, because I must return to Outworld to lead our forces there in a direct assault against the Emperor. Free the Queen, so that she may lead the resistance here in Edenia. Where is the Queen being held? She is imprisoned somewhere near the palace, guarded by the traitor, Tanya. You must defeat Tanya in order to release her. I will win the freedom of your Queen. Of this you can be sure. Thank you, Shujinko, and good luck. Excuse me, but I am looking for the one known as Tanya. Would you happen to know her whereabouts? I am Tanya. Do you have business with the Emperor Shao Kahn? Not exactly. I come to ask that you release Queen Sindel. She has been unjustly held captive by Shao Kahn's forces. <laughs> you are a fool, old man. I have been instructed by Shao Kahn himself to guard her with my life. You will have to get past me if you wish to free her. So be it. Shujinko wins. You are a bit old to be in Shao Kahn's military, are you not? I am Shujinko. Champion of the Elder Gods, I have come to release you at the request of your daughter, Kitana. She is currently in Outworld, confronting Shao Kahn's army. Kitana lives? You are truly the bearer of good tidings, Shujinko. Come, we must leave here now before anyone realizes that I have escaped. Follow me, and I will reward you for your efforts. I am Queen Sindel. I am grateful that you risked your life to free me. I owe you my thanks. It is an honor, your highness. Please allow me to repay your gallantry. I wish to bestow upon you the combat skills of an Adinian knight. Do you accept? Indeed, Queen Sindel. I accept. 
You are now a fully knighted Adinian soldier, Shujinko. And as such, I have a task for you. What task would that be, Your Highness? Shao Kahn seeks a powerful item, one that has been kept hidden in Adinia since before our recorded history. It must never fall into the hands of the Emperor of Outworld. Take this Kami Dogu and return it to the Elder Gods. They will know what to do with it. I will take it to them immediately. What will you do now, Your Highness? Kitana and I will continue the fight to free Adinia from the tyranny of Shao Kahn. His men will be searching for me here, but he has no knowledge of you. You have a chance to escape if you leave now. Yes, Your Highness. Good luck to you. Shujiko, I see you have found the last of the Kamidoru. Yes, Damashi. I was on my way to the Nexus to place it upon the altar. Because you have recovered all the Kamidoru, I will receive a physical body and will be free to dwell in the physical world. My rebirth is to take place soon in our world. That is wonderful news. Congratulations, Damashi. Heard. Take the Adinian Kamidoru to the Nexus. I will meet you there. It will be good to finally bring this quest to an end. After all these long years, I have finally found the last of the Kamidogo. My quest is almost at an end. What is ending is your meddling in the affairs of the Elder Gods, mortal. Scorpion! Yes, and I remember you as well. We met in the Netherrealm. I taught you my fighting skills. Now I will give you your final lesson. Fight! By what name shall I call you now? Tell me who you really are, demon. I am Onaga, the Dragon King of Outworld and soon to be ruler of all that exists. I must thank you for bringing me so much power. The Kamidogu are mine! <laughs> you may have them. They do nothing. You have wasted your time. Nothing happened when I placed them all on the altar. Not all. If you had found the last piece, the altar would have transported them to the Elder Gods. But the last piece is currently in Outworld in the possession of a fool sorcerer. I will deal with him later. For now, I will take these artifacts you have so dutifully collected for me. I am afraid they will not make it into the hands of the Elder Gods after all. And so, Shuchenko, your quest is done. Prepare for death. Have I done? 
The Dragon King now possesses the Six Kamidogu and has taken the ancient amulet from Quan Chi and Outworld. Although each item is powerful beyond mortal comprehension, individually they contain only a fraction of the power needed to create the realms. To become all-powerful, Onaga must discover a way to fuse them into a single ultimate Kamidogu. I have been a pawn in Onaga's scheme to rule all. If I am to redeem myself, I must continue to learn all that I can and prepare for this final battle against the Dragon King. My journey is far from over. There have been many powerful warriors throughout the millennia. But ages of mortal combat have begun to tear the fabric of the realms. The critical point has finally been reached. It was foreseen that combatants would one day grow too powerful and too numerous. If left unchecked, their intensifying combat would weaken and shatter the realms and bring about the apocalypse. <laughs> The gods demanded a safeguard be put in place to avoid total destruction. One that would make use of the combatants' insatiable bloodlust. Like moths to flame, they would be drawn to battle.
It is done. Taven and Dagon have been hidden. The dragons, Orin and Karo, will be at their sides. I trust they will be safe in the caves. I only hope Shao Kahn shows no interest in Earthrealm. It is unlikely. His attention seems focused only on Edenia. The pyramid is completed. You are certain the battle will take place here, Delia? I am. I have sent Blaze to monitor the realms. When the time has come, he will signal the dragons and the quest will begin. Are we doing the right thing, Argus? Your visions determine this course of action. The powerful warriors to come. The corruption of a mortal combat tournament. The chain of events you foretell will lead to a conflict that will destroy us all. These combatants must be dealt with. I am talking about Taven and Dagon. Must they be involved? Our sons are the only ones we can trust. Furthermore, they will prove their worth before the Elder Gods. They will bring honor to Adenia. And to you, if they survive. We have equipped them well, and the Monoliths will hone their skills. This must be done. Dagon and Taven will remain dormant. When they are revived, they will embark on a quest to save the realms from Armageddon. May the Elder Gods watch over them. Taven, it is good to see you have awakened. Do not worry, your strength will soon return. Orin, what happened? You were encased in stone to protect you from harm until I received the signal to awaken you. You are no longer in a Denia, Taven. You are an Earth Realm. I don't understand. Why am I an Earth Realm? Your father has a very important task here for you. Your brother, Dagon, will also be participating. It is a competition between the two of you, from what I understand. What? Competition? Last I remember, Dagon and I were summoned to Father's throne room and... And there you were both rendered unconscious. I don't know the details of this quest. I was charged only with hiding you in Earthrealm and awakening you when the time came. That time is now. No. This is all too strange. Where is my father? I wish to speak with him. I will send you to his temple. Find the main chamber and place your hand on the altar. Your father will speak to you there and present you with a weapon to use on your quest. No doubt your brother has been awakened by Carl and will be sent there shortly. Why will I need a weapon? Very well, Orin. Lead the way. No one crosses this bridge. No one. We shall see. Cobra, I just got the signal from Cabal. The ambush has begun. If you're not a member of the Black Dragon Clan, I'm gonna have to finish you. Taven wins. Taven, place your hand on the monolith. Father? Where am I? This is a training area. Father, is that you? No, Taven. I am merely a reflection of your father. My purpose is to train you for your coming challenge. Would you tell me what this is all about? You will find your answers within the temple. This monolith was created to help you hone your fighting skills. There are others like it scattered throughout the realms. They can only be activated by you or your brother. Now then, let us begin your training. Was I inside the monolith? How was that possible? Maybe Father will explain when I find him in the temple. You 
you fight well. I don't know who you are, but there is always room in the Black Dragon Clan for another ruthless warrior. I have no intention of joining you and your thugs. You will regret your decision. Fight! Strange looking warrior. At least I won't have to deal with his clan any longer. Looks like I've finally arrived at my father's temple. I didn't know he had one here in Earthrealm. I'm sure he'll explain everything once I locate him in the main chamber. What are these images supposed to represent? That looks like Mother having one of her visions. And this must be Father speaking with the Elder Gods. These sleeping figures might be my brother and I. How long was I unconscious? And what's this? It appears as if my brother and I are attacking some demon. I have no memory of that. What does all this mean? Where is everyone? It doesn't seem like anyone's worshipped here in ages. Successor as protector of the realm. I give you each a weapon of great power. You will find them on the wall behind this altar. Your mother has also left you items of great importance. You will find them in her temple to the north. What are they? What is their purpose? You must find Blaze, a fire spawn created by your mother. Use the items we have given you to defeat him. The victor will not only succeed me as protector of Adenia, but he will receive a gift worthy of a god. Go now, and may the Elder Gods watch over you. Sector to Warship, rendezvous for immediate evac. Grandmaster Sector, the prisoner is awake. Good. Now I can get the information I need. Ugh. What are you? I will ask the questions. I need to know what you learned from the altar in the temple. What message did you receive? Answer me! You are going to regret having torn Increase the power! Ah! What information did you acquire from the altar? Uh. Headmaster Sector! The ship is being attacked! Incoming fighters! Special forces! Takunin Warship, this is Sonya Blade. You are in violation of the Earthrealm Accord. Surrender immediately or risk annihilation. Remain at your post. Initiate code K0NN1H5. Affirmative. I must get up this warship before it's destroyed. I have to find some way out of this ship and back to the portal. You are not leaving until I get all the information I need, even if I have to beat it out of you. Fight! <laughs> Taven wins. Finally, I found a way out of the warship. I'll have to get back to the portal and return to the cave. Maybe Orin has some idea who these strange warriors are. I can't help but wonder if my brother Dagon has encountered the same foes I have. Welcome back, Tate. You were awake quite a long time. I was ambushed. More than once. By your father's holy men? No. His followers apparently abandoned the temple long ago. Warriors in red occupy it now. This is not right. Something is amiss. Did you learn more about the quest? Where is the weapon your father left you? 
There was no weapon. I'm assuming it was stolen long ago. As for the quest, apparently it's a race to combat a fire spawn named Blaze. Whoever defeats him will succeed Father as protector of Adenia. Yes, Blaze. He is the watcher who sounded the call to awaken you. But how can defeating him in battle grant you the title of protector? Your mother was mortal. You are only a half god. Transforming you into a full god would require. Require what? What else did you learn? I must travel to the north. Mother has left me an item in her temple. I hope it's still there. I will send you there now. Blade of the Earth Realm Special Forces. You've got some explaining to do. What are the Takunin up to? Why do you assume I have information? You have some connection with Sector. He placed a homing device on you that I've been tracking since you teleported away from the Takunin warship. First to the heart of the mountain, then to this frozen wilderness. I can follow you anywhere. Now answer me! What is Sector planning? I appreciate your assistance with the Beast, but I am afraid I cannot help you. I know nothing about Sector. You're hiding something. Comply or I'll be forced to bring you in for further questioning. I'm the son of Argus. You have no authority over me. I have full authority. have been sent by the gods. Yes, in a manner of speaking. You must help us. Our abbot has been captured by the Tengu. You must free him. I am not here to rescue anyone. I am looking for a temple. Do you know of one? A herald of the gods who searches for a temple. Only the abbot would know of such a place. He could reveal to you its location, but if he is slain by the Tengu, you may never find it. You must save him. Very well, then. Where can I find this abbot? He is being held in the Tengu encampment. That way, to the north. Thank you. I appreciate your help. Now excuse me. I am grateful that the gods would send a hero to free me. I did not come here merely to free you. I need information. I was told you knew the location of a temple. You must be referring to the temple of Delia. Return me to my fellow monks, and I will reveal its location to you. By the Elder Gods. Very well. Lead the way, old man. We are here at last. Our place of worship, the Holy Obelisk. Once again, I am humbled that the Gods would deliver me from peril. Yes, the Gods are great. Now, if you will please, direct me to the Temple. Indeed. The Temple of Delia, the Lady of Flame. Built to honor the Adenian sorceress who foresaw the great battle, legends tell that... The Please, I am in a hurry. Yeah. The temple is down this path. I thank you for your help. I wish you good fortune. Ah, I see the obelisk begins to glow with the power of my fellow monk's prayers. I only pray the Tengu did not defile it with their touch. an obelisk of your father's creation. I have empowered it to train you further in the art of combat. 
You're not really my mother, are you? No, I am not your mother. I am merely a reflection of the woman who enchanted this stone. My purpose is to aid you on your quest. Can you tell me more about this quest? Only that you will find a gift in the temple. It lies behind a wall. Place your hand in the recess to unlock the door. Your training will now begin. Stop where you are! Your dark allies may have escaped for now, but you have nowhere to hide. Kill him! Fight! Outstanding! Wait! Stop! You are free to go. Oh, I'm free to go? After I've already defeated your entire clan? How generous of you! <sighs> my sincerest apologies, warrior. When I was told that you had attacked my men near the obelisk, I assumed you were with the other two outsiders we encountered. But clearly you're human. You must be Lin Kuei. I haven't the slightest idea what you're referring to. And what is a Lin Kuei? The Lin Kuei are a rival clan of powerful warriors. You fight with such skill I mistook you for one of their ranks. We Tengu have an uneasy truce with the Lin Kuei, and we avoid their territory. They reside in an ancient temple near here. And where would this temple be? Further up this path, it is not far. But you would be wise not to venture near it. The Lin Kuei are secretive, and as inhospitable to strangers as we are. I will be ready. Thank you for the information. You are free to go. Finish him. So it is true. Delia's son has returned to claim the prize and save the realms. I figured you would eventually come to this place, Taven. You seem to know much about me, but I know nothing of you, friend. I am no friend of yours. I am Rain, a prince of Edenia. Once I have defeated you, I will find and kill your brother as well. Then I will claim the prize. Well, Prince, let us see what you can do. Taven wins. The Tengu leader was right. My mother's temple is here, but it's now occupied by a clan of ninjas known as the Lin Kuei. Locating the item she left me will not be easy. I'll have to fight my way inside. in ice. Who are you? I am Frost. Where? Sub-Zero? Uh, Sub-Zero? The medallion! Give me the medallion! You seem to be a bit delirious. Maybe you should... The Lin Kuei will be mine! Oh. Taven oh. Uh, at last, an empty room. Maybe I can rest? Think again, intruder. You may have bested my Lin Kuei warriors, but you will not get past me. Uh, and you are? I am Sub-Zero, Grand Master of the Lin Kuei, and you are trespassing! Fight! <laughs> Taven wins! <laughs> Thank you. 
Your tattoo? What about it? It resembles the dragon image on the door behind you. Who are you? And why are you here? This must be it. This must be what? This temple was a shrine to my mother before your clan commandeered it. I assure you it had been abandoned long before we arrived. I realize that. My name is Taven. I merely came here to retrieve something. A gift from my mother. Then tell me, where is this gift? Most likely behind this vault door. The door on the right was unlocked when we first arrived here years ago. There was nothing inside. The other door has remained sealed, despite our best efforts to open it. It seems my brother has already been here to retrieve his gift. Strange. That would mean he's been awake for quite some time. I assume you have a key. You could say that. You have your gift. Now tell me, for what purpose would a sorceress leave her son such a powerful set of armor? Apparently, I need it for my quest. Something important is supposed to happen once I complete it, though I do not know what that something is yet. At first, I assumed the quest was nothing more than a game, but I'm no longer certain. What do you mean? A warrior named Rain mentioned something about saving the realms, and I've also been repeatedly attacked by assassins in red. I don't recognize their crest, though it seems vaguely familiar. A dragon, I believe. Do you have any idea who they are? I may. Grandmaster! More intruders have breached the temple! The east entrance! Friends of yours? They are dark warriors, yet they resemble our own Lin Kuei! <laughs> Time to choose sides, friend or foe. Uh, I'll help. Then defend the Lin Kuei Temple. Smash these new intruders! I should thank you. You probably saved my life. Who is he? He doesn't seem human. He is Noob Saibot, a warrior from the Nether Realm. He is my brother. Your brother? Why did he try to kill you? He was corrupted long ago, but now I have the chance to save him. The Lin Kuei owe you much, Taven. In return for your aid, I will help you find the men who have been hunting you. They are called the Red Dragon, a clan of mysterious warriors. I can't help you get inside their base, but I can reveal its location. Where? Charred Mountain. It's unfortunate that Sub-Zero's brother has chosen a path of darkness. I wish I could help him remove the corruption that fills Noob Saibot's soul. But now that I know the location of the Red Dragon stronghold, I must return to Orin. He will be able to transport me there. Maybe then I will find some answers as to why I am being pursued. David, 
You've acquired a suit of armor. It's the item Mother left me to help with the quest. Are you ready to begin your search for Blaze? Not yet. The warriors in red ambushed me again outside the temple. I met someone there named Sub-Zero. He gave me information that could lead me to them. Who are they? He said they're called the Red Dragon Clan. His Lin Kuei recently located their stronghold. It's in Charred Mountain. I would like to visit them before I search for the Firespawn. They may be the ones who stole my father's sword. Will you send me there? As you wish. That there is more significance to your actions here than is apparent. I suggest you return to Adenia immediately. I would like some information first. The Red Dragon have attacked me twice. I'd like to know the reason, and I'm not leaving until I find it. Such ignorance. I will stop you, by force if necessary. I respect you, Fujin. You are a friend to my family. But I will not leave. Then you leave me no choice. Fight! I didn't want to do that. Fujin has been an ally for many ages. But I need to confront the Red Dragon. This must be the entrance to their stronghold. I hope they haven't been alerted to my presence. I'll soon find out. David. Dagon! You look... older. I am older. Much older than you, big brother. So you were awakened long ago. Why are you here? This is my stronghold. Your stronghold? And these warriors? I formed the Red Dragon Clan many ages ago. There must be some misunderstanding. Your soldiers have been hunting me. There is no misunderstanding. For years, my clan has infiltrated every corner of Earthrealm searching for you. Scouting parties were placed in locations where you were likely to appear. At our parents' temples, for instance. I see you found your armor. I wear mine always. Why would you send your clan after me? Isn't it obvious? I intend to kill you. What? The prize will be mine, Taven. I will not risk losing it to you. Grandmaster, please excuse the intrusion. Speak, Mavado. Blaze has been found. Excellent. I must make preparations. See that my brother never leaves this stronghold alive. Taven wins. Flawless victory. Who are you? Kano's the name. I am Taven. Do you know what the Red Dragon are doing here? Seems they're trying to create real Red Dragons. They've been able to create a hybrid of man and lizard, using their own clan members as test subjects. And you were next? They were trying something new on me, but they'll never finish. <laughs> Wait, I have more questions for you. I have done as you commanded. Then give me what you have found. I, I, I couldn't risk detection. I didn't carry the records with me. They're all up here. What? 
kill him! Dragon, I command you. Koro! Get away from him, lizard! I am reptile, and I do not answer to you. Fight! You're injured! I have been enslaved here by Dagon. He uses me to teleport his clan anywhere in the realms. I can't believe he could be capable of something like this. He is not the man he once knew. What happened? I am partially to blame. Long ago, I lost mental contact with the fire spawn blaze. I mistakenly took it as the signal to awaken your brother, but it was too soon. Reviving him early had unforeseen effects. Dagon was unbalanced. He was outraged that he had been manipulated by your parents and demanded to know the true purpose of the quest. Did they tell him? Perhaps. Whatever he learned must have disturbed him greatly. He killed them both. Killed them? Impossible. Father was a god. Mother was a powerful sorceress. How he did it is of little importance. They are gone. And I am to blame. Do not condemn yourself. <sighs> Nevertheless, I wish to atone for my mistake. Moments ago, I created this portal to the Netherrealm for your brother. He is there now. You must follow him. Leave now. I cannot hold the portal open much longer. I will return to help you. There is no need. I intend to stay here and destroy this atrocity Dagon has created in my name. When I am done, the Red Dragon will be nothing more than broken bodies strewn throughout the hollows of this mountain. Go now, and may the Elder Gods watch over you. I am torn by Karo's request to leave him in the Red Dragon stronghold. He and Orin have long been friends to my family. Together they have protected Edenia from many perils, not the least of which was Shao Kahn's unsuccessful invasion years ago. But even in his weakened condition, Kara will not be easily defeated. I imagine he is combating the Red Dragon Clan already. May the Elder Gods watch over him. Is that Shinnok? Why is an Elder God here in the Nether Realm? It seems as though he needs help. How the mighty have fallen! This day is ours! Die, Shinnok! Tathan! Where did you come from? I am weakened, son of Argus! You must protect me! Step away from Lord Shinnok! Now! You will pay for your interference! Taven wins! Flawless victory! Your assistance could not have come at a better time. You defended me against the She-Devil Li Mei, and for that, I am forever grateful. I don't understand. Why did you need my help, Lord Shinnok? You are an Elder God. 
I am an elder god no longer. I have been cast down, punished for involving myself in the affairs of mortals. Now I am cursed to preside over this wretched nether realm. What could you have done to anger the elder gods? Hm. Boldly asked as always, Taven. Perhaps even a former elder god may be permitted to ask his question first. Why are you here? I'm looking for my brother, Dagon. Yes, I remember him. You competed with one another often. You won most of the games, as I recall. But what makes you think he's here? I followed him here. He's been corrupted somehow. I don't know what evil led him to this place, but when I find him, he'll have much to answer for. I will help you find him, Taven. But first, I will need to regain my throne. Demons and strange warriors have overrun my sanctuary. Help me clear out the invaders and you will gain my favor. But you must listen to my instructions closely. What must I do, Lord Shinnok? The idea that Shinnok, an Elder God, resides within the realms is beyond belief. That he requires my aid is even more baffling. But I will assist him any way I can. It seems that demons and other beings have cast him out of his own spire. I will defeat them all, floor by floor, if need be. Demons have overrun my spire. Taven. This one is most unpredictable. You know him? I am Havoc, cleric of chaos. Shinnok will not regain control of anything, so long as I draw breath. Havoc is down, but there will be more like him in the chambers above. Who are these invaders? Why did they attack you? There is no time to discuss that now. We must make our way to the next chamber before more arrive. Quickly, enter the portal. Get away from Lord Shinnok! Eliminate them, too. We have reached the top chamber at last. My throne will restore my strength. Your throne? Shiva! A shogun? Here? The spire is ours! <laughs> you fight for Shinnok? You will die for Shinnok! Another one? Destroy Kintaro so that I may reclaim the spire. <laughs> My thanks to you, Taven. You have restored to me what little semblance of authority I have left. I am honored to be of service to an Elder God. Former Elder God, but I do appreciate your loyalty and respect. You may rise. Your brother. Yes, he has been to the Nether Realm, but he is not here any longer. I sense that he has gone back to Earth Realm. What? Earth Realm? I will send you to him, but you must leave now. Thank you, Lord Shinnok. He is strong, quite strong, and a skilled warrior. I told you he was a problem. He passed all my tests, destroyed my apparitions with ease, more quickly than you did. Perhaps I am aiding the wrong brother. What? You swore you would help me. Fool. <laughs> Your brother has been effectively delayed. His means of teleportation has been eliminated. 
Forgive me, Lord Shinnok. I didn't realize. It's just that your aid is vital to my success. Our success? There is more to this quest than you know. All things have led to this moment. The prize is not merely some gift, as your mother and father would have had you believe. It will determine the fate of many mortals, a fact I will use to my advantage. I don't understand. I have informed other warriors of the prize to hasten their participation. They will think, as you did, that godlike power will be bestowed upon the victor. It is a deception. They are marching to their doom. You shall be the victor, and the catalyst of my ascension. What must I do, Lord Shinnok? Strange. Shinnok knew that Dagon had been to the Netherrealm, but he didn't mention it until I cleared his spire of invaders. Now he has sent me back to Earthrealm. None of this makes sense. I wonder if Orin knows anything about Shinnok's fall from grace. Orin, are you all right? Dagon, I am mortally wounded. Did Dagon do this? A sorcerer, Quan Chi. He somehow discovered the location of this cave. I... I think I've seen him before. I believe Quan Chi wants to prevent you from leaving Earthrealm. I've kept the portal open, but I'm growing weaker. You must go through now, or you will be trapped here. I promise you, Orin, I will find this Quan Chi and make him pay with his life. Go now, and may the Elder Gods watch over you. Shao Kahn's fortress. I must be in Outworld. I suspect Quan Chi is already inside. I must find a way to get in. This looks like Shao Kahn's dungeon. No sign of Quan Chi here. Quan Chi hasn't been down here in ages. I am Melina. Hmm, not bad. Care to dance? Take ah. It will unlock my cell door. Please, free me. How do I know you won't attack me? You have only my word. I am not here to do battle with you. My task is to eliminate Shao Kahn. <laughs> Alone? This I must see. I thank you, stranger. I am Shu Jinko. I am Taven. You plan to defeat Shao Kahn? Whole realms have tried to overthrow him. Not only will I defeat him, but a host of his allies. They are in his chamber now, plotting some coming battle. I allowed myself to be captured. From this dungeon, I can enter Shao Kahn's soul chamber. Once there, I will be able to destroy Shao Kahn and all his allies in one stroke. I suggest you leave quickly, Taven for I cannot guarantee your safety. My safety? I just defeated this entire... Ah, foolish old man. I could release their power, but I can't reach them! 
Maybe I could focus the orb's energy on the statue if I trap the statue in the center of the room. Enjoying the view. Who are you? What are you doing here? At ease, Shokan. I am looking for Quan Shi. Have you seen him? He is with the Emperor. I am Goro. I have been ordered to let no one pass under penalty of death. My death? Or yours? <laughs> were elite guards, if you say so. I assume you are here to kill the Emperor. If anyone deserves to die, it's Shao Kahn. But I'm here for someone else. Quan Chi. Ah uh, yes, he is in the next room with the others. As much as I would like to see him die, I have been charged to protect the Emperor's allies. I am Reiko, general to Shao Kahn's army. The Emperor could use warriors such as yourself. Mm, as a rule, I don't ally myself with egotistical madmen. Hmm. Then I'm afraid I will have to kill you. And that is why we must put our differences aside and join forces. Why should we believe you, Quan Chi? Why should we trust you? I will not join an alliance of traitors! Shang Tsung, Shao Kahn, Onaga, my comrades. We are all treacherous by nature, and betrayal is to be expected. But if we do not stand together, at least initially, it could mean the end of darkness. I stand with no one. I will claim the prize and with it, destroy you all. Onaga. Emperor Onaga. Not anymore. <laughs> you haven't been listening to what Quan Chi has told us. The forces of light also seek to acquire this power. You cannot defeat them alone. Only if we join forces does one of us have a chance of winning the prize. But which one of us? If Onaga is the victor, he could use that power to overthrow you. I'll take that chance. Hmm. What of the brothers? What can be done about them? I have trapped one of them in Earthrealm. The other is in Edenia. We must go there now. Our allies are waiting. To war! Do not go through that portal. Raiden, you look different. But I'm glad you're here. I need your help. Shao Kahn and his allies are planning something. It is none of my concern. I don't understand. You always fought against Shao Kahn's forces. Now he's planning another battle and you won't lift a finger? We must not stand idly by. We must stop this- No, Taven. I have struck a deal with the Emperor. Shao Kahn will honor Earthrealm's independence when his forces have won. When he's won? What are you saying? Why would that lunatic spare Earthrealm? Because in return, I will prevent you from completing your quest. I cannot believe that Raiden would side with the enemy. Since this quest began, nothing has made sense. 
My entire life has been turned upside down. I want to abandon the quest, but if I do, Dagon will win, and he has become far too corrupt to replace Father as Protector. At this moment, the forces of darkness are invading Edenia. There must be something I can do to stop them. At last, home in Edenia. They appear to be somewhere near the ancient craters of the Southlands. My brother, Shao Kahn, and his allies, they are all here somewhere. And they will all die here. Who are you? I am Scorpion. I seek revenge. Revenge against me? Against the Elder Gods. They betrayed me. As reward for doing their bidding, they promised to resurrect my clan. They are no longer dead. They are the undead. For this treachery, I will eliminate the Elder Gods' only means of saving the realms from Armageddon. I will destroy both your brother and you. Well done, Taven. Dagon. I was hoping Scorpion would kill you and spare me the effort, but it looks as though I will have to finish you myself. Blaze! Why did you interfere? The quest has been corrupted. All did not go exactly as my creator had foreseen it. You are in the wrong location. I will transport you to the rim of the crater where the final battle will take place. The quest will conclude when one of you defeats me there in combat. We must make haste. Many warriors are gathering. If I am defeated by one of them, they will steal the prize and the true purpose of the quest will have failed. Armageddon will be upon you all. I want nothing to do with this quest. My business is with Dagon. No choice. We are all bound to the quest. The fate of the realms will be decided today. Then let's get this over with. I have waited an eternity for this moment. When this is over, I am going to finish you. How did we... Dagon? Ah! <laughs> you used to be faster than me. Last time we raced through Father's Temple, I believe you won. Seems like only yesterday. It was yesterday. I suppose it was. For you. But I was awakened prematurely. Over the millennia, I've grown much faster, much stronger. This time, my victory is assured. The only thing that is assured is that you will pay for killing mother and father. So you know. Yes, I killed them. I had to. Lord Shinnok warned me that they had decided to assist you. You killed them over the prize? With the very weapons Father gave us to use against Blaze. And now I will use them to destroy you. Fight! Obligation? The quest destroyed my family. Explain to me why I should care. Your mother, my creator, foresaw the coming Armageddon. That through mortal combat, warriors would unknowingly tap into the very forces that make reality possible. Those warriors are in the crater below, engaged in mortal combat. All of them? But with that many fighting in one place... This crater will be the origin of the apocalypse unless something is done to prevent it. The Elder Gods had ordered your father to orchestrate a solution. He decided to kill them all when the time came, but your mother argued to merely strip the combatants of their special abilities. For some were heroes, undeserving of death. In the end, they conceived of a contest between you and your brother. 
The victor would unleash one of two solutions. Like a coin toss, one side would disarm the warriors. The other would destroy them all. Which side of the coin am I? It is unknown even to me. Your armor is the catalyst. The fate of the combatants will be revealed when our battle is done. So by defeating you, I could be killing them all. They are unimportant. Whichever outcome, you will be saving the realms. But you must not let anyone else combat me. Then allow me to win, and we'll put an end to this. No, Taven. I must act according to my creator's design. Take your sword, walk through the archway, and finish the quest. been ripped to pieces. I awoke in a foreign realm, forced to complete a quest set forth by my parents, Argus and Delia. This quest, though intended to save the realms, has destroyed my family. My brother Dagon became obsessed with winning the ultimate prize of full godhood and murdered our parents. And in his madness, he sought to destroy me as well. Orin and Karo, dragons loyal to our family for ages, were not spared from the curse this quest has wrought. Dagon enslaved Karo to serve his own ends. The sorcerer Quan Chi killed Orin, who was my guardian. Though I had nothing left, I was determined to complete the quest. I faced many combatants, fighting my way to the top of the pyramid until at last I alone defeated Blades in mortal combat. The energy released by his death passed through me, granting me full godhood. The excess power then filtered through my armor and passed into the other combatants. Though this energy was to have one of two effects on them, death or annulment of their powers, a third, unforeseen outcome resulted. The quest did nothing to resolve the instability of the realms. But as protector of Adenia, I vow to stave off Armageddon until a solution can be found. The realms are in constant flux. They shift and change like an endless dream. Shao Kahn's defeat should have marked our victory against a threatened merge of Earthrealm and Outworld. Instead, it heralded a new struggle for independence. Shinnok will be displeased by your inability to take Earthrealm. Hold your tongue, sorcerer! Raiden! Your invasion of Earthrealm violated the rules of Mortal Kombat, Shao Kahn. Your Tarkatan Horde has been routed by the forces of light. Even now, your allies desert you. Quan Chi! Traitor!
realm will never succumb to the forces of darkness, Quan Chi. Now you will face the judgment of the Elder Gods. Metropolis, a shining example of human achievement. This is where we made our final stand against Darkseid and his army of parademons, born in the fire pits of a distant world called Apocalypse. But what seemed like victory was only the beginning. It's over, Darkseid. Don't be so sure, Kryptonian. Took you long enough. Luther. You threatened the safety of Earth for your own personal gain. You allied yourself with Darkseid. I was only trying to ensure humanity's survival in the event that you and the other so-called heroes fail. Darkseid's activated another dimensional boom tube. He's going to escape. This isn't over, Superman. Don't be so sure. Insolent fool! You're destabilizing the boom tube! you didn't kill us. Save it, Luther. You're going to jail, but this time you'll be someplace much more secure than Stryker's Island. What? Don't worry. I'll make sure your cell has a nice view of Earth. Nice move, Liu Kang. It was really your move. I merely redirected your own power against you. And I could sense your chi. I knew you were there. I should never underestimate the combat skill of the White Lotus. I am surprised to see you so soon after Shao Kahn's defeat. I've taken leave from the Adinian resistance to solve a troubling puzzle. Many of our forces have disappeared, vanished without a trace. We cannot sustain these losses and still hope to reclaim Adinia. Many White Lotus have also disappeared. By the gods. Who do you think is responsible? Shao Kahn was defeated. Quan Chi is rumored to be imprisoned by the Elder Gods. Only two factions remain that are bold enough to fill the void left behind. The Lin Kuei and the Black Dragon. Precisely. We need to know for certain if they're responsible. They're from your realm, which is why I need your help. You'll need more than just my help. Contact Sonya Blade. She has a better understanding of the Black Dragon than I. I will search for Sub-Zero. Reports are coming in that Darkseid has been defeated by Superman. Though the invasion is in fact over, the looting continues. Deathstroke, how's it going? Yeah, it's been a while. I got all the money for you. It's, 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 no, 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 please! I, I got the money! Ah! You should have paid up sooner. You'd still have a head. Metropolis isn't your turf. I suggest you run back to Keystone City before something bad happens. Don't 
Don't bother getting up, Deathstroke. You're going to jail. Uh, not without a fight. The Flash wins. Flash to Wonder Woman. I just went three rounds with Deathstroke. I'll contact Metropolis PD. I need you in Gotham. No problem. I'll... Flash, are you okay? I'm... I'm alright. Just dizzy. You've been running from city to city for hours. Forget about Gotham. I'll ask Martian Manhunter. I'm fine, Diana. I just felt strange for a moment. I'm on my way to Gotham now. Busy night for the bat, and even he can't be everywhere at once. What he doesn't know won't hurt him. No, but it might end up hurting you in the long run. Hand it over, Catwoman. Sorry, Red. No can do. I'm protecting it. <laughs> I can never figure you out. One minute you're a hero, the next you're a criminal. I'm a complicated woman. You know, I don't feel like chasing you anymore. And I don't have time to explain myself. We don't have to fight. Oh, but I want to. The Flash wins. This is why I don't play nice with you hero types. This ought to fetch a tidy sum. All right, what's your deal? <laughs> you don't look so good, mate. I'll take that. Hey! Ah, what the? Hand over the gem. Back off, freak. She took it. So you helped her escape. I don't like your attitude. You need to be taught some manners. Uh, you'd give Cabal a run for his money. My turn. What are you doing in Gotham? Batman! This freak tried... He tried to kill me! And now I'm gonna return the favor! No, you're not. It's clear something's wrong with you. The Flash I know doesn't kill. <laughs> he does now. Snow. Out of place this time of year. If my hunch is correct. Kitana, have you contacted Sonya Blade? Yes. It seems she has been on Kano's trail for the past week. Hmm. <laughs> I'm not surprised. She will contact you later. I am returning to our world. Have you found Sub-Zero? Not yet. But I feel I'm getting... close. Closer than you think!
Is this the way of the so-called forces of light? Exterminate your enemies? It was you who attacked me, ninja. Many of our warriors have disappeared, and now I have found their assassin. I didn't kill any Lin Kuei. I heard your communication. You and your special forces dogs were about we're to- We're investigating the disappearance of our comrades as well. It seems we have a common enemy, Sub-Zero. The question is, are you willing to work together to uncover the truth? How do I know I can trust you? Because I'm about to save your life. What? Scorpion. Go, now. We will meet again later. You allowed Sub-Zero to escape. Now you will suffer my wrath! Inside the cave? Why did you attack me? Listen, I'm sorry. I don't know what happened. I just felt this rage. It overwhelmed me. I couldn't stop myself. What are you doing in Gotham? Wonder Woman asked me to help. And that's when Catwoman and that other guy showed up. I'd like to run some tests. I told you I'm... Oh no. <laughs> What's happening? Get away. I can't control... Whatever Scorpion is, Wonder Woman, it isn't human. What about Flash? I believe Flash and this Scorpion creature switched places through some kind of teleportation event. Keep me informed of your progress. I will. Batman out. Another energy anomaly similar to that of Scorpion's frequency? In the heart of Gotham. So strange. I have seen this trick before. Your illusion does not fool me, Shang Tsung. Round. Masters. Masters. Where are they? Why don't they answer? Because they no longer draw breath. Shang Tsung! And soon, neither will you! <laughs> May the Elder Gods bind you in the Nether Realm for your treachery, sorcerer. This is Liu Kang. Sonya here. Have you found Kano? I almost caught up with him, but he disappeared. I did get close enough to tag him. I've been trying to initiate a techno portal to his current location, but I can't stabilize it. How goes your search for Sub-Zero? The Lin Kuei are not behind this. They are suffering losses as well. I think there is a new threat. I fought a warrior. Something resembling a red devil with a bolt of lightning on his chest. At first I thought it was Shang Tsung transforming his appearance. I have ruled out that possibility. This is a different warrior altogether. I clearly sense an abnormality in his chi. His chi? The energy that courses through all things in the universe. His aura is unlike anything I have seen before. 
I will try to attune to it. Attune to his? Don't do anything crazy, Liu Kang. I will be fine. You may be the champion of Mortal Kombat, but you are not invincible. Liu Kang, come in! Liu Kang! Something must have gone wrong. Katana, this is Sonya Blade. Please respond. Katana here. Something happened to Liu Kang. He may need help. My techno portals are unstable and I can't risk ending up in the middle of nowhere. Can you portal to him? Unfortunately, no. There is a crisis here in Outworld that demands my full attention. I do not have time to explain. <sighs> Understood. I'll have to go there myself. I will join you when I can. Sonya out. If the portal was working properly, I could get to Liu Kang immediately. But the destination is too erratic. I can't risk emerging in the wrong place. Or worse, bringing something here. It's a little late to be worrying about that. Who are you? Uh, I'm Catwoman. And I really need to be getting back to Gotham City. So if you could just, maybe... Security breach, portal room, initiate immediate lockdown. You aren't going anywhere. Not tonight, honey. I have a headache. All right, then. No one cages this kitty. Security will take care of you. I've got to get to Liu Kang. I don't have time for this nonsense. when the clown exploded! Sorry to ruin your night, Joker. Batman wins. Okay, okay, I, I give up! I've heard that before. <laughs> this night just keeps getting better and better. Stay where you are. Yeah, that's gonna happen. Who are you? I am Liu Kang. Are you injured? I can help you. I thought I defeated you, sorcerer! By the Elder Gods, I will finish you! Win. No Joker, and no Scorpion. Your little distraction means two deadly menaces are out on the loose. At least you're not going anywhere. Green Lantern, this is Batman. I have a prisoner I need to examine in a secure location. I need an extraction to the UN Orbital Station. I've been having problems with my ring. It may have been damaged during the battle with Darkseid, but I still should be able to transport you. Give me a minute. No sign of Liu Kang. Or anyone, for that matter. I've got a bad feeling about this. Sonya here. Sonya, it's Jax. Who's this woman in the ring? She calls herself Catwoman. I'll question her later. She's not a priority right now. Something's come up. What's wrong? I need help locating Liu Kang. Follow my signal and rendezvous with me as soon as... <clears throat> Baraka! Sonya! Just get here as soon as you can. Sonya, out. 
Jax won't save you this time. Round wins. I don't know what Baraka's doing in Earthrealm, but it's suspicious. If a new invasion is coming, Raiden must be informed. Something about him isn't making sense. I could buy that Scorpion came from Apocalypse, but this man is different. According to you, Flash had the same kind of psychotic condition. I'm not sure, but we may be witnessing the beginning of another invasion. I'll leave the detective work to you. I'm going to look for Superman. Computer, run the blood sample from Liu Kang against the known alien blood types we have in the database. No matches to blood type. Hmm. I need to know if we should expect any more visitors. same place as Liu Kang and Scorpion. How is it possible? Insulated armor. You will release Liu Kang. First, I need answers. Release Liu Kang, or I will take him from you. With a lightning bolt on his chest. This must be the warrior Liu Kang fought. Who are you? I am... Captain Marvel. Captain? Why are you here? Oh, confused. Don't understand. The rage! The rage! Now maybe I can get some answers out of you. Cap, what happened? My ring's not working right, but I got here as soon as I could. Green Lantern? Beware. The rage. Oh. The rage? I take it he means you. What did you do to Cap? The same thing I'm going to do to you. Win. Ah! 
Thanks for the save. Whoever she is, she was ready to finish me. You look bad, but whatever is going on is affecting us all. Come on, I'll take you to the UN space station so Batman and Wonder Woman can have a look at you. Sonia, what happened? What are you doing in Raiden's Sky Temple? When I lost contact with you, I was about Back to... Off. Hey, what's wrong? Kano? Kano? I finally found you. What are you talking about? This time, you won't get away. Fight! Enough! Explain yourselves. I don't know what happened. She just attacked me. I... I saw you as the enemy. I thought you were a threat. I can't explain it. I'm sorry, Jax. It's all right. You seem to have snapped out of it. She was most likely influenced by the same forces that have affected Liu Kang. Liu Kang! What happened to you? I was captured by the invaders. Fortunately, Raiden rescued me. He was being held aboard that vessel. I came here to find you, Raiden, and was attacked by two warriors. They retreated to that space station. I do not know from where these invaders come or who leads them. But it is clear that Earthrealm faces a grave new challenge. Our world is merging with another. I can feel it. But Shao Kahn was destroyed! We stopped him from merging Earthrealm with Outworld. The Emperor may still live, and these new warriors may be his reinforcements. Then let's do something about it. Sonya, let's get back to the base. We can mount a counterattack from there. Tell me something I don't know. The invasion has reached Themyscira. Do you need help? No. I'll contact you when it's over. Wonder Woman out. Leave this island at once, or pay with your lives. I am Princess Diana, emissary of Themyscira. You are not welcome here. Surrender and you will be given safe passage back to your world. An arrogant fool. I am Shang Tsung, and this is my island. Fight! Wonder Woman to Batman. The invaders have retreated into the jungle. I have more bad news. Earth is in the process of merging with another planet. By the gods. Our world and the alien world occupy the same time and space as fragments separated only by large... Large yellow energy rifts. I've seen them. We need Superman, but no one knows where he is. I'll search Metropolis. Darkseid's invasion ravaged Metropolis. It's not like Superman to... Great Hera! Are you all right? Let me help you. It can't be. We routed his invasion. He was destroyed. Who? Darkseid? I saw him. More powerful than ever. Torn his realm asunder. Am I too late? Has he already brought the apocalypse to this world? Wonder Woman to UN Orbital Space Station. I need a med unit at my location. We have another victim of the invasion. Please, come with me. You're safe now. We- I have been followed. Who are you? No one will hurt you. My name is Wonder Woman. I am not so easily fooled, assassin of our world. Your master has sent you to finish me, but this battle will be your last fight! <laughs> Metropolis, the fortress of 
solitude has been breached. That's impossible. Superman may be in serious trouble. And without him, so is Earth. I'm on my way. What have you done? Another one. Quan Chi was right. Who are you? I am Sub-Zero. Surrender and no harm will come to you. The Lin Kuei do not know the meaning of surrender. Fight! What happened? Are you all right? Something's wrong. My powers have been fluctuating ever since the battle with Darkseid. I came back to the fortress to try to discover what was wrong, and Sub-Zero attacked. What's happening to me? It must have a basis in magic. Luckily, I'm not susceptible to magic, so he got what he deserved. Bruce believes he's part of an invasion force. Heroes all over the world are disappearing, including the Flash. And our planet is merging with another, possibly Apocalypse. Apocalypse? Then Darkseid is back? I have to get back to Metropolis. I'll rendezvous with you at the UN Space Station. <sighs> Sub-Zero, who is behind this invasion? You are the invaders! I'll be there as soon as I can. You'll be coming with me. Cap! Stop! Hal! What have you done? The rage will consume us all! Not if I can help it. I need you to be oh. calm. Tell me what you did to Green Lantern. Why did you attack oh. him? Uh, I don't know. The ethereal forces are all unbalanced, shifting. I reach out to the gods and don't recognize what I see. The rage. You have to help me. Oh. You should have finished him. Your world must be different than ours. Here, we don't kill our friends. Wonder Woman to Batman. I've found Superman, but we have a new problem. We've lost Green Lantern. When I got to the Wuxi Academy, you were already gone. I did find some guy dressed in red tights, though. I had him medevac to the infirmary. Then I followed your signal to Raiden's Temple. You gotta stop running off like that, Sonya. We're a team. You can't take on the bad guys alone. I know. I'll work on it. Go get yourself patched up. Meantime, I'll prep the portal for a jump to that space station. We'll take them by surprise. Sounds like a plan. But I have to warn you, the portal has been less than cooperative lately. Nothing I can't handle. She's right. Log shows the portal was having a hard time focusing. Probably a side effect of the two universes merging. The ethereal matrix seems to be more stable now. Just a few adjustments and we should be back in business. There. That's more like it. Impressive. What the hell are you- Allow me to introduce myself. Lex Luthor. Perhaps you've heard of me, or a little company I run called LexCorp. This area requires top clearance, and I don't remember inviting you to the party. My technicians at LexCorp picked up a massive signal emanating from this base, indicating highly advanced technology. 
I'm the hands-on managerial type, so I came to see for myself. And I must say, I am impressed. A teleportation device. Maybe you and I should do business. It's a portal. As for doing business, maybe it's time I gave you a demonstration of my impressive technology. I'd prefer a handshake, but if you insist... What happened? They found our base. Somehow, he breached our defenses. Who's he? Called himself Lex Luthor. He runs some company. Acts like he's gonna take over the world. Looks like you put a stop to that. Only one way to be sure. Let's take out that space station. Sonia! Sonia, you copy? We've apparently been sent to different locations on the station. I think the portal still needs some work. We'll need to regroup. Stay where you are. I'll try to... Hold on. Someone's coming. We've set up a temporary holding facility as requested, Wonder Woman. It should hold Captain Marvel until he's recovered. My thanks. If this Earth merge continues, everyone's powers may be affected. I'll be joining you shortly with our newest guest. Affirmative. Are there any special security measures? Uh, ah! <sighs> well now, this just got a whole lot more interesting. <clears throat> Sonia, area secure. What's your situation? I'm fine. We need to locate the main command center to cripple this station's capabilities. Right. Stay where you are. I'll follow your signal and come to you. You're not going anywhere. Sub-Zero? I take it you two know each other. He is Jax, a formidable warrior, as you will soon discover. Well, warrior, I don't know what your universe is doing to mine, or what, what you're, you're doing, doing to this station. station. But true warriors don't use guns. And if it's a fight you want, you'll soon be joining your friend in a cell. Sonia, you'll never guess who I bumped into. Sub-Zero. What's he doing up here? Obviously, I'm a captive would appear that we are now allies. Appearances can be deceiving. True, but you would be a fool to refuse my help. What do you think, Sonya? Should we trust him? Better the devil you know than the devil you don't. All right then, Sub-Zero. Tell us what you know. Only that these warriors are unlike anything I have encountered. I don't know yet who commands them. Any ideas? The most logical assumption would be that Shao Kahn has returned to finish what he started with this new army. Now I need to find someone, a sorcerer who may have answers. Sorcerer? I don't like the sound of that. Like it or not, we need him. Where there is threat of invasion, he usually knows something about it. are colliding. Your fellow Lanterns are elsewhere doing what they can to combat the crisis. That would explain Captain Marvel's attack. Whatever's happening on Earth must be affecting him more directly than the rest of us. I have to get back to Earth. Yes, you do. Lex Luthor and Catwoman? How? Lex and I were held captive in the Invaders' underground base. Their security was more pathetic than the Gotham City Museum. We escaped using their portal technology. I calibrated it to transport us to Metropolis, but there was obviously a malfunction. We ended up here. Now I know I need to get back to Earth. If he's involved, things can't be good. T 
Typical. You're no better than Superman. The universe is falling apart, and the so-called heroes focus on the little picture. All that power in his ring. Have you ever noticed how he uses it? Big hammers, trains, and idiotic animals. What's the matter with you, Lex? His eyes. Just like Captain Marvel. You lack imagination, Green Lantern. You always have. Someone like me should have that ring. Over my dead body, Lex. Just the way I like it. Wins. This is a foolish waste of valuable time. The merging of worlds is contaminating the galaxy, infecting your very substance with rage. For the moment, we can control it here on Oa, but if unchecked, it will spread across the universes. Then we'll stop it. If it continues to progress at this rate, energies throughout will be redistributed and corrupted. No lantern's ring will be unaffected or remain intact. Nor will any other being in the galaxy escape. Neither universe will survive. Why is this happening? We are uncertain of the cause, but we believe this anomaly originated on Earth at the moment of Darkseid's defeat. You know anything about that, Lex? It is highly unlikely that Lex Luthor is capable of influencing devastation on such a cosmic scale. You on Earth must work together to locate the source of the disruption and destroy it before the merge is complete. Looks like we have no choice. Don't worry, handsome. We won't bite much. Earth Sector 2814 is under your protection. We cannot spare any of the Lantern Corps to help. Charge your ring and return quickly. There is not much time. That's more like it. So what's it going to be, hero? Do we work together? Or do I have to save the world in spite of you? Remember, I don't trust you, Luther. The feeling is mutual. That's the UN communicator. I have to leave you here. If I were you, Catwoman, I wouldn't turn my back on him. I can take care of myself. Idiot. Home sweet home. Or at least it used to be before Darkseid got to it. You brought it on yourself, Lex. From what I hear, you helped Darkseid. I never take sides. I chose the lesser of two evils. The worst Superman would do is hand me over to the authorities. Darkseid, on the other hand, would destroy everything. It wasn't much of a choice. Seems like we don't have one now, either. So what's the plan? Simple. We find a way to turn this situation to our advantage. The Lin Kuei are not welcome here. Raiden, I come seeking assistance. Assistance? For what end? Your kind has challenged me before. I'm not my brother. But you are still Lin Kuei. Fight! Round zero wins. Scorpion's trail is weak, but I can still track it. 
This way. Wonder Woman, this is Green Lantern. What's going on? I'll tell you what's going on, Green Lantern. Who are you? Name's Jax. And now that the introductions are out of the way... We're shutting you down. Jax! You again? Sonia Blade to Special Forces. Jax is down. Don't try it, lady. Things have changed since the last time we faced off. Message received. Sending reinforcements. Negative, negative. I can handle it myself. Not this time. Right. Ah! Green Lantern, am I glad to see you. Hey Cap, how you feeling? I won't attack you, Green Lantern. I think I finally have the rage under control. It's all coming from this other universe trying to merge with ours. Its energy creates this terrible fury. You just want to hit something. That's what the Guardian said. How did you figure it out? Their alien gods are creating interference with my powers and infecting me with their combat rage. Great, out of control magical alien god powers. So that would make you a danger to us and yourself. None of us is safe from the rage until this is stopped. I have to go back to the Rock of Eternity to get closer to the gods and see how we can defeat this combat rage. There has to be a way. Good luck, Cap. Truly, you are more powerful than your sibling. But the corruption of the Lin Kuei remains within you. And for that reason, I... The Lin Kuei also have reason to be concerned about this new crisis. Indeed. The Lin Kuei act solely in their own self-interest, regardless of the impact on Earthrealm. Why then should I give you the location of Quan Chi? For the same reason you helped my brother, to protect Earthrealm. That rock formation in the distance, it was not here before the invaders came. But through it, I've gained insight. Earthrealm is merging with another world. Powers are shifting, rebalancing. I have felt the effects in Shao Kahn's defeat, and they have grown ever stronger. Quan Chi foresaw the intrusion from the other world, and that their champion would pose a dire threat. And the Lin Kuei sent you to eliminate this champion. Yes. Much like this rock formation, the warrior's fortress appeared near the Lin Kuei temple. I wore him down and sealed him in ice. You did not wear him down. His power was siphoned away, redistributed to others. I must find Quan Chi, to demand he reveal all that he knows. Very well, Sub-Zero. I will show you the way. Search for Scorpion and you will find Quan Chi. But be forewarned. Betray my trust at your own peril. Scorpion was here. I can sense the nether, but he must have vanished from this spot. Well, isn't this interesting? A masked man in Gotham. And from the look of you, I'd say you're no hero. You do not look so innocent yourself. Name's Deathstroke. Sub-Zero. 
So, who are you hunting? Or are you just looking for a fight? It is none of your concern. Fair enough. But I've been around this world, and I've never heard of a Sub-Zero. I'm not from your world. Then you're in enemy territory. And I assume you are the enemy. Smart boy. This is where Scorpion first entered the mortal realm. What was he doing here? What is this place? It's the Bat Cave. Ah. Your world is invading mine. Affecting everything and everyone in it. Don't think you'll take me so easily. Then I will do it the hard way. Welcome, Sub-Zero, to the Netherrealm. Quan Chi! There were rumors that the Elder Gods had punished you. I see the rumors were true. I won't be bound here for long. I believe you know my Enforcer. You share a violent history from what I understand. You will pay for the murder of my family and clan! That was not me. Who else could it be? Scorpion. Finish him. Fight! Round. <laughs> the Elder Gods underestimate me. You're free. The realms have become unstable. Our world is colliding with another, the merging fueled by combat. The intense battle between such bitter enemies caused a rift powerful enough to shatter my bonds. You used us. I'm a sorcerer. The world as we know it is in peril. None will survive, regardless of allegiance. Return to your Thunder God. Tell him if he wishes to save his precious Earth Realm, you'll have to ally himself with devils. Search their cities. Find the princess. She has seen our enemy. Disturbance is clearing, but for how long? Their gods will be drawn here. I have to stop, stop them, Billy Batson. Wizard! This is only the beginning. You must stop Dark Khan. Is that Dark Side? Dark Side's essence has been fused with evil magic from the other realm. This new being, Dark Khan is the focal point where both universes freely intermingle. His existence will turn this world into a nexus of evil. If the connection between the universes is not severed and Darkseid freed, the rage will reach out and devour us all. You must gather an army of both dark and light and find a champion who has defeated Darkseid in the past. Then we must find Superman!
Superman doesn't respond to my hails. Wonder Woman says his powers have been affected as badly as mine by this alien world, if not worse. But he's the champion Earth needs. And now, you have suffered the same fate! Get this place... such evil! Flattery will get you nowhere. This pathetic creature reeks of the gods. I want whatever power he possesses. We are your death. Even with your world poisoning mine, I think you'll find Captain Marvel isn't easy to kill. Fight! Shazam! Captain Marvel wins. Now finish him! No. I won't kill. You disappoint me. Still, your mastery over the supernatural is exceptional. I won't let this insanity destroy my world. I defeated your champion. Now return me to Metropolis. Your challenge is not over. Let us see how you fare against the savage fury of Baraka's blade. Impressive. You would have fared well in my tournament, but I'm afraid you could never have been champion of Mortal Kombat. In the end, you would have faced Shang Tsung. I've had enough of your game, Shang Tsung. I've beaten you and your demons. Now before the combat rage overtakes me again, send me back. As you wish. Quan Chi said the Netherrealm would drain him. But even here we could not defeat him. How can we defeat a foe such as this? We must return to Quan Chi. He may have the answer. Princess, where is she? Princess? Didn't I kill the last guy that called me that? He should have known! I'm the only Joker around here! Oops! Where did that come from? Hello, Joker. Looks like you could use some help. I already have a few recruits. How'd you like to join us? <laughs> Diana, you have returned. Not for long. Batman has requested my presence. Earth is being split just as the Mascara has, by forces we don't yet understand. I've returned to ready the Amazons for war. Great Hera! Who are you? What business do you have on the Mascara? I am Scorpion. I seek the Princess. I am Princess of Earth. You may speak to me, Scorpion. Batman told me of your battle. You are not the princess I seek. You may not roam this island at will. Even though you are an invader, 
I promise you, if you come with me, you will not be harmed. You cannot harm me, but I will show you the meaning of pain! Princess is not here. Wizard! Wizard, I need your help! Oh. There are no wizards or sorcerers here. This place is not for you! Listen, Listen to, to me! me. Your presence here places my world in great danger! It is you who does not belong. I am Raiden, God of Thunder. Ethereal power courses through this place, yet it is unfamiliar. Tell me, for what purpose does this place exist? This is a focal point between the realm of the gods and men. The gods give me their powers. Which gods? Please, I'm losing control. You're corrupting this place! You have to leave! I will make you leave! NOW! Round one. Fight! She is near. You need some help, stranger? The princess. If you know where she is, you will deliver her to me. You're not from this universe. All the same, I'd encourage you to get to safety. For your own well-being, you'd better come with me. <laughs> Magic. Sorcery. Surrender the princess. Or die! Scorpion. But she has gotten too close to the enemy. Rage has all but consumed her. I can control her. For now. What will you do with her? Kill her! She may have lost her mind, but she still has her uses. I will not leave her to you yet, Baraka. One of the enemy is near. Draw him to the nether realm where he will be weak. Kill him. When you have finished with your prey, meet me at Raiden Sky Temple. The time has come for old rivalries to be put aside. Excellent work, Captain Marvel. Finally, one of the heroes is doing something about these invaders. Did you win? What are you and your criminal buddies doing, Luther? Unlike the rest of the long underwear crowd, I'm trying to save the planet. Can we kill him now? Don't even think about it, Joker. Superman. You're supposed to be in jail, Luther. The evidence didn't hold up. You should be used to it by now. Nice try, though. Easy, boys. 
Let's keep our eye on the prize. Catwoman's right. I know what we're up against. Our enemy is called Dark Khan. Khan! 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 Shut up, or I'll gut you. Darkseid's energy merged with energy from the other universe. Dark Khan's mere existence is what's causing the two universes to collide. That explains the attacks on me and the rest of you. The strange fluctuations of our powers. It was you. Your heat vision. You blasted Darkseid's boom tube and sent him hurtling into some unknown universe. This is all your fault. You accuse me? You helped Darkseid invade the Earth, remember? Fight! 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 Both of you calm down. You're being poisoned by the combat rage. Poisoned by what? The dark energies from the world merge. We can't fight among ourselves. We need to work together to find Dark Khan. I have lives to spare. How do we find this Dark Khan? If Dark Khan is made of Darkseid's energy, there's a good chance he's on Apocalypse. I know where we can access one of Dark Khan's portals. I used it when Catwoman and I escaped. If their portal can take us to Oa, it can take us to Apocalypse. Deathstroke, you and Joker secure that portal. This device will lead you to the base. Report back to me when you've succeeded. You want me to assault an enemy base with him? Come on! We'll kill things! Blow things up! Oh, it'll be fun! Catwoman, you're with me. Can't be too safe in this town. Too many criminals. Superman and Captain Marvel, you gather your hero allies and wait for my word. All right, Lex. I'll trust you. For now. You get to the portals. I'll go to the Fortress of Solitude and pull up everything I know about Darkseid. No killing. If one of you steps out of line, believe me, I'll know. Then you helped him escape? It was not intentional, I swear to you. You have betrayed my trust, sub -Zero. He did you a service. Katana! You dare to come here, sorcerer? Not to fight, I assure you. Then for what purpose? By now, I am sure you are aware of the merging. Its effects are far-reaching. Even the Netherrealm is vulnerable. I care not for the wasteland you call home. Katana? You believe that you're in control? That your allies are enough to stave off the coming destruction? Think again, Thunder God. Katana! I will destroy you all! This is your doing, sorcerer. It is no spell of mine. She is a harbinger of things to come. It will only get worse. What is this? I've used the last of my power to purge her of the rage. I am at your mercy, Raiden. Why would you do this? To win your trust. What is it that we face? Perhaps she can show you. At first I thought it was the Emperor. But it is someone much more powerful. Dark Khan. The portal Raiden disrupted did not destroy the Emperor. It created a monster. Dark Khan's energy is slowly grinding the two universes together. Agitating us until we become enraged and fight. Combat releases the rage, hastening the merging. Then Dark Khan must be stopped. Not yet. We must first eliminate his forces. But to do so will require the unthinkable. Bitter rivals must fight as one to focus the rage against our enemies. So it shall be. We will seek out Dark Khan's forces, hunt them down in pairs. Liu Kang, you must fight alongside Shang Tsung. I will do as you ask, Raiden. This could prove interesting. This is the location, but there's no base. And here I was so looking forward to murdering someone. You don't like me much, do you? Does anyone? Over there. 
They must be the source of the transmission. Then let's get down to business, sweetie. All right, Joker. Here's your chance to kill something. If you can. Pretty flower? For the pretty lady? Get the hell away from me, you... My wrist portal. Hmm. I was going for the eyes. Thanks for bringing us to your headquarters. We're interested in some technology. Is this some kind of trick? He damaged the teleporter. I have no idea where we are. We'll figure it out later. You take the ninja, I'll take the clown. What can I say? The ladies dig me. Now, you don't hit like a girl. Can't we talk about this? Give me five. Shake. Put her there. Give me five. Put her there. Shake. Put her there. The Joker wins. I beat her? I won? I won! I mean, of course I won! Since when can you fight? She's easy. It's me you gotta worry about. I'll never worry. You're good, but you lack discipline. Allow me to discipline him. Joker, what the hell? Step aside, death joke. I hope you put up more of a fight than Blondie did! Because this Joker is wild! Put it Give me five! The Joker wins! I don't believe it. He should have killed you. What's going on, Joker? Don't know, don't care. This woman's teleportation device, it's what we need to get to Apocalypse. I think I can reactivate it. Perfect. Let's get this to Luther. The hell with Baldy! What's going on with your eyes? There's two things he forgot to tell you about me. I don't care what happens to the world! And I don't play well with others. <laughs> Some world-class assassin you turned out to be! I'm undefeated! Unstoppable! I bet I could even kill... Batman! <laughs> Joker. You wanted me? Here I am. Well, well. If it ain't Batman. Sorry about before, you know. The running away. That was rude of me. You'll be happy to know I won't be running anymore. I know you've got a trick up your sleeve. Nothing up this sleeve. Let's check the other one. Nope. Nothing up my sleeves. I don't have time for this. Make the time, bats! Now you're all mine! This is Batman. Your strike team failed. Joker's been exposed to the planetary merger and the power went to his head. You shouldn't have trusted the clown with such an important mission. Give me some credit, Batman. I used 
those psychotics as a diversion. Catwoman and I are still on track to take the portal. You'd better be on our side for this one, Luther. If not, I'll be the first one you'll answer to. Batman is so infuriating. Tell me about it. Uh, by the way, Lex, I'm nobody's bodyguard. Certainly not yours. Of course not. You know the enemy's base and how to override their defenses. Once I've taken what I need, I'll rally the so-called heroes to handle Darkon for me, and you can- Lex, we've got company. More intruders! Their souls are forfeit. Our souls are forfeit? Is that ninja humor? Because it's not very funny. We don't have time for this stupidity! One down. Lex, behind you. You'll have to do better than that. moment there, I wasn't sure what side you were on. Story of my life. Let's go. Shang Tsung and I have just arrived at the fortress. No sign of the enemy. You can chat with your woman later. We have a job to do. People to kill. Your forces got the better of me before. My powers may not be at full force, but as you can see, I have friends. The warrior Sub-Zero warned us about. Let us finish what he could not! Fight! They were more of a challenge than your masters. Do not test me, Shang Tsung! I should have killed you at the Academy! What stopped you? Shang Tsung, your treachery ends here! can this be? You are more powerful than before! I was weakened when last we fought, but energies are in constant flux as a result of the merging. Now I am revitalized, surging with power! I could finish you right now! You wanna finish? You got it! <laughs> Leave him. He is defeated. Now you face a more deadly adversary! You defeated him. You defended me. It was not something which I enjoyed. I owe you my gratitude. Save your pathetic graciousness. Were it not for Darkon, I would kill you now. Our objective is complete. We must return to the others. Here it is. 
Just imagine what I could accomplish with the ability to travel anywhere instantaneously. I'm going to download their schematics. While you do that, I am going to do some reconnaissance. Amazing. It's more advanced than I thought. This is Luther. I'm transferring the portal technology to the LexCorp servers. With this, I'll rebuild LexCorp. Nothing will stop me. Except me. Jax. I thought I'd locked you up. You may have escaped once, but it won't happen again. I've been admiring your portal technology. It's going to prove quite useful to me. Over my dead body. If you insist. Your cybernetic arms intrigue me. Fascinating musculature emulation. Perhaps I'll take them with me. Luther! Flash, what have you done to Catwoman? Isn't it obvious? She's a criminal just like you! You're out of the loop, Red. We're all on the same side. Shut up, Luther! I'm taking you down! Flash Luther wins. All right, Luther, we all got your hail. Let's end this now. Get us to Apocalypse. Here's your pet clown. Ouch! Someone please kill him for me! Back off. Joker and Flash are infected. We can't trust them. We've all been infected, Batman. It's a risk we have to take. Not to worry, Batman. My fight with Luther apparently purged me of my combat rage or whatever you call it. Gentlemen, if you're finished wasting time, we have a job to do. Open the portal, Luther. Take us to Apocalypse. Yay! We're all going to hell! And if you're not a good boy, we'll leave you there. We couldn't stop them either. They overpowered us. How can this be? It was a skinny one, dressed in purple with green hair, stronger than you'd think. I have fought him before. A jester with a twisted face. A clown? You were defeated by a clown? It may be as you said, Chang Sung. Energy shifting, causing imbalances. I don't need you to make excuses for me, and I don't need your approval! Kano, calm down. You don't want to do this you now. You think you could have handled him? You can't even handle me! We shall see. wins. As much as I would love to see you two kill each other, there are bigger issues to deal with. Agreed. Sonya here. This is Jax. I'm at the base. I have some bad news. They were at the base. A guy in an exosuit dropped me. Then they used our techno portal. I think they're headed to Outworld. Then that is where we must go. We all know what is at stake. If we fail, none of us will survive. Then we shall go to Outworld. Something is definitely wrong here. I like it! You would. This is what's in store for Earth if we don't stop Dark Khan. Grinding two universes together will eventually rip them both apart. A portal! Dark Khan must know we're here. He sent his forces to stop us. Fine with me! Let's take them out! Wait. They may not be aligned with Dark Khan. Who cares? They tried to kill me! Let me talk to them. It is 
worse than when I left. This is what will become of the realms if we do not stop Dark Khan. Over there, Dark Khan's forces. Their commander approaches. I will speak with him, but be ready to fight. I'm Superman. We need to know your intentions. I am Raiden, God of Thunder. With me are the mightiest warriors in all the realms. We have come to challenge you in mortal combat. You will be defeated. Don't be so sure, Raiden. If you want to fight, you'll find my friends and I are up to the challenge. Hey, what's wrong? I can sense something. Something big. It's here! Dark Calm! through them, Raiden and his allies battled the invaders with a diabolical elation. But as the dust settled, it was clear that neither side had won. The few comrades still standing try to free themselves of the bloodlust. Darkon is heading to that fortress. We should follow him. An obvious course of action, but having been suggested by you, Shang Tsung, I must consider that you are leading us into a trap. You have good reason to doubt me. Long have I fought against you, but this time I swear, we fight together. No, you are in league with Dark Khan. You lured us to our doom. If we are to perish, then so shall you, sorcerer. This is the end, Shang Tsung. I will finish you! Raiden, stop! Shang Tsung is not the enemy this time! Step aside, Liu Kang! No! I will not let you kill him! Then you have turned your back on Earthrealm, broken your vow, and betrayed me! Fight! Round one. What have I done? You have wasted precious time. We must destroy Dark Khan, take the battle to his fortress. You are right, but this fight is mine alone. It was my lightning blast that created Dark Khan. Do not be a fool. You heard what Quan Chi said. We must fight together. No. The rage will only turn us against each other. I will face him alone. You! Alien! This is all your fault! Your stupidity created Dark Khan! Now the Earth is doomed! And people say I'm the villain! You are a villain, Lex! Not this time! This time, you brought ruin to the world! My world! You've ruined all my plans! And I'm going to make you pay! You've caused me trouble for the last time! 
Superman, stop! Back off! You're under the influence of rage. You have to fight it. My powers are finally returning to full strength, and this is where it ends, Luther! Now I'm going to finish you once and for all! If you're not going to fight it, then I'll beat it out of you. Superman! Clark, I know you can hear me. Look at yourself. Look at what you're doing. You're trying to kill me. Stay down, or I'll... If we lose here, if you lose to the rage, then the Earth is doomed. I'm not going to give up. I never give up, and neither do you. Bruce, I hear you. You're right. It was my mistake that created that thing. I have to stop it. Not alone. Darkseid himself nearly killed you. This Khan creature is much more powerful. Thank you, Bruce. Damn impulsive. Good luck. going to stop me. Superman. Raiden. The rest of your forces were defeated. So were yours. Nobody won here. Then it is between us now. That's fine with me. Round one. Fight! Raiden wins. destroy the earth. Against him. Sounds like a plan. Face each other or face me. It makes no difference. You will fight! <laughs> Round one. Fight! He's gone. 
The others have disappeared as well. The rage? It's gone! What is this place? Darkseid's throne room. The two universes must have separated. Everything's returned to... normal. You aren't Darkseid. I am Shao Kahn! And you will bow to me! What? Superman! He's gone. Shao Kahn's throne room. The realms have been restored. Anything like Shao Kahn, you will find no refuge here. Your fate will be decided by the Elder Gods. the Elder Gods, Raiden. <laughs> Their pathetic mortal combat shackles me no longer. Toothless worms. My venom spreads. It is the end of all things. Armageddon. Stop! It is done. Your time has passed. He must win.
Lord Raiden, what is wrong? Strange visions. Your amulet. It is nothing, Liu Kang. The tournament begins. Combatants, I am Shang Tsung. In the coming days, each of you will fight. Some are here of their own volition. Others were brought here by chance. Hey, beautiful. Johnny Cage. Good for you. What? Massive Strike? Citizen Cage? Ninja Mime? None of those ring a bell? Kano. Kano? Wasn't in that one. You participate in the most important Mortal Kombat in history. This tournament, the tenth after nine Outworld victories, will determine Earthrealm's fate. If you defeat all of your opponents, you will face one final challenge. Me. Huh. That old geezer's the final challenge? They might as well give me the belt right now. They do have belts, right? <clears throat> what? How did you... Appearances can be deceiving. Our first combatant will be Mr. Cage. Yeah. That's right. That's right. Who's it gonna be? Reptile. Nice stunt. Who's your agent? Begin! All right, it's showtime! Johnny Cage wins. He got caged. That's it. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm so pretty. And I'm taking you down, I'm taking you down, I'm taking you out, I'm taking you out, and I'm taking you out for dinner. <laughs> now for your second challenge, Mr. Cage. Baraka! Hmm, okay. Nice makeup. But is it really necessary? Whoa! They will taste your flesh. Johnny Cage wins. Man, I love those blades. My producer has got to meet you. We're doing Tommy Scissor Fists. Uh, and congratulations, Mr. Cage. Now, finish him! Finish him? <laughs> yeah, right. Kill him! Whoa, 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 wait a second. I'm not gonna kill anyone. Very well. The tournament! We resume at dawn. W what? That's it? Really? Now, where'd that hottie go? You fought well. Thanks. Nice hat. You should be more respectful of Lord Raiden. He is the protector of Earthrealm, the god of thunder. The Look, I, I don't know what kind of role-playing you guys are into, but count me out. This tournament is more than a chance for personal glory. We are fighting for the very survival of Earthrealm. What are you talking about? Your last opponent was Tarkatan. He was born with those blades. Yeah, those things are real. He represents Outworld. Had you lost, the Emperor Shao Kahn would have come one step closer to physically absorbing our world into his. Outworld, yeah, right, right. The Elder Gods created the Mortal Kombat Tournament to give Earthrealm a chance to defend itself. But if we lose this time, Shao Kahn will conquer all. Dun dun dun! Look, guys, I'm an actor. I saved the world for the cameras. If this emperor is really a threat, call the military. Me? I've got a date with a blonde. Ciao. What do you see in him? 
He is a hero, Liu Kang, though he may not yet know it. Triangulating your signal for evac, but it's... There is no island. I'm standing on it. Just lock onto my wrist comm. Understood. This is your current status. They have Jax, and if I don't fight in this crazy tournament, they'll kill him. I'm gonna try to... Need help? I specialize in rescuing damsels in distress. <sighs> you again. Listen, I've got serious problems here. I'm in no mood to be hit on by some movie star. Come on. A girl like you shouldn't be wandering around this freak show alone. Look, baby, I can't let you run loose without an escort. I don't need an escort, and I'm sure as hell not your baby. Johnny Cage wins. Ha-ha! <laughs> Not bad for a... girl. Look, sorry about that. I don't need your help. Fine, have it your way. I'll just leave you to your... problems. Good idea. Yeah. Now that he's softened you up, it's my turn. Not man enough for a fair fight. I don't do fair. Couldn't have done it without you. <laughs> SF is on the way. You won't get far. Oh, I got a knack for survival. You, on the other hand, are gonna die here. Yeah. Step away from the lady. Fans think my moves are all wire work and special effects. Truth is, I am the special effects. Johnny Cage wins. Throw that on your Barbie. Shrimp. Thanks. No problem. Who is that guy, anyway? His name's Kano. He was an informant in our Black Dragon investigation. Big time arms dealers. Turns out he was their leader, giving us the runaround. A lot of our guys got killed because of him. So that's not a costume? Your actual military? Special forces. Get out. So you know about this threat to the world stuff, right? Raiden called in the cavalry. Raiden? No idea who you're talking about. <sighs> Damn. He can't be far. He'll have to wait. I appreciate your help, Cage. Johnny. But right now I've got things to take care of. My CO is locked up on this island somewhere. I have to find him. Oh my god. What did they do to you? Run, girl. Run. Miss Blade. You do not disappoint. I have been expecting you. Let him go! We're not part of your tournament. On the contrary, you are very much a contestant. You will face Sub-Zero of the Lin Kuei Clan of Assassins. <laughs> now you will feel death's cold embrace. Done. We're leaving. Stand in my way and I'll kick your A challenge? <laughs> no. You will not be the one to challenge Shang Tsung. You want some too? Fine by me. 
Enough of this. Shield your eyes. What? Shield your eyes. Jax, come on, we're out of here. About time. You aided their escape. You allowed them to escape. They will not get far. Come on, Jax, move it! That's an order. Oh, so you're in charge now? Special Forces Command, this is Sonya Blade. Where's that evac? They are en route. Coming to you shortly. Affirmative. Almost home, soldier. By order of Shang Tsung, no one leaves this island. I don't have time for this. Out of my way. Ah! Ah! Yes! Sure don't need any more surprises like them. How are you holding up? I'm fine. Liar. After I get you to base, I'm coming back. Kano's still here somewhere. Your obsession with him is gonna get you killed. I trusted him. Yeah, we all did. But I was the one he used. I think our ride's here. Have a challenger, Kano. Ah. Pretty boy ain't gonna save you this time. Ah. Yes. You're coming with me. Kano is not your prisoner. At least help Jax. He needs a medic. <laughs> Bastard. <laughs> there she is. Sonia, you all right? Hey, looks like you found him. What's up, Sarge? He's a... Hey, what are you doing? It's okay. He's cool. What? Jax! Seriously, he's cool. That's amazing. Told you. Turns out he's a god. Thank you, Raiden. Gratitude is unnecessary. I have foreseen events, like memories of my future. They lead me to believe that you are all connected to Earthrealm's fate. What have you foreseen? In my visions, Shao Kahn becomes invincible. He destroys all life in Earthrealm. We will all die. I believe these flashes are a guide to defeating Shao Kahn, but disrupting the flow of time can have serious consequences. I'm not worried. I bet you can win this thing no problem. Unless directly challenged, I cannot participate. What should we do besides standing around looking pretty? For now, the tournament must run its course. All right then. We're with you, Raiden. will now begin. Scorpion, specter of the nether realm, resurrected by the sorcerer Quan Chi. Who among you is worthy of this challenge? Where is the Lin Kuei, Sub-Zero? He killed my family and clan. I will have his head. I know it is you, Kung Lao. The Shaolin monks chose Liu Kang to represent your order in this tournament. I am Liu Kang's equal. That remains to be seen. Watch and see. I accept the challenge. Kong Lao. Never mind the Lin Kuei. Now you face a Shaolin. You will regret your impulsiveness. Ah! 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 
wins. You are not yet a warrior. Kung Lao! Listen, when your elders speak, you could not win this fight. I have defeated the challenger, Shang Tsung. I demand Sub-Zero. You will demand nothing. Nightwolf! Your aggression is misplaced. What do you know of my... You are not the only one whose people have been victimized. But I have found new purpose in serving the spirits. I do not cling to the past. You no longer seek retribution. You dishonor your kind. I will honor the memory of my fallen. Scorpion wins. The spirits have forsaken you, Shaman. An impressive start. You waste my time, sorcerer. Restraint, Scorpion. You will fight Sub-Zero soon enough. Scorpion. I understand your desire for revenge. But Nightwolf is right. There are other ways in which you may find peace. Sub-Zero deserves death. Defeat Sub-Zero if you must, but do not kill him. I fear his death will give rise to a more treacherous foe. I will have my revenge. Spare Sub-Zero's life, and I will request that the Elder Gods return the Shirai Ryu to the realm of mortals. understand there are benefits to the Grand Master's plan, but his plan goes against Lin Kuei principles. We are Lin Kuei, Cyrax. We will obey the Grand Master's commands. It means giving up our free will, our souls. It will turn us into... Scorpion. Your inferior clan is dead. Soon you will join them. My clan may walk the Earth once more. A challenge! Scorpion versus Cyrax and Sector! Your obsession with Sub-Zero ends here. Scorpion wins. I will have my revenge, but I will not kill Sub-Zero. Will not. Or cannot. You. The Shirai Ryu are dead. You will suffer as they did. To hell with your clan. No, to hell with you! The Netherrealm. This is where I was reborn. This is where you will pay. Scorpion wins. I have avenged my family and clan. This is your retribution? Scorpion, kill him. I... I will not. He has been beaten. Have you forgotten? What is this? Clan, your family.
That is not me. Despite my efforts, my vision has come to pass. An unfortunate end, he once defended Earthrealm from the Netherrealm armies of Shinnok and Quan Chi. Scorpion will pay for this. Sub-Zero's fate is his own doing. His own doing? The Lin Kuei have a history of making ruinous choices. Such as the Cyber Initiative. I am among those speaking out against the Grand Master's plan. Surgically transform the Lin Kuei into glorified robots? It kills our intuition, our instincts. Did you speak out against the Lin Kuei's participation in this tournament? We were invited by Shang Tsung. He pays you to kill Earthrealm warriors. Betraying your own realm? I expect better, even from an assassin. My loyalty is to the Grand Master. Victory for Shang Tsung means the end of Earthrealm and the Lin Kuei. What are you doing? I am not here to fight you. I'm assigned to kill Johnny Cage. Shang Tsung no longer has need of you. What do you mean? He is terminating your agreement. And you. I need to have a talk with your master. Ugh! This fight is not over. You mean to finish me? You couldn't even stop the actor. Cyrax wins. Now this fight is over. Shang Tsung has turned on me. I need to find out why. Sector, we need to talk. Our hosts tried to have me killed. You were speaking with the Thunder God. Your indiscretion has jeopardized my plan. Cyrax is Lin Kuei. He will complete his task. We shall see. The next match will be Cyrax versus Johnny Cage. What, me? All right, then. Not everyone gets to rumble with a celebrity. Ready for your beatdown, sunshine? Here it comes. Cyrax wins. That should shut you up. Finish him! I won't kill him! Oh! You were commanded to kill Johnny Cage. You disobeyed. I eliminated him from the tournament. He didn't need to die. You have broken your oath. I used my judgment. The Cyber Initiative will eliminate insubordination. We are not machines, Sector. I chose to serve the Lin Kuei, but I will not surrender my free will. Cyrax wins. Tell the Grand Master I am finished. No one leaves the Lin Kuei. Combatants, I 
represent this latest creation of Shao Kahn. He is many warriors, their souls fused into one being. Behold! Ermac! unlike anything you have fought before. Liu Kang, you are the sole Earthrealm warrior to progress to this final stage of the tournament. I am ready. We are many. You are one. We will destroy you. <laughs> Liu Kang wins. Earthrealm will not fall into your master's hands. He is a greater threat than anticipated. I will ensure he does not reach the final challenge. Remember Bo Raicho's teachings. For my vision to be realized, you must not let emotion overpower you. Your visions? What causes them? My future self sent them to me, perhaps to ensure some outcome. Or to prevent one. <gasps> he must win! He must win. Those are my last words before I die. I believe it is you who must win. This amulet was forged by the Elder Gods. It cracked here in the present after my first vision. If we choose wisely, the future will be secured and the cracks healed. I trust you will make the right decisions. We must trust in the Elder Gods, Liu Kang. Shaolin. Liu Kang wins. I am impressed. Do it. Do what? Kill me. Why would I do that? I came to kill you. I have failed my father, my emperor. Shao Kahn is your father? I have disgraced him. You must kill me. I will not. This encounter never took place. You have disgraced no one. I hope we meet again, under different circumstances. opponent will be Scorpion I do not fear you demon fighting with Scorpion the sorcerer Quan Chi <laughs> As I said, I do not fear you. I pity you.
You have done well, but the tournament is not yet over. Goro. What's a Goro? Liu Kang, it has been years since an Earthrealm warrior has progressed this far. But the reigning champion is far beyond your ability. <sighs> to the lair with you! expect to fight in this tournament, but eventually, even the Shaolin produce a warrior worthy of the Shogun. I know who you are. I am ready for you. I will give you a warrior's death. Liu Kang wins. Flawless victory. It seems the Shaolin trained a warrior greater than the Shogun. One fight remains. Face me in mortal combat. So be it. Liu Kang wins. Say it. I concede. Who yes. is yeah. Well done, my friend. He has saved Earthrealm. failed me! 500 years I have waited. Now I must wait 500 more. My lord, all is not lost. Uh, curse the Elder Gods in their tournament. My I should lord. have taken Earthrealm by force. But I am bound by their rules. Rules that cannot be broken. My lord! Kill him! But what if the rules were changed? Katana! Continue.
do not understand why my amulet is further damaged. He must win. If not Liu Kang, then who? You got me. Not sure anybody could have done what he did. Made Shang Tsung look like a chump. Here to congratulate us on our victory, sorcerer? What? Shang Tsung? You have been revitalized, I see. I didn't realize your master was in the habit of rewarding failure. The Emperor has an offer, Raiden. A new tournament. <laughs> I see no reason to participate in any plan of yours. The Emperor proposes a single tournament to replace the current system of ten. It will be held in Outworld. If Earthrealm does not win, Outworld will absorb it. But if Earthrealm wins, Shao Kahn will abandon his claim to it forever. Give your Emperor my regards. what we must do. Uh, anybody get the number that... Wait, where's Sonya? Shang Tsung has taken her. We've got to find her. We must follow them. Shang Tsung has made it clear that Earthrealm will be under constant threat unless I agree to a new tournament. Another vision? Yes. I saw Liu Kang win the proposed tournament. I believe we must attend. But my earlier vision of your victory over Shang Tsung was not the solution I sought. Therefore, this premonition must show an event I need to change. Perhaps he must win refers to another. Hear me, Elder Gods. I accept the terms proposed by Shao Kahn. We go to Outworld. Soon that's the big man himself. The wrestler guy with the cow skull on his head? And why aren't the Kung Fu twins here helping us? I sent Liu Kang and Kung Lao to free their Shaolin masters. I expected Sonya Blade to be here with Shang Tsung. She better not have a scratch on her. Wait, this is a tournament! Ah, the Earthrealm delegation has arrived. And we have a volunteer for first combat. What? The tournament will begin! <laughs> Jackson Briggs, you will face Baraka! <laughs> And she do anything other than rescue one another? Your next opponent will be... What is it? Excellent. It seems I have a pressing matter to attend to. With the Emperor's permission, we will reconvene later. What was that all about? I think we should follow him. You okay? Sonya Blade. She is to be executed. My powers are compromised here in Outworld, but I will be able to transport us near enough to her.
Maybe you could try for even nearer next time. Where are we? I will inform you the instant I know. <sighs> Wish this damn tracking device worked in here. This is just like my movie Time Smashers. We were going around and... Give it a rest, will you? Making my ears hurt. So what's the deal with you and Sonya, anyway? She's smoking hot. It's not like that. I'm her CO. Honey like that under my command? Oh, I'd You'll want to stop talking now. But if it's not like that, then you won't mind if I... That's it! Time somebody shut you the hell up! Jax wins. How you like that, Mr. A-List? Enough! Jackson Briggs, you will restrain yourself. Yeah, well, I... Someone approaches. Good. Maybe somebody else needs their ass whooped. Looking for something? The armory is restricted. You will leave now. Gonna have to ask nicer than that. Jacks wins. Wrong place, wrong time, lady. Feel better? Um, listen, Cage. I... Don't worry about it. Guess we know where we are now, thanks to her. Yes, and where we must go. Let's do it. Oh, uh, uh... Come on, Cage. What is it with your Shokan and underground cesspools? If you had not dishonored yourself by attempting escape, we would not be here in the sewer. Sonya! Guards, stop them! So much for the surprise attack. property, human. She's nobody's property. I guess extra arms don't make a difference. You sure have a way with women. You know me. I'm a class act. Thanks. What took you so long? He was busy hitting me in the face. That's weird. I've got two sets of readings, heavy tech signals, both of them. Technology then they cannot be of Outworld. We need to confront the source of each signal. We might discover the one whose victory I must ensure. Wait, what about us? What are we, chopped liver? What? Perhaps you are right, Johnny Cage. You will stay close to me. Great, I... Close as a shadow, and twice as silent. Sonya, you're with me. Keeping my eye on you. Raiden? Looks like you want to teleport yourself about 30 clicks that way. We should stay together, Tundra. Assuming your brother's identity will certainly draw attention. Not all of it welcome. You are right, Smoke. But assuming Bihan's identity is the best way to honor him. Let us proceed then. Sub-Zero. We should separate. Our fellow Lin Kuei will not be far behind once our absence is discovered. If only they had been more forthcoming with the details of your brother's demise. We will find Shang Tsung. He will tell us all he knows. If he killed Bi Han, he will die. Be stealthful as the night. And deadly as the dawn. The Emperor was wise to send me here. The Lin Kuei do walk uninvited in his realm. Wise though your Emperor might be, he was foolish to send his housemaid to interfere with Lin Kuei business. I am Kitana, Princess of Outworld! And I deal harshly with sharp-tongued intruders. Smoke wins. Where there is smoke, there is fire. 
Sleep well, princess. <laughs> With a whole army toting these, no one in Outworld or Earthrealm can stand up to you. Well done. You may tell your fellow Black Dragon that I am very interested in your merchandise. Shang Tsung. I'll take care of him. No charge. One dead Lin Kuei in a tick. Smoke wins. Stay down. I would have words with your associate. Tell me what you know of Sub-Zero's death. What? Despite his failure at my tournament, I'll wager he was more powerful than you, Lin Kuei. Assuming his form will not give you his skill, Shapeshifter. Let us see if Smoke can freeze. Smoke wins. Now answer me. What do you know of Sub-Zero? <coughs> what? Smoke. You have disobeyed the directive to remain at the Lin Kuei Temple. Sector? You will return with us to begin your transformation. You actually did it. You're a cyborg. We are the Lin Kuei, more stealthful than the night, more deadly than the dawn. Smoke wins. I will never submit. There is great energy nearby. Um, Ray dude? They must not take him. Thank you, Lord Raiden. I am called Smoke. Why are you here in Outworld? To participate in a tournament to save Earthrealm. Join us, Smoke. Forgive me, but if Sector was searching for me, he is hunting Sub-Zero as well. Sub-Zero? Call me crazy with a K, but didn't we see him die? The Grand Master intends to turn every Lin Kuei into a cyborg. My friend is in danger. The tournament. I have a feeling your friend will be there. Then let us go. Sub-Zero's soul depends on it. A pity you could not have cooperated. You are ordered to return to the Lin Kuei Temple for assimilation. Cyrex! I am Lin Kuei Unit LK4D4. You will come with me. I'm sorry for what they did to you, but I will not comply. Sub-Zero wins. I will face the Lin Kuei when my task is done, not before. The readings were getting stronger and now they're gone. I... Sub-Zero? But you're dead. I am not the Sub-Zero you speak of. He was my brother. Your brother? I am only here to learn Sub-Zero's fate. He was killed by someone named Scorpion. Where would I find him? Try the Colosseum. That's where... You have disturbed our regeneration process. Jax. Ah. 
We will break you as well. Not if I break you first. Some zero wins. I remain whole for now. Sonia Blade to command. Sonia Blade to command. Do you read? You have stopped the bleeding. Yeah, but he needs a medic as soon as possible. I must go to the Colosseum. But I need your help to There's get There's a portal to... to the south. You can use it to transport yourselves back to Earthrealm. Mother... F that portal better be close. <clears throat> Father, you must kill me. Kill him. Katana, you will join me. Shao Kahn. I challenge Scorpion, the murderer of my brother. You will bring him before me. No one makes demands of the Emperor. Reptile! Sub-Zero wins. I would kill you. But that is not my purpose here. Your followers hold you in high esteem, Warlord. They fight and die for your amusement. My brother participated in this folly. I do so only to face his killer. And you shall. What is this? You are not Sub-Zero. I am his family and clan. I fight for his honor. He had no honor. You will die as he did. Sub-Zero wins. For my brother. No, you... Now interrupts the Emperor's tournament. Sub Zero? No! You cannot save him. Stay here, or they will take you as well. We request that we may return him to our temple for judgment. And what do I gain from granting this bold request? The Lin Kuei's loyalty and service. Very well. He is yours. The flow of time has been changed. I spared smoke this fate, only to watch this new Sub-Zero fall. No! I will not be turned! Katana! How is it that Earthrealm ninjas brazenly appear before me when my daughter, Princess of Outworld, was sent to intercept them? Father, be I... Be gone! Katana's faith is a slender reed bent before the storm. If it can be uprooted altogether. Sure, let's go ruin someone else's life. Is this how you show your loyalty, Jade? Katana, I... You follow me when I clearly wish to be alone. Then you upbraid me? I will not be scolded like some child. You need to be careful. I have never seen your father this angry with you. You are a princess. He expects more from you than I this. I know what he expects. We will talk later, when you are in more of a mind to listen. Princess Katana. I request an audio. Earthrealmers, 
You dare approach me. Hey, listen, honey. We don't want to fight, but we will if we must. You will learn respect. Kitana wins. Shao Kahn wants death to follow combat. I will give it to him. Perhaps Liu Kang was wrong about you. Or perhaps he sensed, as I do, that there is conflict within you. Thanks. Ow. You couldn't have seen that in one of your hot flashes? Something whispers to you that circumstances should be different. That you should be different. You are much more like Sindel than Shao Kahn. But she is dead. My mother is dead, yes. Why do you... You need answers, Katana. I can help you find them if you will trust in me. Go to Shang Tsung's flesh pits. Much will be revealed there. The flesh pits? But I am forbidden to... Yes, you are. And why is that? I don't know. Tell me... You must discover your true path alone. Show yourself, Jade. I know you're following me. Again? Following you still. I know where you're going. I am ordered to prevent you from going there. And why is that? I do not question the Emperor's commands. Katana, please, turn back. I cannot. This path might lead me to the truth. I'm sorry, Jade. But I will not allow you to stop me. Katana wins. I tried to warn you. This is something I have to do. She looks like... me. <gasps> Sister... <gasps> so pretty, so fair, so sad and alone. <gasps> Come, let us be a family. You are not my family. You are a monstrosity! That is no way to treat your sibling. Despicable swine! Do you think my father will stand for this... These... Abominations you have created here? I am merely perfecting you, princess. As difficult as that might be. Silence! I will drag you before Shao Kahn by your pointed beard! Kitana wins! Get up! You will stand before my father and confess your deeds. Ugh. I would not disturb you, father, if this matter were not of utmost importance. I felt you should know what Shang Tsung has been doing as of late. This conjurer has created horrid replicas of me, crossbred with Tarkatan blood. One was alive and attacked me. Well done, sorcerer. You know? You... approve? How could you? My own father! I am your emperor! Your father was a weakling, a dingy king. I annihilated him while merging his realm with Outworld, and took his queen as my wife. If only I had not allowed Sindel to convince me of your worth. But 
Now I have a true daughter. Raiden was right. You have lied to me my entire life. Escort her to the tower. I will make an example of her. Return to the flesh pits. Bring me my daughter. Melina. I failed you, Kitana. Now I will make amends. That is all of them. That is no toy! It belongs to Shang Tsung! We are finished. Return to your post. Stand aside. I will see Katana. No one enters the tower. You are an excellent guard dog, Baraka. But you must learn to heal. I do not take orders from you. Jade wins. Danians have no loyalty. Blind loyalty is not a good thing, as I have learned. You must keep your eyes open to anticipate the finishing blow. What are you talking about? <laughs> you make it too easy. My orders are clear. No one is allowed in the tower. As you can see, I am here. Here to help the princess escape. You would deny her execution? Only means of regaining her honor? We have very different concepts of honor, Shokan. Not much of a jailer, are you? Now then, your highness, let us see how quickly we can remove these bonds. Jade, I... I am too. Go, find Raiden. Ask for his help. That should distance me from any pursuers. <gasps> Others pursue. I find. By the gods, you are Melina. You must return with me. There's to be a celebration for my sister. She's going away. She wins. I am more of a sister to Kitana than you. I must find Raiden. He is here. Kitana turns away from Shao Kahn, so you attack her rather than join her? This is not Kitana. Smoke, stop! That is not Kitana. You will come no closer. Jade wins. I did not wish to do that. Lord Raiden, I come at the request Lord? Of I was with Smoke. I thought she was a bad guy. Uh, girl. Guess he turned another one. What's Raiden got that I haven't got? Godlike power? A personality that is not at all like sanding paper? Jerks. Kitana? Executed? Where is she? Held captive in the tower of Shao Kahn's fortress. I am will... not pleased with this outcome either, Liu Kang. But there is no time. We must return to the tournament. But you are responsible for her capture! You persuaded her to turn against Shao Kahn! Lord Raiden, we can free her as others fight in our stead and join you thereafter. Very well. We will meet you at the Colosseum. I hope your girlfriend is worth Lord Raiden's anger, Liu Kang. Notice that I am ignoring you. Hmm. They must have relocated Katana. We have indeed. We knew someone would come for her. May you join her in death. Be thankful I choose not to spill your tainted blood. Who are you? There is 
something familiar. Do you need help? Four arms against two is hardly a fair fight. Liu Kang? You have had your match against Liu Kang. Now you will face me. Kung Lao wins. Now if you have any honor left, you will tell us where Katana is. She has been taken to the Colosseum, where she has no doubt been executed. Lie! She may yet live. Let us go. There's Katana. I must free her. Not now. Smoke and Johnny Cage have been defeated, and I no longer sense Jackson Briggs or Sonya Blade's presence in Outworld. Despite my doubts as to whether you are Earthrealm's savior, you must fight. But I am not he who must win. Raiden! Put forth a worthy champion. If you can. Perhaps you are meant to be the victor. You will face Shang Tsung <laughs> and Quan Chi. No Earth Realm war stop this deadly alliance. On that, we agree. Kung Lao wins. It is done! No, Kung Lao. Not nearly so. For Kung Lao, the Shaolin, and Earth Realm. have spoken. Earthrealm is free of Shao Kahn forever.
but the price of victory was almost too steep to pay. Kung Lao's death is my fault. I encouraged him. Our triumph was not meant to be achieved in this way. I see now. He must win refers to you. But to prevent Armageddon, you needed to defeat Shao Kahn, not Chang Sung. It cannot be. Shao Kahn is dead. Yet the future remains unchanged. Shao Kahn is finished. Melina is his heir. She should rule. Melina? She exists only because of my sorcery. And you breathe because I restrain mine. Ember! You live! I am not so easily killed. Quan Chi accelerated my recovery. Emperor, I... Not one word. Because of you, Outworld can no longer merge with Earthrealm. There may yet be an alternative, Emperor. Invasion. Uh, invasion? Do you mock me? Sindel's ward prevents me from setting foot in Earthrealm. Have you considered why your wife and Empress chose to betray you in this particular fashion? Of course. But even after millennia, her motives are a mystery. She realized that the safeguards afforded by the Elder Gods through mortal combat are but fiction. She sacrificed herself to give protection the Elder Gods could not. So Earthrealm could not suffer as had Edania. Indeed. I have mastered the spells necessary for her resurrection. Her ward will be nullified, and with it, the barrier that prevents your entry into Earthrealm. I will return her to you, of course. You will find her much more cooperative. This is a very magnanimous offer. I wish only to serve, Emperor. I am weary of sorcerers, Quan Chi. Prove your worth. Bring her to me. Sindel. Quan Chi? Shao Kahn looks forward to your return. The Emperor, yes. What of Kitana? Kitana now allies herself with Earthrealm. Then she is no longer my daughter. Take me to Shao Kahn. Yes, Empress. The invasion of Earthrealm can now begin. Base, Eagle 2, we count 18. 1-8 one bogey, southbound on Olympic. Roger that. Eagle 2, out. This is not happening. Not what I was thinking when I swore to protect and serve. What is that? I'm thinking shoot first, ask questions later. Fine with me. Freak show. Striker wins. 
spitting, sticking out your tongue? Bet your mama's real proud. Come on, we're going street level. We've been compromised. It ain't safe down there. Better there than here. Check her out. What do you think? Friend or foe? Foe. Dressed like that? Definitely foe. Cover me. Hey, what are you doing out here? <laughs> Looking for a new playmate. Strike. You're coming with me. Who... Who are you? You all right? Johnny Cage fighting a giant monster? What is this, Time Smashers? That guy just shot lightning from his hands. How'd he do that? No idea. <laughs> Spread out. Give him multiple targets. <laughs> Less ugly when they burn. Striker wins. Never knew I had it in me. Cabal! Base! Eagle 2! No Eagle 2. Need medevac, current position. Cabal is down. Third degree burns. Medevac unit routing to you. What the? Say again? The Emperor will have your soul. Yeah, come and get it. Strike win. I think I'll be keeping my soul. I have been searching for you, Curtis Stryker. Well, you found me. Who are you? I am Nightwolf. Lord Raiden is gathering Earth's defenders. You are among them. What the hell are you talking about? Raiden leads Earth's defense against these outworld invaders. He is our best hope for survival. Yeah, well, Earthrealm Defender is about ten steps above my pay grade. I see you doubt yourself, even after you. What? Where is he? Medivac hasn't been here. Perhaps he has gone to find help. Nah, he was way too banged up. Someone took him. Easy there, mate. You've had a rough one. Kano? <laughs> In the flesh. I was... 
on fire. Burned to a crisp you were. Good thing I found you. Uh, I'm hideous. Shang Tsung's magic healed the rest of you, but your lungs... Eh. Take it off. Can't. It's permanent. What? No mask, no breathing. I'm a freak. Go on, give him a whirl. I don't use those anymore. Yeah, you're all proper police now. The Black Dragon ain't the same without you, mate. You should come back. We're in the money on this war. You sold those monsters their firepower. Guilty as charged. This is your fault! What are you on about, eh? You're here, ain't you? I should be dead. Now you're gonna be. Cabal wins. Now, how do I get out of here? Not so keen on being dead now, are you? How do I get out of here? <laughs> Good luck. No one gets out of Outworld without Shao Kahn say so. Outworld? Shao Kahn? Shao Kahn's a big boss round here, and soon, Earth's new master. Where is he? Don't bother. You can't get near him. No, but I'm guessing you can. What is this? Raiden has killed Motaro. That's him, Raiden. on the throne. You're a right genius, you are. It's no great matter. I will go to Earthrealm to finish Motaro's work. Yes. Shang Tsung. Yes, Emperor. The Empress requires something of you. <laughs> See there. I'm thinking he's a bit much. I can take him. a freak. Quan Chi, seal the portal. Time to go. Says who? Sub Zero, Unit LK520. <laughs> you say that like it means something. As you will soon discover. Cabal wins. <laughs> Not as cool as you thought. Why do you turn on your brother, Lin Kuei? That is not my brother. He's machine. I'm human. You do not appear human. Don't let the mask fool you. The ball wins. Starting to feel like the old days, only faster. Sub Zero. You have great power indeed, Cabal. Wait. You're the lightning guy. You help Striker. Striker, is he? He is safe. He has joined us in the fight against Shao Kahn. We would welcome your aid also. Sub-Zero. That which made him Sub-Zero no longer exists. He is my friend. What they did to him. It is... hideous. You're right. We gotta help him if we can. 
Sub-Zero? Can he hear me? You should. Sub-Zero. Yes, Smoke. How do you feel? Uh, what is it? I remember... the things I have done for Shao Kahn. He cannot be allowed to merge the realms. Aoka, hey, how can Sub-Zero best help us? I do not know. My attempts to alter future events have had negative consequences. Sub-Zero should never have undergone this transformation. Enlisting him may only further divert the flow of time. We need intel, right? Let's send him back to Outworld undercover. They will be unaware of my defection. I could deceive them. Killed him in Earthrealm. He should have been saved for interrogation. He was formidable. I had no choice. Follow me. We must lead a new mission. What mission brings us here? I have scanned your neural net 520. Your neural modulators have been recalibrated. Impossible. The experience has been deleted from your system. Remove your access panel. <laughs> your programming has been corrupted. My soul was corrupted. Now it is cleansed. <laughs> Flawless victory. Artificial enhancements are no substitute for the human soul. Finally! Come on, we gotta get him to the graveyard at St. Dominic's. On your feet, all of you! For what purpose? Don't care, really, so long as I get paid. He said on your feet. Come on, up, get up! Hey, what it does! I will help you. Treachery will be punished! Sub-Zero wins. All those teeth and claws yet still overmatched.
further feed the hot world. Sub-Zero. You are not so fearsome. Oh my yeah. god. Thanks. I thought we were done. I must go. I need to investigate the graveyard. We'd go with, but we have to return to our unit. That is for the best. Good luck, man. <laughs> he ain't gonna need luck. Raiden, what is it? What did you see? One of Shao Kahn's Solnados, on a scale I thought unimaginable. All of Earthrealm's souls imprisoned, absorbed by Shao Kahn, multiplying his power. That is what Sub-Zero has found? No matter my efforts, the future remains in peril. How could I have failed Earthrealm? Do not lose faith in the spirits, Raiden. They will guide you, protect you. Sub-Zero, we will disrupt the Solnado. I will be there momentarily. Hurry! The spell appears to be nearly complete. Who is that? The one King of Warner. He is mine. You. You are not worthy of the name Sub-Zero. Who are you to judge? I wore those colors before you. Bi Han? Yes, Kwai Liang. It is I. Quan Chi restored me. Restored? You and I both. We are flawed copies of our former selves. I have no flaws. Quan Chi has perfected me. For what end? To serve the Nether Realm and Outworld? It suits my purpose. The brother of We God. share blood. You're not brothers. Then I will not regret your defeat. Sub-Zero wins. You are right. We are not brothers. Ratna Sumbing Natargo. O Ta Shen Until the end. Night wins. Your time is over. But how do we know? 
Raiden could be having visions of possible futures, not THE future. Sonya's right. Was I supposed to have my arms replaced with these, or was it caused by interfering with the timeline? My head hurts just thinking about it. This isn't helpful. We cannot second-guess our decisions. Raiden, what are your thoughts? Raiden? Yes, that is best. What is our next objective? Nightwolf! It is done. Earthrealm souls are safe. No! Oh, is it not enough? I must speak with the Elder Gods. Shao Kahn's violation must be punished. But the battle is joined here, in Earthrealm. We cannot win without the Elder Gods. But, Master... Liu Kang, close as a shadow. Nightwolf, you will lead until we return. As you wish, Hyoka. Well, now what? Standing around here won't do us any good. Wait! The Lin Kuei, they surround us. So much for standing around. Attack! My speed and skill are beyond me. Nightwolf wins. Mere speed and skill will not win this war, Cyrax. You awake, Smoke. Now do you understand the power of the Grandmaster's vision? You are no match for the power of the spirit. Nightwolf wins. Perhaps even you can be saved. <laughs> what is it? But the Lin Kuei could not! Let's do this. Attack! I am no longer your mother. Mother, this is not your way. Shao Kahn has corrupted you. Shao Kahn has resurrected me. You have betrayed him, embraced a pathetic cause. Remember Edenia, mother. 
Remember your rule before Shao Kahn's invasion. Quiet, child. It is time for you to join your friends. <laughs> Monster! Still alive? No matter. Soon you will reunite with your ancestors. Nightwolf wins. Now, Sindel, face the spirit's judgment. <laughs> Tunkasila! Moisisiello! Simalayu, Omakiyo. Raiden. Raiden. Where are you? Elder gods, I beseech you. Earth realm is in danger. We are aware of your plight, Raiden. Then you must intervene on Earth realm's behalf. We cannot. But Shao Kahn, Liu Kang has bested him twice, yet he still... Shao Kahn has not violated the rules of mortal combat. What? He invades Earthrealm as we speak! Invasion is not itself a transgression. It is the merger of realms that is proscribed. A distinction without a difference! Innocents are dying at the hands of Outworld! It is regrettable. But the Mortal Kombat tournaments are not intended to prevent certain outcomes. They are intended only to maintain balance among the realms. Please, you must... We have spoken. The last doors are closing. We are nearly trapped. is mine, shaman. Not if I take it from you. To Godzilla. <laughs> By the Elder Gods. Katana! Liu Kang... You were right. I wish we had met... under... different... circumstances. Katana! Dead. Liu Kang, I... We abandoned them. And they're dead. My heart, too, is heavy with their sacrifice. Their deaths achieve nothing! What is next, Raiden? Tell me the future! How do we honor their sacrifice? I climb to heaven. Now I must plunge into the depths. I will go to Quan Chi, ally our realm with his against the forces of Outworld. What? Grovel before Quan Chi? What will he demand? What price will be paid? Would any price be too high to save Earthrealm? I had prayed it not true. But you have gone mad, Raiden. Your visions... They are nothing. Delusions of an addled mind. Liu Kang, please. Enough. I must help the wounded. 
leave on your hopeless quest. May the Elder Gods protect you. Disappoints me to see you here. Save your pity. I will have an audience with Quan Chi. You may address me. I will inform him. Is this why you chose not to save your family and clan? To maintain your place at his feet? Do not talk of my family, Raiden. Fetch your master, Scorpion. I must speak with him. You speak only with me. Now, Scorpion, fetch your master. You seek an audience. I seek cooperation between Earthrealm and the Netherrealm. Losing the battle, are you? We will prevail, but with the Netherrealm fighting at our side... You lie poorly, Raiden. Earthrealm's defenses are overwhelmed. You have mere hours. Name your terms. What do you offer? I offer... I offer the souls of Earthrealm warriors who die in this conflict. <laughs> they would agree. You are a cavalier with other men's souls. Not just others! I offer my own soul as well. If I die, you will have it. How noble, Raiden. Yet utterly pointless. No! You see? Their souls are already mine. Shao Kahn's payment for Netherrealm's allegiance. No! This was not meant to be! Earthrealm has lost, Raiden. Now so shall you finish him. As you command, my master. Wins. May the Elder Gods watch over you. The Elder Gods cannot help them. Their souls are mine. Kitana, Nightwolf, Kong Lao. You sealed our fate in this place, Thunder God. You have condemned us all! Wins. Curse you, Quan Chi. Zhao Kahn's victory is nearly complete. Soon he will arrive in Earthrealm. No! The Elder Gods cannot allow it! The Elder Gods are toothless. Your world is near destruction, yet they do not act. They must! Only through mortal combat may Zhao Kahn merge the realms. Lest he face the judgment of the Elder Gods. Lest he face the judgment of the Elder Gods. He must win. It is you who face judgment, Raiden. Thank you, Quan Chi. I now know what must be done. empty-handed, I see. Liu Kang! Liu Kang, I now realize what we must do. We must allow Shao Kahn to merge the realms. That is insane. The Elder Gods forbid it without victory in mortal combat. When he does, the Elder Gods' fury will fall upon him. Defeating Shao Kahn before the merge is but temporary. He will return, bringing Armageddon. I have foreseen it. Enough, Raiden! I say, have faith in the Elder Gods. Have faith in me. Liu Kang, I cannot let you fight Shao Kahn. 
then you are my enemy. Red wins. Liu Kang, do not interfere. So be it! By the gods, no! No. This was not meant to happen. What did you do? Liu Kang, forgive me. You... Have killed us. Oh. Oh. Come on, it's up to us. <laughs> Come to your senses. Earthrealm citizens suffer. Further resistance serves no purpose. All these ages you have fought me. You denied me my rightful claim. Not this time. <laughs> me no longer. Ages wasted in foolish resistance. I have won. Yes. You have won. Now, Raiden, your world ends. Shao Kahn, you merge realms without victory in mortal combat. Our penalty is clear. <laughs> An anemic effort from ineffectual deities. Today, I become the Elder God. Red wins.
is over. Only at the gravest of costs. So many are gone. Their light has sunk into the earth. I am responsible for their loss. You did what you had to, to protect Earthrealm. Losses in war are, are inevitable. Come, let us tend the fallen. Then we must help our realm rebuild. Our work has only just begun. Lord Shinnok. Shao Kahn was blinded by rage. How easily he was convinced that the Elder Gods would ignore his merging the realms. Yet the Thunder God still lives. No matter. Neither Earth Realm nor Outworld can now withstand the Nether Realm's onslaught. It is time. Soon I will be free. Earth Realm and Outworld. Millions of years ago, Shinnok, one of the Elder Gods, turned on his fellow deities and invaded the Earth Realm. Raiden and the Elder Gods stopped Shinnok, locked him up in the Nether Realm. Others followed in Shinnok's footsteps, like Outworld's Emperor Shao Kahn, who was obsessed with conquering Earthrealm. So Raiden convinced the Elder Gods to enact the Mortal Kombat tournament as a way to even the odds, give Earthrealm a chance. For generations, Shao Kahn followed the Elder Gods' rules. The war moved to the arena where he sent his toughest fighters to challenge Raiden's greatest defenders in Mortal Kombat. Two years ago, we beat him. But Shao Kahn wasn't ready to lose. He violated the rules of Mortal Kombat and invaded Earthrealm. Most of Earth's defenders, our friends, were killed turned into evil undead warriors. Despite the odds, we stopped Shao Kahn's invasion. As punishment, the Elder Gods destroyed him. We thought the long nightmare was over, but it turns out that Shinnok had been manipulating events. Shao Kahn's invasion, his death. All part of Shinnok's plan to escape the Nether Realm and resume his war on the Elder Gods. down nice and easy for me. Don't I always? If by always you mean not once. 
Major? All right, you have the rendezvous coordinates, far into the forest. From there, we access the portal to Raiden's Sky Temple. Where there's an angry former elder god and his devils waiting for us. Gods, portals, flying demons. Blind guys with magic swords. The world has changed. For the worse, if we do not expel Shinnok from Raiden's Temple, he means to poison Earthrealm's life force, the Jinsei. And we're not gonna let that happen. Kenshi and I appreciate the Major allowing us to join you. We're happy to help kick Shinnok's bony ass back to the Netherrealm. Getting a little ahead of yourself, aren't you? What happens to everyone? Gotta get back to the chopper. Sonia, get out of there! was unpleasantly cold. Didn't know you were such a fan. I liked it better when we fought on the same side. <coughs> you okay? We fared better than the men. Add him to the list of things Shinnok will answer for.
must re-fortify the portal's defenses below. No, Fujin. It is too late. The mighty gods of Earthrealm. You be foul of these hallowed grounds, Quan Chi. Be gone! Surely you are pleased to see your friends. You abandoned them to their deaths. I returned them to life. A life worse than death. One you will soon share. And my lord himself shall witness your fall. Nightwolf! The real Jax wouldn't punch his best friend. Johnny Cage, killing you will be a pleasure. Yes. Enough's enough, big guy. We're gonna fix you someday. Well, nice seeing them again. Sonia, that's not him. Sergeant, what is it? That the elevator? Yes, the elevator. Sento contains the souls of my ancestors. They guide me. Could they hurry the hell up? You guys stay here. Close the door. Look at the reach! You 
you see it now, Raiden? Your legacy. You poison their hearts with hope. And what do you offer? The same as you did millennia ago, when you betrayed your fellow Elder Gods and attacked Earthrealm. We stopped you then, imprisoned you in the Nether Realm. We will do so again. Remove the shadow from the light. The shadow grows. The legacy of life is death, Raiden. My followers accept this and live on. They fight for me. the Jinsei. Oh, I will. And all of Earthrealm will learn the truth of death. Oh, sorry, ma'am. Didn't see you there. Miserable wretch! Insignificant speck of feculent scum! How dare you! <laughs> that is mine! <laughs> Ready? As always. She will be the first to join me. No! I'm not sure what just happened to me, but I am sure of this. You don't even think of hurting her. You really are a fallen Elder God. Johnny Cage, the amulet! Enjoy the new digs, Gramps. Sonia? Johnny... Did we...? Yeah. We got him. Remain here. The Chamber's properties will heal Sonia Blade in short order. Quan Chi and the others, they're gone. A surge of power within the chamber overwhelmed my senses. We can deal with Quan Chi later, Kinshi. We've netted a bigger prize this day. Shinnok's amulet. 
And within it, old Fishface himself. Let us take the amulet to the Elder Gods. They cannot destroy it. No one can. They might offer counsel. Shinnok can never escape. The war is not over. Quan Chi has escaped. Why are you smiling? She called me Johnny. Raiden told me later that I'm descended from some Mediterranean war cult. Bred as warriors for the gods. I've never been able to resummon that green halo. Raiden thinks it was triggered when I saw a loved one about to die. <laughs> How about you, Cassie? Can you summon anything like that? Or did it skip a generation? Take it easy, Jin. We didn't need a halo in Darfur. Or Iran. Or Kurdistan. Did we, Jackie? Nope, we didn't. Shaolin monks ever send you there, Jin? I've seen plenty of action. Takeda and I both. Stuff that blow your special forces mind. F At ease. You're all here because you deserve to be. You're beautiful and unique snowflakes. Now, as I'm sure you're unaware, judging from the lack of gift cards, today is our team's six-week anniversary. Secretary Blake says he's pleased with our progress. You could spit in his hair and he'd be pleased with our progress. He was smart enough to have Mr. Cage put this team together. I'm glad the Shira Ryu chose me to join. New places, new faces. As the secretary pointed out, us older folks are gonna retire someday. So it's time for your generation to step up. Shaolin, Shirai Ryu, SF, together. For your team's first mission, you're going to the Lin Kuei Temple. We haven't heard from the Grand Master in a while, so we need to make sure he's still on our side. That he's got our backs if things flare up again with Outworld. You need to bring him in, but don't be surprised if Sub-Zero's not willing to cooperate. Why be worried about Outworld? I thought Kotal Khan respected the Reiko Accords. He does, but he's facing a civil war. The Rebels win, those Accords will be history. The expression? It's not worth the dirt on my shoe. Koto Khan has always bargained with you fairly, you know. Sure, sure. I'm just saying. Upgraded weapons, my intel, and poof. The long outworld civil war. Done. Might be nice to kick back a bit, eh? You know Melina's location. And a whole rebel army. It's got to be worth at least 50. I must attack her immediately. End this conflict. As you say, it drains us. Right. Do we have a deal? What is it, Devora? The Emperor should not be concerned. Accident ahead. This one will clear it. Make way for Kotal Khan! Move! The Tarkatans are in position. We await your order. It is given, dearest Tanya. Stopping a carriage is nothing. Killing an emperor... False emperor! ...requires power. Power you have, Melina. And won't use. It pains me to use it, Rain. I need more time. The usurper's excursion came too soon. The rain falls when it may. No matter. If Kano does what I paid him to do. Now! Do it!
You said a mouthful. Wind and air? Keep your 50 million. Melina's given me twice that to take you out. I <laughs> pray for the Kong's mercy. You're not worth the dirt on my shoe. I'm pleased you remember me, Koata. I will never forget those who freed Melina. She vowed to create a free Edinia, something you refused to do. A united outworld stands strong against its enemies. It will never be united under your rule. Your rebellion is all that prevents it. You are a fool to trust Melina. She tasks me for the last time. Melina. Kano was to kill you, miserable snake! Bro, not day! Another Adenian, the supposed half god. Kogatia! I am a son of Argus. I was not merely declared a god by befuddled commoners, Bulak. Surely Melina suspects your true intentions, son of Argus. My intentions are to teach you the difference between pretension and godhood. <laughs> My little mouse. That should silence you.
You won't touch him again. But I will. As the heir to my father, Shao Kahn, I, Melina, Kahnam of Outworld, order your execution! <laughs> your sacrifice honors me. There will be an execution this day. You will atone for your descent, Melina. Your blood will make right. Up the stair path. To the fire's edge. <laughs> A mere cub, grown to be a jaguar. Once we hit the drop point, we split up. Jackie and I will come in from the south, you two from the west. Rendezvous here, the north entrance. Then what? A simple pick up and go? We bag him if he resists. Resistance might be more possible than you think. Don't sweat it. It comes to that, Sub-Zero won't know what hit him. The forward defenses stand down as you command, Grandmaster. It is confirmed. Four intruders. It is time to entertain our guests. All right, I've got point. You and Jin, that side. Move! Ready? You! I need to s You are not welcome here. State your intentions. Grandmaster, we need you to come with us. My name is Sergeant- oh, no. You demand my cooperation, yet you are cut off, surrounded. What will you do? My father always spoke highly of you, Sub-Zero. He wants to talk. Talking. Always his first choice. Okay. Let's try pummeling. Now! Wait! <laughs> Cassandra Cage. You lead this group, but they do not follow. What would your mother do? Stop wasting time and take you down. Lack focus. You are more like your mother than you think. should have revealed my intention, Takahashi Takeda. No doubt Kenshi taught you how to use them. My father taught me a lot, Grandmaster. Let us see. 
lack of conviction. You are not your father. Not yet. Huh? Damn it. You announced your arrival, Jacqueline Briggs. Specialist Briggs. Yes, military decorum is important in your family. <laughs> If you know my father, you know me. Thought you and he were friends. Our histories share a dark chapter. <laughs> Cannot evade me. Do not judge yourself harshly, Specialist Briggs. <laughs> <laughs> rather than mock your superiors. I'll remember that, in case I ever meet one. False bravado does not suit you. Any ideas? Sub-Zero, let's talk. That opportunity has passed. Got a new plan, Cage? You could have followed the old one, Jin. You're gonna catch hell if you kill us. Yes, I suppose so. Chuo, Dang Jin! That worked? This was all a, a... A training exercise. Damn. I should have seen it. You and your friends show much promise, Cassandra Cage. But until you function as one, you will fall short. So other than that, you enjoyed your visit? The Lin Kuei shredded us. You, maybe. I see plenty of frozen boot prints on your ass, too. Come on now. You're all winners in my book. New orders from General Blade. Priority one, Outworlders. Here in Earthrealm. An invasion? Couldn't be. You're not afraid, are you, Mr. Cage? Outworlders, I can handle. So when did they show up? The portal opened by the docks a few hours ago. Nearly 5,000 in all. Refugees. From the Outworld Civil War. Must be bad if they risk coming to Earthrealm. After you. Do not dwell on your encounter with the Lin Kuei, son. Pretty hard not to. Thanks, Kenshi. Could you and Mr. Cage join us? Sergeant Cage, you and your team as you were. This is Li Mei. She seeks asylum for her people in Earthrealm. Our village, Sando, was the epicenter of a fierce battle. We barely escaped with our lives. Such is war. I mean, no offense, but you outworlders kind of live for that, right? This was different. The rebels, Melina, had a weapon unlike anything. Entire battalions erased. It was not honorable, not combat. Tell me more about the weapon. A talisman, gold, with a center jewel. Melina wields its crimson energy without precision. 
Well, that's good then. Not now, Sergeant Cage. It is enough that she possesses it. It turns the tide in her favor. The Emperor grows desperate, and those caught in the middle pay the price. If this talisman is what I suspect it to be, we may all pay a price. We talking about Shinnok's amulet? Can't be. The base, the vault, your wardings. SF, Shaolin, no way anyone can get past all that. I must be certain. Well, this is cozy. You remind me of an Earthrealmer who crossed over with us. He also found humor in everything. Handsome guy, right? He was an Earthrealmer. One of his eyes glowed red. What does she mean? Kenshi, continue with Lee Mei. I'm going to the refugee camp. Gotta get to him before he finds a way out. I'll come with. Go get an update on camp security from Colonel Flagg. Why? Because then you won't be here. Are we with you? No. I need to confirm with Kotal Khan that Lee Mei's story is true. You and your team are going to Outworld. I don't know. I expected the sky to be purple or something. Don't believe everything you see online. And what makes you an expert? The Shaolin Archives. I studied a lot about Outworld. No substitute for experience. So what makes you our leader? Guys, let's stick to the mission. Lee Mei has to be telling the truth. An invasion would violate the Reiko Accords. Because you can always trust an Outworlder. But if Outworlds are ally, why didn't they help us during the Netherrealm War? Against Quan Chi and his team of... Revenants? Like Jackie's dad? Asshole. It's not an alliance, not an aggression pact. Outworld is not our ally. A point you might make with more subtlety, given your surroundings. Now state your business, including a reason why we shouldn't kill you. I can read you. You're not from Outworld. I'm from Earthrealm, like you. But my employer, Kotal Khan, is from Outworld. So now I'm from Outworld. State your business. We're emissaries. We need to talk to Kotal Khan. Here, we have Raiden's official seal. I can buy one of those at that stall right over there. Look, you can arrest us, even kill us. But if we're telling the truth, you probably get a pay cut. Or worse. You take us to the Khan, I'll tell him you took us down. Maybe you get a bonus. You can't lose. Follow me. In these times of war, we are required to view every resource as a weapon for our Emperor to use at his discretion. To take without his leave is to steal from the hand of Kotal Khan himself. Therefore, having been found guilty of theft, you shall be put to death. I was hungry. Your sentence will be carried out immediately. Death? For petty theft? Remember where you are. Jin? Get out of here! Go! I knew I shouldn't have listened to you. A lesson in trust from a mercenary. Here's another learning opportunity. Fuck it off! I'm a quick learner.
them. <laughs> Let's play, Tor. <laughs> you couldn't just ask for a pony like every other girl? The archives never mention symbiotes. Love to learn more about you. Too bad you're insane. You guys all right? <laughs> The Earth Bombers, yes. This one must learn more of your diplomatic techniques. We're here to see Kotal Khan. General Blaze. You interfere with outworld matters. The penalty is death. I'm sensing a theme. But, as we honor the Reiko Accords, we will consult the Emperor. You will await him here. You want to take this opportunity to tell us what the fuck shit you were thinking? I gotta wonder why you'd risk interrealm war for a bread thief. Because not all thieves are irredeemable. It has more sentimental than monetary value. Nevertheless, I would prefer you did not steal it. It's a family heirloom. One that shouldn't have been given to you. Your family honored me with this memento of your cousin Lao. After his death. A death you caused! You made him fight Shao Kahn! And stood there while that bastard snapped his neck! You go too far, Kung Jin. No. Not far enough. Just let me go. Blood of Kung Lao. Descendant of the great Kung Lao. A common thief. Did you think you could walk unimpeded into my temple? And walk out again? Without my complicity? You wanted me to attack you. Why? To release your anger. Make you amenable to reason. And make me feel like shit. Self-loathing has always been an unfortunate part of your makeup. There lies ahead a brighter path. One that will truly honor your ancestors. One that is worthy of you. Go to the Wuxi Academy. Join the Shaolin. Like Kung Lao before you. I can't. They won't 
Except... They care only about what is in your heart, not whom your heart desires. It's too late for me. It is never too late, Kung Jin. Your news of refugees is troubling. Their exodus to Earthrealm was not known to me. I do know this. I invited no guests from Earthrealm. Certainly none who would disrupt the execution of justice. How do I know you are not allied with Melina? Perhaps her newfound power has earned her new friends. Friends? No. No, we're not even sure that Shinnok's amulet she has- She employs Shinnok's amulet against me? The very item Earthrealm swore would be safe in its care? When Outworld was offered no participation? We were under attack, not Outworld. Odal Khan, the fire that burns the sun. We are here because we share your concerns about the missing item. We intend no ill against your rule. At least one Earthrealmer can forge words like silver. But I recall an Earthrealm expression. There is more honor among thieves than diplomats. I've had the questionable fortune to be both Emperor, but I'm telling you the truth. You are allied with Melina. You may carry out your sentence. Kotal Khan, under outworld law, I claim the right of defense by combat. What? You're gonna fight a duel? To absolve us of all accusations. Denying the request brings dishonor upon the accuser. You know much of outworld. No, also, the duel ends in death. You have won nothing. Merely a few more seconds of breath. And now, Emperor? The charges against you are void. I say to all that Earth Realm means outworld no harm. Now kill me. Be done with it. You're not actually gonna. Instead of your life, I claim your service. If Melina does have the amulet, we can get it from her more easily if we work together. Emperor, they cannot be trusted. Devora, can you not perceive I am indebted to them? You honor us, Kotal Khan. Our gratitude is wide like the ocean. I'll talk to General Blade. Tell her about our new... arrangement. Thanks for the heads up, Sergeant. Stay with Kotal Khan. We'll figure out next steps once I've got Kano locked down. Yes, ma'am. Cage out. He's still here. I can feel it. Report. One of the refugees. Found her near the north perimeter. That's one of Kano's necktops. Inform Lee May. Tell her we're investigating. Raiden, what'd you find? Shinnok's amulet has been stolen, replaced by an exquisite duplicate. Damn it. Something is wrong. I will speak to you once I... Raiden? Raiden! Lieutenant, I need you to take a team to Fort Charles. Check in with Raiden and report back. What's going on? What's your update from Colonel Flagg? He said, why are you bothering me? And I said, because my ex-wife is a pain in it. Where are you going? You can't just walk away. I'm in this too. Not my decision. Thank your buddy, Secretary Blake. This is what split us up in the first place. You disappear in your work, 
Never time for me and Cassie. I had responsibilities. Sorry you couldn't be the center of attention. There was a time when you cared more about your family than your job, General. Nope. No evil sorcerers in here. Would you get serious? Quan Chi needs to clean up his man cave. It's cleaner than yours. You're comparing me to Quan Chi? Only in terms of cleanliness. What's this? I wouldn't do that. Aw, oh, come on. Where's your sense of... adventure? You wish for adventure? You shall have it. Fire! I have no need of your soldiers, but you and Mr. Cage will serve me well once you are dead. Not as tough as you look. Quan Chi? You've lost. A delay, Miss Blade. The inevitable still beckons. Johnny! not happen. I'm sorry, Jax. I'll get you out of here. You'll be fine. Don't know. Blood's supposed to be on the inside. Raiden! I must reverse his spell. Ata Romileko Esaltika Arventika Ata Romileko It's working! Essen Salta Barpeta You cannot save him. <laughs> You're weak, Thunder God. Johnny Cage is mine. No, he's mine. Save him. I've got this son of a bitch. That wasn't even close to what you deserve. Sonia Blade, the link with Quan Chi is not completely severed. Not a problem.
The others are restored to the living. By coupling Quan Chi's dark magics to my own, I was able to restore their souls. Is he gonna make it? Haven't I told you? Uh, he's a god. <laughs> you scared the shit out of me. <laughs> and they said I couldn't do horror films. <laughs> He's gone? How did he... We gotta go after him. He can wait. Right now, we need to get you and the others back to Earthrealm. Why is it taking so long? Name. Rayen Edu Keire. Thanks. You seem to know this Kano intimately. Not the word I'd use, but yes. I chased him for years until he escaped to Outworld after Shinnok's invasion. Why would he return now? All that matters is he's... <laughs> ...caught. Gotcha. Are you lost? <laughs> Hello, love. Been a while. Not long enough. This is General Blade. I need MPs to my location immediately. Oh, let's keep this between friends. A trade. Info for freedom. I don't negotiate with scumbags. Well then, if Mother won't play nice, Maybe daughter will. If you ever. Back off? And all's well. Piss me off. And Cassie's gonna meet Uncle Kano. I swear to God I'll... No. I'm not done with you. Sonia, ease up. You kill me. Never fight. Amulet. Move, move, move. Sonia, we need that info. Sonia, don't make this another thing you regret. Quatan jungle, with at least two divisions of Tarkatans. They're on the move constantly to avoid detection. That's not far. Maybe 200 kilometers. You know what to do. Yes, ma'am. Good luck. Blade out. You have new information? From Earthrealm? Kano talked. Gave us the details on Melina's location. She has the amulet, but she's got a lot of protection. We will strike immediately. Perhaps a two-pronged approach. The army will engage Melina, distract her, while this one retrieves the amulet. Not alone. This one's coming with. Stealth is of the essence. Did you not hear me? You may assist in the main strike. Devora, we will grant their request, and I will finally be rid of Melina. This one understands your logic, but does not reach the same conclusion. Like others, this one is not pleased with Melina as Connor, but it is not clear your crew will succeed. That is why I invited our Zaterran friend. Listen, and join us. I know things about Melina. Her troubled rule will fall in the telling. 
and paved the way for Quartal. What would you know that? There they are. Three of your fellow counselors, whispering like handmaidens. About what, I wonder? If only you would hear our counsel. As war with Netherrealm looms, I have urged detente with Earthrealm. And I've told you I would sooner die than treat with my father's murderers! You refuse practical solutions to credible threats. You endanger the realm. And sedition does not? Speak your last, before I have your tongue. You are not Shao Kahn's true heir. She is a construct, formed in Shang Tsung's flesh pits. I saw this. Your best claim to the throne is moot. How dare you! I succeed Shao Kahn by his decree! Succeed him you have, but Outworld demands new leadership. From you, Arshtek fool. Kill him! <laughs> this one serves Nelina no longer! <laughs> ah! You will defend your Empress! Our creator Shao Kahn is dead. We will serve whom we choose. <laughs> Still, you follow Melina. Shao Kahn conquered my realm. I owe him my loyalty. I honor his will. Your last ally has left you. Take her away. We would serve the new ruler of Outworld. Then you serve Kotal Khan. Here to surrender, traitor? You speak of treason. This one knows you desire the throne. Why serve Melina? I advise her. Stealing the amulet was my genius. It kills her a bit each time she uses it. As both sides diminish, you fill the void. Exactly my plan. <laughs> 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 Leaving without your friend, Devora? Your people believe we avoided your island out of respect for your solitary nature. We just didn't like you. The Kaitin do prefer solitude, which I will achieve momentarily. <laughs> Now 
Now two Edenians will die. I know you said you weren't friends, but you're not killing them. Head's fine, by the way. Very well. Let us go. Step aside. That is really disturbing. Devora. This one knew you would not stray far from the amulet. You took my throne. Now you wish to steal my means of reclaiming it? Neither was meant for you. Who are you to say? I will take something of yours. Your life! Excruciating death. One will enjoy your death. Enough of your prattle. Finish me, that I may join my father. You do not deserve death by an emperor's hand. Instead, I give the honor to my worthy first minister. is over. Well, thanks for that. I know I'll never eat again. With your leave, we're gonna head back to Earthrealm. Put the amulet back where it belongs. <gasps> the hell are you doing? Earthrealm cannot be trusted to protect the amulet. It will remain with me. The Reiko Accords require the that Accords you- The Accords no longer concern me. But you may prove useful when Raiden comes for this. This one deceived them. The amulet is in Kotopan's possession. You can retrieve it. He trusts no one else to transport it. Keeping you close to the Outworld throne these many years, has proven most fortuitous, Devora. They never suspected one of their own to be a disciple of our lord. This one lives to serve Shilop. You have done well. Now bring it to me. Without delay, Anji. from our world. Shinnok will soon be freed. We make for my fortress. Is there a problem? Two problems. Your wife told me I'd find you in here. You and Vera have a nice chat? Always. Is that a national? 
I haven't seen one this... You didn't come here to discuss farm implements. All right. I'll cut to the chase. I need your help. My help? I know. I don't have any right you to... You knew what I wanted. Jackie volunteered. She came to me. <sighs> I know. Listen. I get why you didn't want Jackie joining SF. Why you retired. I mean, if I had to live with memories of being one of Quan Chi's thugs, I would have eaten a gun a long time ago. Well, you know Vera. She never would have allowed that. So what is it you need help with? The outworld refugees? Worse. Shinnok's amulet. Melina has it. Damn. And we've gotten word from Serena that Quan Chi has resurfaced in the Nether Realm. He shows his face after 25 years, just as Shinnok's amulet is in play. That's not a coincidence. That's why I need you. Your Quan Chi expertise. We wouldn't reactivate your commission. You'd be an observer. Cage. Jax. What is it? Just wanted to see if maybe... You could help close the sale? <laughs> yeah, because that worked out so well last time. Can't blame a guy for trying. We need you, Jax. Help me capture Quan Chi. None of us is safe if he gets near that amulet. So where's Jackie in all this? <sighs> Outworld. With Cassie's team recovering the amulet. <sighs> She'll be fine. We expect to hear mission accomplished from him soon. So what you guys think? Are they gonna kill us? They would have done it by now. Unless Kotal Khan's planning on having us as guests at the Coliseum. Well, if they don't kill us, my mother will. Me, at least. Tough being the General's daughter? <sighs> you have no idea. I do. My great whatever grandfather took down Shang Tsung, saved Earthrealm. How often do you think that comes up at family gatherings? That was 600 years ago. And yet, you'd think it happened yesterday. No pressure there. I've trained all my life. Can fight my way out of nearly anything. But I still feel like a second-rate cage. <laughs> At least you grew up with people expecting things from you. I thought you and your dad were best friends. <laughs> now? He was a no-show for a long time. I can relate. What was that like growing up, having an ex-revenant father? Jen. No, I'm asking. Couldn't have been easy. He was just a bit overprotective. When I joined SF, Mr. Cage insisted on being the one to tell my dad. He thought it'd go smoother. <laughs> I'll never forget that day. My dad came home with a broken jaw. <laughs> You've got what exactly? Trust me. Away from the bars. Overloaded his senses. It only works at short range. Being the son of a telepath has its perks. 
I didn't used to think so. Yield. Well done. You are now Chujin. You honor me, Master Hisashi. Now that I'm Chujin, how will I serve the clan? Your future does not lie with the Shirai Ryu. But. The clan's my family. When I took you in, I promised your father... I don't have a father. Yes, you do. One who's proud of you. A Chujin in record time. You knew he was coming? You said nothing? Knowing this would be your reaction, yes. Takeda, your father is not your enemy. Ten years. No visits. Nothing. You abandoned me. I did not abandon you. I was eight. My mother had just died. Now you come back? Think you can jump right in as a proud dad? Son, I... To hell with you. I am not your son. Now get up. I want to knock you down again. Takeda, cease! Kenshi did not abandon you. He brought you here for your protection. Protection from what? From those who murdered your mother. She... She died in an accident. That is the story I asked Master Hasashi to tell you. But in truth, your mother was killed by Red Dragon assassins. I was the target. Su Chin was the victim. Son of a bitch! It was your fault! Your father has devoted his life to fighting animals like the Red Dragon. It is they who are without honor. You shouldn't have hidden the truth. You would have gone after your mother's killers unprepared. I could not risk that. Master Hasashi has perfected your fighting skills. Now it is time to complete your training. How, how did you do that? We are telepaths, a family gift. I can read minds? Through training, we will determine your full abilities. And then we will hunt down the Red Dragon together. This is Devorah's work. No argument there. Only she could create wounds like these. That Devorah's full of surprises. Question is, is she working with anyone else? <laughs> what is it? Damn, he's made us. Okay, guys, standard diamond formation. Takeda, you're on point. Jackie, bring up the rear. Kung Jin, air cover. You got it. The Earthrealmers. Devora freed them. <laughs> Natagasu!
One down, two to go. When we get back, you're teaching me that. Deal. Go help with Ermac. I got this. Think you can handle me alone? You're either brave or foolish. Brave or foolish? I'm alive. Let's see what's worth learning in there. So many minds trapped inside. We exist to serve, bound by Shao Kahn's magic. Chaos. The voices. We are many. You are one. Your abilities fail before us. I'm enjoying this. I think I've had enough of Outworld. I'm starting to get why my dad retired. We have to find Devora. Get the amulet. Let's go. It won't be out long. Devora. And the Earthrealmers? She stole the amulet, then helped them escape. She betrayed us to the Thunder God. You wound me, Devora. Prepare the legions. We go to Earthrealm. We will wrest back the amulet from that devil Raiden. We're all in one piece. No one seems to be tailing us. Have you been able to determine where Devora was headed? We think she's headed for the Sea of Blood. Dad? She's coming here, to Quan Chi. There's a secret portal near the Sea of Blood. Quan Chi had it built when we were getting ready to invade Outworld. Great. Dad, what are you doing? Why are you in the Nether Realm? But now who's being overprotective? I know you think you have things to make up for, but... I'm doing this for Sonya. She's family. That's why I'm worried. I'll be fine. You stay safe, you hear? You stay safe, too. I love you. Briggs out. Briggs out. Feeling better or worse? Not sure. Maybe both. <laughs> They'll be fine. The question is, will I be? We have good crossfire position. But why is it Quan Chi travels by conventional means? He seems unable to fully use his magic. He's weaker than when I was in his service. Serena's dead on. He doesn't have Shinnok as a power source. He's still Quan Chi, though. I realize you agreed to guide and observe, but you are welcome to assume any role you wish. I'm too rusty. I don't want to jeopardize the mission. He approaches.
Do not interfere, Jackson Briggs. Go back into hiding. Hiding? Guess I have been. That knocked some of my rust off. Welcome home, Jackson Briggs. This hill is not my home. Then why be fool enough to return? I got a family to protect. Huan Shi reunited me with my family. He will do the same for you. Quan Chi's not helping you. It is possible to escape Quan Chi Katana. I can aid you, as Bihan aided me. You became too familiar with Bihan, allowed emotion to corrupt you. Emotion freed me. <laughs> I don't understand, Katana. I mean, I hate the things I did here, but you enjoy being a revenant. It suits me. I am a victim no longer. Yeah, I know what you mean. But this ain't the way to assert yourself. I gotta believe there's hope for you. Mother of God. We've lost many. The rest are wounded. And our friends? The tide turned against them. They fled. How you two doing? I'm fine. <sighs> That's what I thought. Where are you going? Go to bag me a sorcerer. Alone? You'll be killed. Wouldn't be the first time. In your weakened state, is it possible for you to release Shinnok? I am more than capable. And Devora? Are you certain she is capable? She will bring the amulet to me. And I'll be waiting for her. Jackson Briggs. A pleasant surprise. Nothing pleasant about it. So you return to Raiden? The foolish follow fools. Oil! Raiden did his best. He saved Earthrealm. He murdered me! No, that isn't true. You were not there! He stole everything from me! You do not deserve to rejoin us. Instead, you will learn. There are worse things than death. I wish I could help you, okay? Jax, there is no need. Just stop it. It's good to be back. Kenshi, I got him. Excellent work. I'm staying here. Devor is on the way. You need to get Quan Chi to Sonya. She'll make him spill his guts. Sit. 
I'm guessing it's not your first time in cuffs. What's your safe word? Advise Secretary Blake that Quan Chi is in custody. We'll be moving him to the Supermax facility at Fort Charles within the hour. Yes, ma'am. You two stand guard. Prisoner transfer will be here in 20. Oh, now she trusts me to babysit. Cage, report. We haven't caught up to Devora. We had her tracked to the Makiba Cliffs, but then her trail went cold. Damn. Jackie thinks Devora's unique physiology may allow us to pinpoint her location. She's retooling her smart comp to track Devora's pheromones. On my command no only. Wound. Do not code. kill. We're looking at two hours? Sergeant, your team doesn't have two hours. We need her found immediately. Sonya! Cassie, I appreciate what you're trying to do, but there isn't time. Bring your team back here. We need to regroup and redeploy. Yes, ma'am. They're doing their best. I know. General, we have a visitor. You two are friends, right? He tell you he was coming? Nothing. General. Master Hisashi, I hadn't received word you were coming. I will have Quan Chi. We have things under control. You can- He must die. Raiden needs him. Without Quan Chi, we can't restore Liu Kang and the other revenants. You'd leave them trapped? Like you were? Only Quan Chi concerns me. Don't do this, Hanzo. I'll put you down. Then we are at an impasse. Seberu! Quan Chi is mine. I wish you no harm, General Blade. Call off your men, Hanzo! If you value our friendship, you will give me Quan Chi. Withdraw. Without Sento, you are vulnerable. Only Quan Chi's death will abate my anger. Hanzo, no! You've earned great trust for the Shirai Ryu. Do not squander it murdering a withered sorcerer. That withered sorcerer is the architect of my suffering. Master Hasashi, I am grateful that you've come. Speak your mind. I do not wish to linger here.
you re-establish the Shirai Ryu as I reform the Lin Kuei. We both seek to shed our clan's dark pasts, dedicate them to Earthrealm's protection. Our common purpose gives us a chance to end old rivalries, to start anew. You'll confess what you've long denied? That your clan's hands are soaked in Shirai Ryu blood? In the blood of my family? Our honor is indeed stained. Please, sit. After you and I were freed from Quan Chi's control, I sought out my clan. I had hoped rebellion from within would have quashed the Grand Master's plans. But Sector had realized his father's vision. The Lin Kuei had been fully cyberized. I pledge to kill Sector and his followers, reform the Lin Kuei, and restore our honor. I am not interested in Lin Kuei politics, Sub-Zero. When I finally killed Sector, I discovered the Lin Kuei had not sacrificed its honor with the Cyber Initiative. We had abandoned it long before. Peace, Scorpion! Frost! The Lin Kuei are still without honor! Master Hasashi, wait! For what? More treachery! I will have your head! Our story ends here, Sub-Zero. What is this? I did not bring you here for treachery. Frost is strong, but lacks judgment. She cannot see the wisdom of peace. I will deal with her. You spoke of the Lin Kuei's lost honor. For years, I had thought you would unfairly blame the Lin Kuei for the deaths of your family and clan. But Sector's cyber-preserved memories revealed the truth. The Lin Kuei need to abide their agreements, Sector. The Grand Master gave Shinnok his word. Shinnok's currency is lies, as is yours. Payment is due. I exterminated the Shirai Ryu as promised. Hanzo Hasashi lives. He's your Spectre Scorpion. I created Scorpion from Hasashi's soul after he died. We observed the agreement. The letter, not the spirit. You are owed nothing. Harumi. Satoshi. Had I known of my clan's complicity in the Shirai Ryu's extinction, our history would be different. I killed your brother because I thought he... Quan Chi is responsible for Bihan's death. Sector was wrong. There is a debt to be paid, and Quan Chi will pay it. Unbind him. Scorpion. We can- <laughs> My name is Hanzo Hasashi! You killed my wife. My son. And then you burrowed your way into my head. Misdirected my vengeance. Cost me my one chance to have them restored! Your family, I... Ah! Quiet, sorcerer. Nothing can help you now. Ah! 
At last, you feel my pain. Scorpion, stop! Crunchy! Blood for blood, your debt is paid. How small they are. This one greets Lord Shinnok. Quan Chi chose his servants well. He was wise to restore me in Earthrealm, behind their defenses. Quan Chi deceived them, allowed himself to be captured. He knew they would bring him here. A pity he did not live to see his work completed. <sighs> There will be no surprises from you, Mr. Cage. Bring him. Praise be to Lord Shinnok. Let us be on our way. There is an Earthrealm force in Netherrealm. I am aware. They will be neutralized. Oh, shit. Mom! Where's Dad? Shinnok. Mom, Mom, where'd they go? Uh, Mom? Your father. Shinnok's prisoner. At the Sky Temple. <sighs> Raiden! Raiden, my old friend. Master Borecho, I am pleased to see you. It has been many years. Too long. Yes, too long. We old warriors need to stick together, eh? Most certainly. I presume recent circumstances precipitate your arrival. Yes, yes. I am concerned that Shinnok may return. I've been trying to contact you. I feared the worst. When Kano misappropriated Shinnok's amulet, he left behind a snare. Disabling it required that I travel to many strange realms. I must retire to the Jinsei chamber, regain my strength. You are close to recovering it then. Shinnok's amulet? I do not know. Disabling Kano's snare demanded my full attention. Once I am rejuvenated, I will confer with General Blade. If only we could have destroyed Shinnok during the last war. If only he were mortal. Such beauty, like gazing upon 
the Elder Gods themselves. I hold out hope that we can turn this crisis to our advantage. How so? Quan Chi's magic binds the souls of many we hold dear. Capture him, and we can force him to release them. Liu Kang and Kong now restored. I suppose it is possible. As long as Quan Chi lives. I've long regretted losing our comrade's souls to Netherrealm's evil. Kung Lao and Liu Kang, they were like sons. I would move the heavens to bring them back to the light. It is as Master Boraicho said. The Shaolin Masters are aboard that ship. Boraicho said two ships. The other has disembarked. We need to determine its destination. They will talk. I will see to it. No extraordinary means, Kung Lao. They raided the Wuxi Academy, killed Master Wen. Even with Tarkatans, there are boundaries we do not cross. Yes, Lord Raiden. I still cannot believe Shao Kahn would order such a brazen attack. It demonstrated Earthrealm's vulnerability. Shao Kahn knew we would have no choice but to agree to a new tournament. Liu Kang defeated Shang Tsung. He will beat Shao Kahn. In good time, Kung Lao. First we free the Shaolin. All are aboard? This one leaves with the tide. We are ready. Shao Kahn demands the hostages be unharmed. Their wounds are not fatal. I would hope, Baraka, for your sake. For yours as well. <laughs> if you harm them, you answer to me. Tarkatans are beaten so easily. Empty threats, Raiden. You will not see the tournament. Not a fool. You will return to the wastes with no prize. Step aside. <laughs> Such power. What are you, Raiden? I am of truth and light. I protect Earthrealm. This one cares not for Earthrealm and worships no gods. <laughs> When a god speaks, heed him. They were not so vexing. All sneers and growls. Let us free those aboard this vessel. Then you will find the second ship. Where will you go, Lord Raiden? The tournament begins soon. Join me as soon as you are able. We will succeed, Lord Raiden. Of that, I am certain.
Yet another of your allies falls to me. When he dies, I will claim his soul. You know not his power. His soul cannot be subjugated. Shall we kill him, Lord Shinnok? Not yet. He will bear witness as I conquer his realm. Then I will imprison him as he did me. I would not boast of victory premature. <laughs> I have already won, Raiden. Kung Lao, desist! I serve Shinnok and the Netherrealm. Because Shao Kahn murdered you. Something you allowed to happen. I will not be so passive in your demise. You deserved a better fate. is not your destiny, Liu Kang. More visions, Raiden? Do you still see the future? The visions are gone, but I know what should be. I was put here by your hand. An accident, which haunts me to this day. I should thank you. You freed me. The Elder Gods you blindly serve, I will help Shinnok end their rule. I regret our paths have led here. <laughs> the Jinsei Shinnok. We have battled for eons, Raiden. Now, finally, it ends. <sighs>
tremble before me, Elder Gods, as I absorb Earthrealm's power. No, Shinnok. Even now, others come to defeat you. We land in 15 minutes. We'll enter the Sky Temple from the terrestrial entrance. Why not go straight there? It exists in a different quantum state, slightly out of phase from our reality. It can't be reached by conventional means. <sighs> what? It's just us. No one's coming to help. We either pull this off We or... will get it done. Vaitha! What is that? Don't know. But it's headed right for us. All their gods have mercy. Buckle up, people. I gotta put her down. Looks like the temple entrance is 15 clicks that way. A moonlight walk in the woods. Another time, it'd be relaxing. I wouldn't have pegged you for outdoorsy. My mother and I live near a forest a lot like this. It really takes me back. After we wrap this up, we should go. Fuck me. We're grounded. That shockwave fried the leads. Then let's get going. We're almost out of time. What are they doing here? Looking for the amulet, I bet. We have to tell them about Shinnok. Call a truce. Bring them to me! Or not. The woods. Come on. Be quiet. Sneaky. Hey, Mac. We sense them, but the forest deeds the souls. Yes. So close. <laughs> Jackie, look out! You hurt him? You answer to me. Go crawl back under your rock, reptile. Ah. Stop! You need water. Ah. Lean your head back. Ah. Can you see? Yeah, yeah, it's it's fuzzy, but ah. better. Beautiful. Choice. I've got our Mac. You were spawn of Jackson Briggs. And damn proud of it. I know what you did to him. We took your father's arms. We will take all of you. That was for you, Dad.
your eyes. So bright. Gonna carve them out! Trickery! Deceit! No more tricks. Just a straight up beatdown. Next time I block. You really creep me out, girl. Two for one. I'll take it. We know Devora is here. Where is the amulet? Koro Khan, the situation has changed. Do not fling your spittle at me. You tell him? Not yet. He needs to know Busy. that- Busy! I will kill you both. Shinnok's been freed. He's at Raiden's Sky Temple. He's already infected Earthrealm's life force. The heavens boil. Earthrealm is lost. Not if we hang together. I will appease Shinnok. Bring him your heads. Gain time to bolster Outworld's defenses. <laughs> <laughs> You need to help us, Kotal Khan. It is too late for Earthrealm. Shinnok is now its master. You should have been with us. That's enough. Fuck me. Don't know about you guys, but I'm living the dream. You have our dreams. Chattel, you die tonight. stood together against formidable odds. Lesser warriors would not have fared so well. Thanks, Grandmaster. I will remain here to push Kotal Khan back to Outworld. Proceed to the Sky Temple. Earthrealm's fate lies with you. Lord Shinnok is nearly finished. Soon the Jinzei's corruption will be irreversible. The invasion can then proceed. Raiden and his allies will be unable to offer resistance. Once the realm falls, our path to victory will be clear. Advise Lord Shinnok that the Oni and Oroki are ready. At his command, we'll unleash them on Earthrealm. Have you found Raiden's portal to the heavens? Yes, but his ward's protected. We can't break through. That is unacceptable. After Earthrealm is destroyed, we must complete Lord Shinnok's vengeance, invade the heavens, and destroy the Elder Gods. Come. Make war on the heavens? If Shinnok can take down the Elder Gods... End of the universe. Got it. Kung Lao. To see him like this... We'll all be hanging around the Netherrealm water cooler if we don't pull this off. Come on. Uh! Takeda! Has your mother ever told you what I did to her friends? Kill them all in the blink of an eye. And your own daughter. You proud of that? We are bonded in death. You will join us. And I will give you a proper upbringing.
Nice offer, mommy dearest, but I'll pass. <clears throat> Back off, princess. You think mere words can stop me? Thanks for the assist. Anytime. Tick tock, ladies. You're not killing anyone. Help Jackie! Messed you up pretty bad. Ugh. Great bedside manner. I can fight. Jackie? It's nothing. Just like Kurdistan. Boot it up! You two go. Jackie and I'll handle them. What? We'll just slow you down. Forget it. Damn it. Keep your heads down. I'll see you on the other side. They taste your flesh, burrow deep. Inside you, they will grow all your innards. By the gods! Dad! Father and daughter. Will they taste the same? You're the bug, I'm the windshield. I'm a little old for pumpkins. No. Get Shinnok. But... I love you. Dad? So you are the issue of Johnny Cage. Fitting that I exterminate his entire line. You want him, you're gonna go through me. Shit, it does run in the family. Your father's power will not save you. You cannot hope to survive. You got caged. <laughs>
that you? Nice. Cassandra Cage put me in the Jinsei. What? But you're... it'll kill you. Must be cleansed. Hurry! Gonna wait. No walks. Poolside. Umbrella drinks. <laughs> Deal. Is he alive? Barely. I'll help him. Help your father. And to think, I was worried when you started dating. Afraid I'd come home with someone like you. <laughs> Funny, beautiful, saves the world. My work here is done. This way. In here. Isolate Shinnok and Devorah. And get the medic. We'll fix you up. Help is on the way. You should have seen Cass. Wipe the floor with Shinnok. I believe it. And you. You did a great job with your team, Johnny. You hear that, Cass? She called me Johnny. I thought she might. Too long have I allowed Earthrealm to endure the horrors of war. Time and again, we've defeated our enemies, but we've exacted no retribution, demanded no remuneration. What have we gained for our mercy? More intrigue, more senseless violence. As the new rulers of the Nether Realm, heed me. No longer will I simply defend Earth Realm. I will seek out and destroy all who threaten it. No mercy will be shown, no quarter given.
Shinnok was an Elder God. Impossible to kill. There are fates worse than death. deny. The truth I was cast out for speaking. The truth I embrace, Shinnok, is that mercy is wasted on those who defile Earthrealm. I will destroy our enemies before they destroy us, starting with you. <laughs> oh, Raiden. Not even you can kill an Elder God. There are fates worse than death. warning and an emblem of my wrath. God has upset the balance of history. But know this. The arc of the universe bends to my will. It is only a matter of time.
as you were. For 25 years, the special forces have been Earthrealm's sword and shield. We've pushed back Shao Kahn, defeated Shinnok, yet none of our victories have come without cost. Recently, Commander Jackson Briggs was honorably discharged. His wounds, both physical and psychological, left him no longer fit to serve. We honor Jackie's father, and we honor his sacrifice by doing what he would do, tirelessly defend Earthrealm. Sergeant Cage, step forward. Your leadership and warfighting ability have earned you promotion to commander. But there are no family favors here. By special forces tradition, you still have to pass one last test. I need to kick the CO's ass, ma'am. Your ass, ma'am. All right then, Sergeant. Let's see if you can take me. Commander Cage. Reporting for duty. Congratulations, Commander. Come on, Dad. You really have to go? Well, you've got your duty, Commander, and I got mine. Starring in yet another Ninja Mime sequel isn't what I'd call duty. I need to provide for you in the manner to which you've become accustomed. Jeez, guys, I'm right here. General Blade, Cassandra Cage. What is it, Raiden? The Nether Realm. We should open a dialogue. Maybe there's an explanation. Liu Kang and Katana were friends once. They are irreparably polluted by Shinnok's evil. They are no longer the champions we once knew. We must strike them preemptively. It's about time we brought the fight to them. What's the target? Buried deep beneath Liu Kang and Katana's castle is the Cathedral of Shinnok, the seat of their power. Destroy it, and their undead army will fall, removing its threat to Earthrealm. Aren't your powers weaker in the Netherrealm? Yes, but I will have sufficient strength to occupy the undead army. That'll buy us enough time to infiltrate the cathedral, destroy it from the inside. We get pinned down in there, there's no way out. To ensure Earthrealm's survival, we must all be willing to sacrifice. Uh, you know, it's been two years too much of your grim and gritty makeover droning on about sacrifice. You don't have a family to lose. I know loss, Johnny Cage. Raiden's right, Johnny. We're not ready for another war. We've got to take out Netherrealm's army now, before Liu Kang can bring it here. in position. Hope Raiden's planned one hell of a diversion. Withdraw, or feel the wrath of Earthrealm's protector!
Raiden get this far. Eliminate him. That burn victim's cabal? Wasn't he Kano's goon back in the day? Don't let the scars fool you. He's fast. Take out him and Jade. I'll go downstairs and set the C4. Roger that. as you run. Jackie, where's Jade? She bailed. Getting help, I'm sure. General, how we doing? Need 10 minutes. The support columns are further apart than expected. You need help? Negative. Just watch our back. 10 more minutes. We need it to be taillights in five. Well, we're in the shit now. We have extra C4, yeah? Yeah, why? Let's buy ourselves time. Diversion. Lock and load.
Empress of the Dead. I've not forgotten our last encounter at the Sky Temple. How are your scars healing? Cassandra Cage. How the Chosen One has fallen. Raiden's right. Whatever Shinnok did to you, you're a lost cause. <laughs> Fuck you. General, can you hear me? General! Mom! I'm here, Cass. They're gone. Cass. And I'm not gonna make it. What? I'm not leaving you behind! Get your team home. That's an order. Your duty. Mine's to finish the mission. Mom, no! We can save you! I love you, Cass. Give your dad a kiss for me. Mom, no, don't! Mom? Mom! She started the detonation sequence. Override it, Jackie! There is no override. Commander! <sighs> Our orders are to leave. God, you're back. How did the mission go? Elder Gods here to taunt us? 
No, Kitana. I am much more. Behold. Kronika, Keeper of Time. The sands of time guide the destiny of the realms and every soul therein. I've carefully crafted them to keep the realms in balance. But my work's perfection has been irreversibly tainted by Raiden's actions. The two of you have felt that pain most acutely. What can be done? The past is the past, is it not? It need not be. I intend to wind time back to its beginning and restart history. But even with my vast power, I cannot create this new era alone. How will this new era be different? In many ways. But most importantly, there will be no Raiden. How do we begin? escaped my justice, sucked dry the bounty of Outworld's people. Today, your debt is paid. Kill me, Kotal, and you lose profit. You mistake me for Shao Kahn. I do not inflict bandits upon the poor. Shao Kahn approved. His word was law. Your master is dead. So is his law. Never again will Outworld suffer from his corruption.
Raiden? Shao Kahn? General Kotal? Kotal Khan. Khan? Pathetic fool! You pretend to my throne! It is mine, by right and deed. You were killed long ago, as was your repugnant spawn, Melina. We were at the Mortal Kombat Tournament. Kung Lao had just defeated Shang Tsung and Quan Chi. We are decades beyond those events. For us, they happened only moments ago. What game are you playing, Raiden? What magic powers this delusion? If it is a delusion, it is one we all share. Is it possible that the past and future are colliding? Katana, Baraka, Scarlet, all outworld champions long since gone. If you have all returned, has... I am here, Kotal. Jade. Ashtek custom requires all refugees be offered assistance. I offer it to you, Shao Kahn. I am no refugee. I am Khan of Outworld. Vacate my throne, or I'll soak these sands with your blood. <laughs> What do we do? I have not met Kotal, but he is reputed to be a man of honor. It's true. I know him well. Then we must navigate this crisis by aiding him. Your Takatans are dead. Impossible. They allied with Melina against me. Persist, and you will die again. <laughs> Filthy Takatan. turned assassin. Better to thrive in Shao Kahn's court than starve in the streets. You, Oshtek, may practice blood magic, Kotal, but I am the master. Pride will be your downfall. Kotal. I thought you were dead. What happened to you? Shao Kahn betrayed me. Ambushed my legion. I was kept alive for Shang Tsung's experiments. Only when he died was I freed. Seeing you again makes it worth living this nightmare. I will not lose you twice. Go help the Earthrealmers. I will deal with this. Your future self is ally, not enemy, Aaron Black. <laughs> to hell with the future. I live in the moment. Given who you become, I would not have thought you so reckless. <laughs> <laughs> Not known 
Stranger days. Kotal Khan, I am Raiden, protector of Earthrealm. I know you. We are acquainted in your era. We were allies who became enemies. I am surprised, given our shared antipathy toward Shao Kahn. Everything changed after your defeat of Shinnok. Shinnok's defeated? Our realms joined to fight him. But in victory, you were hardened. To protect Earthrealm, you lashed out at all realms you deemed threats. That cannot be. My Raiden wears Shinnok's amulet as a symbol of his fury. Be assured, Kotal Khan, I am not that Raiden. We have common cause, both in solving this temporal crisis and in defeating Shao Kahn. Agreed. Liu Kang, Kung Lao, and I will return to Earthrealm and learn what temporal anomalies have occurred there. We must better understand the phenomenon we are experiencing. I will have my scouts track Shao Kahn. So, this is goodbye. Only goodbye for now. I can't leave while Shao Kahn threatens Outworld. I must seek justice for what he did to my family, and to all Adinia. I will come back for you, to aid you, Princess. Questions, Devora. I routed your people, burned this hive, yet you aid me. We can't trust her, Excellency. Kotal Khan did, and she betrayed him to Shinnok. Kotal Khan. How is it I'm dead and he sits on my throne? You tried merging Earthrealm into Outworld. The Elder Gods intervened, and Raiden killed you. That's when Melina became Khan. After this one killed your daughter, Kotal claimed the throne. You killed Melina? If this is true, you will die! Devora is under my protection, Shao Kahn. As are you. I am Kronika. The legends are true? I am displeased with how history has unfolded. So you broke time? I stopped time. I enlist all those who disdain the current course of history. By merging past and present, we may draw upon allies from both eras. How will fighting your battles benefit me? I offer a greater empire in the new era, Shao Kahn. Raiden will not exist to thwart you. You can wipe Raiden from history? It is an immense task, requiring great power and effort. My hourglass requires protection while I work. Will your outworld armies defend it? They shall. I swear to God, I'm losing it. Can't someone, anyone, explain to me what the hell is going on? Right? I've been in the future for a whole hour and I haven't seen one jetpack. Not one. So it is true. I walked a darker path. After Shinnok went down, you became a different person. Red lightning, black clothes, authoritarian attitude adjustment. Yeah, about that. What happened to Dark You, hmm? How come you're an only child and I got an evil twin? As an immortal, I exist outside the normal laws of time. That could explain why I am affected differently. Thanks. Weird, isn't it? Not being in charge. That's what's weird. That and having daughters our age. Look at her. How do I have a kid with him? <laughs> at least she's not an actress. Come on, at least think about it. We each get points off the gross. Coming this summer, Johnny Cage and Johnny Cage. In time, quick. Any thoughts on what we do next? 
For months, I've been receiving vague premonitions of the future, but none of them foretold this. I must confer with the Elder Gods. Liu Kang, Kung Lao, please assist the Special Forces while I am gone. Yes, Lord Raiden. Follow me. Commander? Yes, Mom. I mean, General. I mean... <sighs> this is strange for me, too. You have no idea. What? Uh, how do I say this? This morning, we were on a mission. And, and you gave your life to save it. Son of a bitch. Seriously? Yeah. And now here you are. Young enough to be my sister. Cass, you need to see this. Sapphire show another realm incursion of the Wuxi Academy. Nether realm? Taking out Shinnok's temple was supposed to stop them. It's gotta be the time anomaly. We must help our Shaolin masters. Why would the Nether realm want to bust up your alma mater, Liu Kang? The Dragon Grotto. It's underneath the academy. Earth realm's Jinsei energy bubbles up in its springs. That's no good. We've seen firsthand what happens when the Nether realm screws with Earth realm's life force. They will not reach the grotto. It is protected by powerful magic, the deadliest traps. I am sure our counterparts from your era are already dealing with them. Kung Lao, Liu Kang, you might want to sit down. I die in the Colosseum. You on a rooftop fighting Lord Raiden. Our future, Liu Kang. It is insane. Obsessing over it will not change it. Neither will accepting our destiny as evil undead warlords. I'm not. But we can't change a future we don't fully understand. Lord Raiden will guide us. Can we trust him? It appears he got us both killed. on these traps. Do you know how? The monks never taught me. More likely you did not attend class. Watch for the pattern. And pick your moment. Easy enough. What's next? Everything. Poison gas, shooting spears, flame jets. How about we avoid those? I did not do that. I did. Scorpion. Of course you survived the time merger. You will not stop Kronika from restoring my family and clan. Can you stop the traps? I learned my lesson fighting you at Shang Tsung's tournament. This time, I am prepared. I can't stop the traps. The locks have been changed.
You cannot turn us against him. We know about our deaths. They were caused by our mistakes. You have been deceived, Liu Kang. The truth is, Raiden murdered you. Lord Raiden may make mistakes, but he doesn't murder his followers. Is it not murder to send an ill-prepared warrior to his death? Raiden's mistake cost your life, Kung Lao. I like the real you better. The Dragon Grotto is through there. What if the next revenants we have to fight are... us? Then we fight them, Kung Lao. Elder Gods, I have come to seek counsel. The realms are in crisis. The crisis, the crisis is, is grave indeed, Raiden. Every being will be erased in a temporal Armageddon. Even we Elder Gods, already our power weakens. I will fight Cetrion, but how? You must find Kronika's key and gain control of her hourglass. Only then will time's momentum be restored. It will be done. Speak your mind, Raiden. Since this time merger, I have learned about my future. That my champions fall. That I become a tyrant. If Kronika is defeated, will I be consigned to this grim fate? The restoration of time will not predetermine your destiny. That is for you to shape. Was asking you to put those back? They said you'd come. Who said? Who do you think, Kung Lao? Welcome to your future. Courtesy of Raiden. Our future may be tragic, but it's not Lord Raiden's fault. You've both been warped by Shinnok's evil. Shao Kahn snapped my neck in the arena. Raiden saw it coming and did nothing. I would have defeated Shao Kahn, but Raiden wanted the glory. His lightning cut me down. No, I don't believe that. One day Raiden will betray you. Then you will believe. The thought of becoming you sickens me, but I won't blame Raiden. You owe Kronika. She saved your life by stopping time. You shame our family name. <laughs> Is 
Is it me, or could they be telling the truth? Worry about it later. We have bigger problems. You should have listened to your Revenant counterparts. With this power, Kronika will remake history. That was easy. I, Giras, am a fixed point in time. With every death and rebirth, I grow stronger. Fetch the Jinsei, Chosen One. You're good, but you're no great Kung Lao. You've met my ancestor? He stood a chance against me. You have none. I can't kill you, but I can knock you out. You Shaolin monks exceed your reputation. I respect your spirit, but Kronika's will must be done. dangerous to let them live. If they die, their revenant selves will cease to exist. We need them to defend the keep. Yet again, Liu Kang, you've chosen the wrong destiny. to re-sculpt the sands of time. The Nether Realm's undead army will protect the keep as I work. Shao Kahn, when will you deliver the Outworld army? Soon. It will be mine once Kotal is killed. And what is your progress, Sector? The Cyberling Quay factory is modified to your specifications. Production exceeds projections. Lord Raiden, what did the Elder God say? We must find Kronika, wrest the control of history from her. If we succeed, our destiny can change. So what we were told is true? You were... involved in our deaths? Yes. Had the timeline continued, my decisions would have led to your deaths. But the Elder Gods assure me that such a future is not inevitable. This is but one of many possible timelines. That is a lot to take on faith. Rest assured, Kung Lao. I am aware now of what may come. I will not bring harm to either of you. You have my vow. Thank you, Lord Raiden. We must find Kronika's keep and strike it, as hard and as fast as we can muster, before all is lost. What have you learned about Kronika's effect on Earthrealm? We're tracking sites around the globe with major temporal anomalies. Picture's still fuzzy. Our kid's something, isn't she? We see no pattern, so... Oh, Cage. I'm not your Sonia. Sorry. 
too easy to forget. We've prioritized info that correlates attacks from the Nether Realm with time anomalies. Helpful. But we have more to worry about than the Nether Realm. Yeah, we do. Grandmaster Sub Zero reports heavy losses to his Lin Kuei clan. The time merger has resurrected his old enemy, Sector. Sector? Was he not the Grandmaster who years ago enslaved the Lin Kuei? That's him. He's reactivating and upgrading the same factory he built to convert the Lin Kuei into cyber killing machines. Undoubtedly, to construct new and more powerful cyber Lin Kuei. Kronika may seek to co-op them. What of Sub-Zero? Already on his way to shut down the factory. Grandmaster Hasashi is going with him. Grandmaster Hasashi? Hanzo Hasashi? Sub-Zero. I recognized your footsteps, Hanzo. Where's Sector? I will not let him threaten my clan again. The old Cyber Lin Kuei factory was defunct, buried beneath this quarry. Until the time disruption. Now, Sector's returned and reactivated it. He's building an army by processing Lin Kuei warriors kidnapped from my temple. I can see why you need me. We could enter through that tunnel, but a frontal assault would be... Bloody. Needlessly dangerous. There's another entrance, less populated. And the rest of your plan? We get help on the inside. We'll avenge your clan. Man. He was converted against his will. If we disable the behavior inhibitors that control him, he will turn on Sector. All Cyber Lin Kuei are linked to a common network. Cyrax can shut them down from within. Who is the woman? I don't know. Focus on disabling Cyrax. He's the key. We require additional candidates for cyberization. Once delivered, how long before the next generation is born? <laughs> Keep Cyrax alive. We need him. 
There is no future in which you are fit to lead the Lin Kuei. You always doubted me, Sub-Zero. Held me back. Kronika sees my true potential. <laughs> You deceive yourself, Frost. The upgrade, Cyrax. Is this Kronika's doing? To their server, Sub-Zero. We defend Kronika as she rewrites history. So you're nothing but pawns? We act to secure the Lin Kuei's glory in the new era. Take the others. You've been enslaved, Cyrax. First by Sector, now by Kronika. It ends today. You will be freed. Hurry, before we face more Cyber Lin Kuei. You'll need a moment to initialize. Sector, show yourself! Recognize me, little brother. Beyond? Yes, it is I. You were killed, swallowed in a storm of souls. Quan Chi's creations do not die easily. Kronika offers me a new clan to lead. I thought you shared. We share blood. We are not brothers. Experience. Quan Yang, is that you? You look so old. And Scorpion? We'll explain later. For now, know we share the same goal the Cyber Lin Kuei's destruction. We need your help, Cyrax. I can disable their communications network. It will shut down this factory and every Cyber Lin Kuei connected to it. Anything is possible. Hanzo and I are living proof. Please, don't bring me back as a machine. I can't live like this. 
Machine or man, you have a warrior soul. As long as I am Grand Master, the Lin Kuei will welcome you. Until we meet again. Kranicker will get all the service she needs. But I can't quite defeat until I know the job. You will see. Can you restore him? Some frame damage. Circuitry looks good. It looks like someone did a software wipe. Fixing that won't come cheap. Once he is repaired, can he be replicated? Hundreds of times. Thousands. That's a tall order. But anything's possible. With the right help. Serve Kronika, and she will provide. Take the deal. Trust me. Otherwise, who can you trust? You weren't kidding. It's like a mirror reflecting the past. How about that? Over 50 and still a ripper. <clears throat> There's still the matter of our fee. We get paid in the new era. Kronika will make sure the Black Dragon come out on top. Not only in the black market, in every market. Right then, let's get to business. You reach your dad yet, kid? The network's still down. I hate being so far away. Dad must be climbing the walls. Be patient. You'll get through. I know my dad's still alive, but... It's like I'm seeing a ghost. You and me both. But they aren't ghosts. Oh, they're definitely real. Can this get any more bizarre? Come on.
Jackson Briggs. Do not fear. I have come to offer you a new life. A better life. That's awfully generous, seeing as we never met. We have not met. But I know you. How valiantly you have served. How horribly you have suffered. That was not my plan for you. Your plan? You were to retire distinguished. Not in disgrace. Years from now, General Jackson breaks. More importantly, your daughter was not to serve, nor endure the same tragedies you have. Your home should be filled with grandchildren. Help me, and it will be. The Tarkatans, long extinct, have also returned. Shao Kahn will seek them out. He relies on their power. Kotal scouts tracked a Tarkatan war party to the Kai Tin's lost hive, Devorah's ancestral home. Her hand in Shao Kahn's escape makes that our starting point. Please advise me of what you learned. I must consult with the Elder Gods. When do we leave? Your duty lies elsewhere, Princess. I need you to enlist Queen Shiva. Her support is critical against both Kronika and Shao Kahn. Surely you can... Queen Shiva does not trust me. No Shokan has since my bloody battle with Goro. Shiva's always respected your opinion more than anyone's. When she hears you support Kotal, she'll join us. If that is my duty, so be it. Thank you, Princess. Are you my friend or his consort? It was my idea, Kitana. It's in your best interest. Succeed with Shiva, and Koda will pledge his loyalty to you. There's no bond more sacred to an Oshtek like him. I remember when we could ride like this alone. My life has changed as Outworlds come. Thankfully, you have not. You haven't changed much either, despite the years. You're still the same noble warrior I met in Shao Kahn's court. And now you're Khan. I'm surprised no woman has claimed your bed and become your queen. <laughs> Many have tried. Yet they failed. Why? None of them were you. There are fresh tracks leading into the hive. If Shao Kahn's in there, he'll be difficult to find. The tunnels are endless. Set fire to them. If he's hidden, he will be smoked out. Kotal, we don't know who else is in there. trade Katana's friendship for anything. It is pitiful you choose servitude. She and I fight side by side against Shao Kahn. His oppression cannot stand. <laughs> when called for a higher purpose, we must serve. Bleed for 
for your betrayal, Devora. This one acts only for the Hive's survival. to find Shao Kahn. Ghosts of my past. Devora spoke the truth. We are outnumbered. Give me a few of your best soldiers. We'll infiltrate the camp and search for Shao Kahn unseen. What you propose is dangerous. Of course it is. Shokan, Kol Katatrabakar. Wak Haka Turk, Waka Katarina Kotun Karak. Tokana, Takana, Aki Tarakata. Ne, ne. Trakati. No. Parga. It's all right. Parga, not I won't harm you. Neti, Otono Kora. We're looking for Shao Kahn. Shao Kahn. Please. With me. others to rise above your station. I have risen to my station, Jade. <laughs> are not equals. Line them up. Execute them. <laughs> Thank <sighs> you. 
Kotal! This is cruel. Many didn't fight us. They are children. You forget. In my time, they joined Melina in rebellion against me. These aren't the same Tarkatans, Kotal. A better Khan would offer them a warm hand, not cold steel. Your heart has hardened, Kotal. Blame yourself for the Elder God's deaths, Raiden. Your actions have irrevocably altered Kronika's golden balance of light and dark. Shinnok's decapitation was the capstone. You are a paragon of virtue. You should wish evil vanquished. I abide my mother's will. You were begotten by Kronika. As was my brother, Shinnok. The darkness to my light. Nature demands equilibrium. Balance is perfection. You have stepped out of your role, made that balance impossible. That's why the new era holds no place for you. You will not succeed. Kotal Khan is captured, Raiden. The combined might of Outworld and the Nether Realm will keep your forces at bay. While my mother finishes her work. Do not underestimate Earthrealm's warriors. You are right to have been fond of these mortals. They were good souls. are an upgrade. It'll be payback time next time I see Ermac. Oh, I made sure he got his. Hmm. I imagine future me is out kicking ass with these right now. Cassie told you that future you spent time as a revenant, yeah? Sounded horrible. Can't imagine becoming Shinnok's puppet. But she says I come back from it. The experience haunted Dad. But then he, you, met Mom. She brought you back to life. The love of a good woman. Like the sound of that. She was Dad's everything. She died last year. Ever since Dad stayed on the farm, he feels safer there. Here's how you access incoming reports. Swipe here to cross-check them with past reports. The software can suss out the deltas. Now that's progress. So, a merry lieutenant princess over there. Yeah, always had a thing for blondes. Ever since Susie DiNardo, Junior, Junior year. year. Take it from me, <laughs> you didn't miss much. That woman over there, she's the real deal. Oh, I got eyes, brother. As younger you, I saw him. You swear to tap that at the earliest opportunity. What? It's our destiny. How the hell do I ever sleep with that guy? Who's your father? I can't believe I just said that. Look, my dad isn't the Johnny you know. He grew up. I like to think you rubbed off on him. As a kid, I looked up to both of you. 
My dad, your grandfather, was my hero. Called me Private Pumpkin. Huh. That's what you called me. We should get back to work. Biometric verification required. ID verified. General Sonia Blade. General Blade? <laughs> Dad would be proud. Untwist your panties, older me. I'm a star. This is a military operation. Not a movie set. I'm only the best fighter here. But your daughter's got me sitting at the kids' table. Our daughter is CO. A little humility might earn her respect. Dad always said, hungry people eat lunch. Humble people serve it. Dad was an asshole. Hollywood made us an even bigger one. An old man just kicked your ass. Get lucky. You left me behind? Excuse me? My final mission. How did you... Shit. No, I'm not doing this. Not now. Not with you. Damn it, Cassie. You abandoned me? I just saved the company. That was my order. Who the hell gave you that order? You did. Read the full report, Lieutenant. <laughs> Go to condition red! We're under attack! Repeat, we're under attack! Yippee Kaye, right? Follow my lead. Like Friday. The shot on our face, Johnny. The shot on our face. Ah, <laughs> oh, he's gonna get us killed. Funny way 
there saying howdy, partner. I was saying goodbye. Now, why is a nice Texas boy like Aaron Black in bed with the Black Dragon? Older you works for Kotal Khan. He's one of the good guys, kinda. When I pick sides, I pick a winner. Every time. <laughs> Not my contract! You chose poorly. Cassie! Sonia! Breathe, kiddo. They took Mom. Sonia. I'll get her. Can we find out where they've gone? Tarmac B. On it. Keep her safe. <laughs> Be online long enough for your friends to make it, Tinhead. Johnny Cage, Cyrax defeated you when you were younger and stronger. As I am his superior, I am yours. You're forgetting the time I beat Shinnok mano a mano. Oh, wait, you were dead when that happened. Fight. Go back to the 90s. Who's next? I'm next, Hollywood. Back me wasn't bad enough. Oh, it gets bloody worse. Sonia and your little girl, they're gonna die right in front of your face. No one threatens my family. <laughs> Oh, 
Come on. Well, well. Got ourselves a full on generation swap here. Don't think so. Between Ninja Mime and Lady Liberty, we've got all the leverage. We're leaving. And the base? Taken care of. Let's go get them. Anyone else hear that beeping? Have I arrived too late? You're back in the nick of time. That's what I call a miracle. Yeah, Raiden. Thanks. Grandmaster Hasashi, I humbly request the Shirai Ryu's hospitality. My Sky Temple has been compromised. There is no safer place for us to gather. Lord Raiden, welcome to the Fire Garden. The Elder Gods are gone? Shinnok is Kronika's son? No wonder she sent the Black Dragon after me and Dad. We both kicked his ass. It is not vengeance that drives Kronika. She restarts history to balance light and dark among the realms. What can we do, Lord Raiden? Gather Earthrealm's forces. But that effort will be for naught if Kotal Khan's armies cannot join us. Cetrion informed me that Shao Khan has captured Kotal Khan. We must spare no effort to free him. Kung Lao and I will go. We will rendezvous with Princess Katana. Thank you both. May the Elder Gods protect... May you return victorious. You are passionate, Princess Katana. But I am not persuaded. Queen Shiva, haven't your people fared better under Kotal Khan than Shao Khan? In some ways. But we can only guess which Khan will prevail in this struggle. We gain no advantage choosing sides now. Princess! Liu Kang, why are you here? Kotal Khan has been captured by the Tarkatans. We 
must act quickly before he is executed. My people will not rally to a Khan held in chains. We have Earthrealm's support, Your Highness. With yours, we can guarantee victory. There is no path to victory without the Tarkatans. If they can be swayed to Kotal Khan, it would be to our advantage to join him. I will return, Queen Shiva, with the Tarkatans at my side. Together we will march on Shao Kahn. You, Scarlet. Indian blood is most sweet, Your Excellency. It is also a rare commodity. Where are they taking him? To the Colosseum, no doubt. Then we attack now. We'll never sway Baraka to Kotal's side by taking the offensive. We must turn Baraka first, then attack Shao Kahn together. The Tarkatans won't grant an audience. Their instinct will be to attack. Not to mention Jade. At the first sign of trouble, they could kill her. I have an idea. gift for Shao Kahn. We wish to join his fight against Kotal. All those years, the Khan's high and mighty daughter, now brought low by common soldiers, have you learned finally that you're no better than the rest of us? She is for Shao Kahn. We demand to see Baraka. You won't be seeing anyone. Liu Kang. You betrayed your father, Kitana. I was Shao Kahn's daughter by conquest. He stole Adinia from its rightful ruler, the father I never knew. Because your people and your bloodline were weak. There is more to power than conquest, Scarlet. As requested, zero casualties. Jade, are you all right? We must find Baraka quickly to save Kotal. Baraka won't join us. Kotal's hate for the Tarkatans runs too deep. If I hadn't stopped him, Kotal would have executed them all. Yes! Kotal has made his intentions plain. <laughs> Baraka, please listen. 
No more Tarkatans need to die. Kotal Khan threatens all Tarkatans. In the new era, Shao Kahn will rule. Fight. Hear me, Baraka. I speak truth. Jade, Liu Kang, Kung Lao, stand down! Good! Now come back, Draka! Speak! You've earned the chance! Shao Kahn has pitted Outworld's peoples against one another for millennia. And for what? The honor of dying in his wars? We must fight for each other, Baraka. Not with each other. Kotal wants us dead. He said as much to my face. Aid us, and I'll make sure you sit at Kotal's table. Which do you prefer, Baraka? To be Shao Kahn's slave? Or Kotal Khan's trusted ally. No one has ever made Tarkatan set an offer. But these are your words, not his. Help me save Kotal Khan. We'll ask him together. <laughs> he offers less. I'll slit his throat. If he offers less, Baraka, I'll help you. Suffered too long at this pretender's hands. But I've returned, and I will save you from his madness. Only I can rebuild the Empire. All realms will tremble before me. Outworld will again be conquered. Never the conquer! shown it before, I'd have had no need for Melina. My sister was an unholy monster. Exactly like you, father. <laughs> <laughs> to judge me. You have not known cold or hunger. If you had, you would value the gifts Shao Kahn gave you. Be grateful you still breathe. Consequences. Surrender on the brink of victory. You're as feeble minded as Jared. King Jared, the father you murdered and stole me from. I wanted Jared's wife, not his heir. 
I kept you only to appease your mother. Do not expect mercy this time. I'll not inherit your cruelty. Do you feel anything? Shao Kahn has crippled me, left me defenseless. Not while I am by your side. You would have me, even with my hardened heart? I know your heart. It can change. It is over, Kotal Khan. The throne is secure. Thank you. Baraka. Shiva. I have not served your people's well. Yet, still you aided me. I will not forget. We don't need charity. We will share an outworld's rule. That is up to her now. What? The throne is yours. You have united Outworld, Kitana Khan. She's now officially out of your league. I am humbled, Kotal. From this day on, may all our peoples fight together as one. The news from Outworld is indeed hopeful, but the location of Kronika's keep remains a mystery. It is beyond the realms and has proven to be beyond my sight. Do you know of Karan, Raiden? Karan, of course. Who is Karan? Master of the ancient ship of the dead. Sub Zero and I met him during our time as revenants. He travels in the space beyond realms, transporting damned souls to the Nether Realm. If the keep lies there, Karan may know its location. Would he help us? It is possible, but I cannot be sure. I urge you both to investigate. We will leave immediately. Locking down Outworld's army is huge. But still, I'd feel better if we had more manpower. The Shaolin will join us. Liu Kang and Kung Lao travel now to aid the monk's preparations. Good. I'll be leaving soon to go after Johnny and Sonya. I'll go too. We're both going. No. Raiden needs you for an intel op. We need to get Sonya back. Undoubtedly. But Kronika's behavior makes it clear that while mighty, she is not all-powerful. Otherwise, why would she attempt to steal Jinsei? Think maybe she's still building strength? A distinct probability. Then what's her next move? With the Dragon Grotto's Jinsei Fountain sealed, there is no greater energy source in Earthrealm than the Well of Souls beneath Shang Tsung's island. Then we'd better go check it out. I regret that I cannot join you. I must keep vigil for signs of Kronika's further tampering with time. We all have our duty. I am told you defeated Shinnok, Cassandra Cage. You will defeat the likes of Kano. But proceed with caution. If either Johnny or Sonya die, you will cease to exist. It will be beyond my power to save you. Stuff, One thing we might drag in mud. It's no fun in a fair fight. 
So Sonia's the skank who burns me? Ah, uh, she more than burns you, Cabal. She goes black ops on your ass. Shocks, knives, the bloody works. Patched you back together myself. Well, most of you. She's dead. This law and order really does that to him? Nah, but now he's motivated. Hope you're ready for some preemptive vengeance. What the hell are you talking about, Cabal? You, torturing me to get dirt on the Black Dragon. Don't believe every rumor you hear. I'm done entertaining you clowns. Get in here, you cowards. Tempting love. But we think our next contender is a beaut. Shit. Give him the satisfaction of watching us fight? Like hell. You said it. They'll kill us whether we fight or not. Fighting buys us time to find a way out. So, quit being a diva. Hit me. Dive when they see one. in the legendary Sonya Blade. Lieutenant! He needs a medevac. We're gonna have to fight our way out to the rendezvous. You'll need these. Ready 
you think you're going? about this future love I'm alive but you're dead as a doornail worst thing is it's those nether realm stiffs did you in should have been me let's have ourselves a do-over <laughs> You might be alive in this future, but that can change. Let me give you a break. Now this is a pickle. Can you break his neck faster than I can gut, pretty boy? Don't forget, it's two for one. He dies. So does your little girl. Thanks, Kano. For what? For reminding me of the rules. I'm totally stealing that one for time quake. How about uh, dinner sometime? You know, thank you for saving my life. And uh, apologize for being, well, me. No pressure, no romance. Patience is a virtue, Cage. What is that? Special guest villain. Gyrus. Kronika's goon. Allegedly, he can't be killed. I bought a dude like that in Fatal Infinity. <sighs> Get him evac'd. I'll keep this thing occupied. Sonia Blade. Mother of Cassie Cage. Yeah. What of it? Cassie Cage defeated Shinnok. Son of Kronika. I am his mother's vengeance. Stay away from my daughter.
Try coming back from this. You okay? I'll be fine. I come from tough stock. Listen, what I said back at the base about the mission, it wasn't fair. You're a damn fine soldier. I'm so proud I can almost picture myself dating Johnny. Almost. I wish I could go back to our last mission over. It wasn't easy finding out how I'd die or could die. But I reread the file. You followed orders, saved your squad. I'm just glad that my sacrifice saved Earthrealm. And you. Besides, you heard Raiden. Things will never go back to what they were. We all have to choose our destiny. Liu Kang and Kung Lao weren't kidding about this guy. All squads withdraw! Evac! Now! Giris failed. When he returns, I will strengthen him further for the final battle. Speak your mind. We've lost Shao Kahn, his outworld army, and now the Black Dragon. While Raiden's allies have burned precious time fighting Kano and Shao Kahn, our most important work has continued uninterrupted on Shang Tsung's island. That island is in ruins. What could possibly... Timecraft requires an abundance of raw temporal energy. Every mortal soul contains a lifetime of this power. Every hour, every minute, every second lived is stored within. Shang Tsung fed off souls. He collected them. In his well of souls, which remains untouched beneath his island. A destiny I crafted for Shang Tsung, in case I ever had need. Shang Tsung's souls will be mine. How's the view? No sign yet of the mystical barrier you mentioned. Oh, you'll know it when it comes. How you feeling? For the first time in a while, in control. I got tossed into the deep end of this world of gods and monsters. But now, knowing my future, I feel like I finally come up for air. Those bad things that happened to me, I mean, will happen to me, like Raiden said, it's going to be different. Isn't this good news? The things that happened to my dad, that trauma he suffered, it's why my parents met. They fell in love while he was in recovery. If they don't happen, you and Mom may not meet. I may never be born. Jackie, I, I can't pretend I get all this cosmic time stuff. But I do know you are here for a reason. You're not just some random accident. I hope so.
Shang Tsung's island. Here we go again. I was here for the tournament. There were people everywhere. These guys looked a lot younger. Seems like only yesterday. <sighs> Guess after Shang Tsung died, this place did too. Nobody's home. So much for needing stealth. Should have brought the whole squad. Kinda hoping Brayton's wrong about the Well of Souls. I don't want to be here longer than we. Multiple contacts. How many? Two, but one of them circling us real fast. Give me 10 seconds with this guy. Jax Braves, we were partners under Quan Chi's command. You'll join me again. Got the wrong Jax. I haven't been a revenant, and I never uh. will. <laughs> Times are changing, Cabal. Kronika's work. Disturb. Try ending. You're done messing with the Well of Souls. You're not as strong as you think, Jax. As I recall, Sindel made quick work of you. I'll take the lady in green. Time when you knew to fight for, but between Quan Chi and Kronika, your mind ain't right. I joined Raiden against Shao Kahn. He led me to my doom. Now Raiden leads you there too. I'll take my chances with Raiden. Enough dancing with the dead. Raiden said this well of souls would be underground. This way. This is Goro's lair. Thankfully, mine is Goro. Shang Tsung kept me locked up here, back at my first tournament. Never thought I'd be back. Remember where a well of souls might be? I couldn't tell you. I was pretty beat up. It's all a bit hazy.
I'm guessing this is it. That crown. Five bucks says it's Chronicles. It's drawing swords from the well. There's no way that thing's unguarded. Let's grab and go before whoever is on duty gets back. I never left. That is the first sub zero. Scorpion ripped out his spine, left it in a heap upstairs in Shang Tsung's old throne room. An event the new era will wipe from history. Hang on, Jackie. I got this. <laughs> Got that right. I'm just that tough. Guess Ermac's not the only one who's weak. Come on, let's get that thing and get out of here. Yes. Dad, your your arms. Those look like Kronika's design. What are you doing? Giving you the life you deserve. By destroying the universe? Restarting it, not destroying it. Being a revenant. The years I lost, the things I did. Your ma held me together. But I was never the father you needed. You're talking nonsense, man. You raised a fine daughter. She's one hell of a soldier. She shouldn't have been a soldier. I never wanted you out there, taking those risks. If I hadn't fallen apart, you wouldn't have felt the need to enlist. That's not why I do this, Dad. Please! Give that crown to me. I don't want to hurt anybody. This is seriously messed up. Hang back, kid. I know I wouldn't want to fight my dad. How about we keep this between me, myself, and I? Never thought I'd stoop so low. You don't know how bad it gets. Losing your arms was just the beginning. I know you suffered. You still do. But you don't betray your unit. And you sure as hell don't betray your family. What? There's got to be a way to make this right. He's out, but he'll recover. How are you? Tripping. You? Ditto. We can't leave him. Let's get him and the crown out of here. If I never come back here, it'll be too soon. I heard that. Surrender Kronika's crown 
and the Elder Jackson Briggs. No harm will come to you. No deal. We know you betrayed the Elder God, Cetrion. Kronika must restore the balance that Raiden destroyed. Can you not see? He is the devil in these matters. At least he's the devil we know. Can we take an Elder God? Cassie beat Shinnok. Only because the cages are born with crazy magic powers. Maybe we have our own magic. Stand down, please. Resistance only ensures your suffering. What are you doing? Stand back. We don't know what this thing will do. That crown is meant for Kronika. Your human physiology cannot control its power. Only got to wear this thing long enough to beat you. Mission accomplished. Control the crown. I did not wish to harm you, but now you have forced my hand. the crown and I will spare her don't don't give it to her go her life is in your hands nobody here wants to hurt anyone now please don't let this happen to our girl damn it now bring Jackie back. Dad, how could you do this to me? I'm not doing this to you, Jackie. I'm doing it for you. I love you. Kronika awaits our return. Come on. This fight isn't over. This will bring us our deliverance. Thank you. Both of you. I sense apprehension, Jackson Briggs. I'm not usually surrounded by so many friendly faces. We are unlikely allies, united for a common cause. Worry not. Liu Kang, Kitana, are the armies assembled? They're en route. Kitana and I will see that they arrive as planned. Excellent. My strength gathers. The new era draws ever closer. The report from Jacqueline Briggs. 
Her father's actions have compromised our situation gravely. I know. I can't... I can't believe he did this. Even if we locate her keep, Kronika's power now likely exceeds the might of our combined forces. Maybe we should rethink using Shinnok's amulet. We cannot, Cassandra Cage. I've seen what you can do with it. You held off the entire Netherrealm army. You weren't even at full strength. I dare not risk the temptations of its dark power. Even now it calls to me. Despite Kronika's advantages, we must attack as soon as we know the Keep's location. It's been hours since we heard from the Grand Masters. What's the plan if they don't come back? They must, or else hope is lost. bound to Cardon. It sails only by his command. That it's still moored suggests he won't help Kronika. In which case he may help us. like caught on his home, perhaps hosting some unwelcome guests. Return to Earthrealm. Tell the others we found him. We'll deploy as soon as I return. Are you certain Karon will aid us? No, but he's our best chance. Lost causes. This one ensures the hive's survival. You will not save the Shirai Ryu. The Shirai Ryu will not fall. The clan of imposters will indeed fall. I've restored the Shirai Ryu. Built a clan that's never been stronger. On a foundation of pretenders and outsiders, Kronika told me. Shirai Ryu. Our clan's massacre extinguished them. Kronika will revive the true Shirai Ryu in the new era. Do not trust Kronika. She uses your anger to enslave you, as Quan Chi did both of us. I let go my rage, and it saved me. 
to save yourself. You must do the same. It's past time you were freed. We both know what truly drives you. It's not Shirai Ryu pride. It's your wife and child. Harumi and Satoshi were stolen from me. Murdered. Seeing them again is all that matters. We share this pain. I fought through hell to end it. But Kronika's new era is not the remedy. She would resurrect Shinnok, the same devil who brought death to our family and clan. He cannot be allowed to return. When I revived the Shirai Ryu, I vowed our clan would ensure Earthrealm's protection. Help me keep that promise. Shaolin masters, they're ready. They will fight until the last man. That is likely what it will take. There will not be a fight if Karon does not help us. Is there any word from Grandmaster Hasashi? No. If we do not hear soon, I will return to the Nether Realm. Wrong Scorpion. This cannot be good. Get Raiden. Fire gardens. Rebuilt. The Shirai Ryu are indeed restored. Why are you here, Scorpion? Where is Grandmaster Hasashi? He is dead. Now you have come to finish us. I understand your mistrust, but I am here to assist you. I find that impossible to believe. Fight! <laughs> Misunderstand my intentions. Who sent you here, Scorpion? My future self is dead. I am here at his behest. Grandmaster Hasashi sent you. I honor his dying wish. Karan will ferry your armies to the Isle of Kronika. We must leave at once. Do you have proof of Karan's offer? Only my word. Your word is worthless. At the tournament, I trusted you to spare Bihan, and you betrayed me. A mistake born of rage. I seek redemption. Lie, Scorpion. You are a slave, and Kronika is your master. <laughs> Spout your falsehoods elsewhere, Scorpion! Kronika will not entrap us. It is no trap! Karan awaits you in the Nether Realm. Lord Raiden! We should listen. He may be telling the truth. 
There is only one way to find out. Now, Scorpion, the truth! Raiden, stop this! Step aside, Liu Kang. Put down the amulet. Its darkness is taking hold of you. Our time has run out. I do what I must to save Earthrealm. Stay down! This is not the way. Scorpion is not the enemy this time. Liu Kang, do not interfere! <laughs> Be glad of my mercy. Do not force my hand, Liu Kang. The realms hang in the balance. To defend them, I must command order. I thought it impossible, but the revenants were right. You cannot be trusted. I do not need trust. I demand obedience. Enough of your madness. If you must die, so be it. This... This has happened before. Interfere. You cannot fight Shao Kahn! <laughs> Liu Kang, stop! Enough of your madness! If you must die, so be it! <laughs> I have been a fool, Liu Kang. Kronika's puppet. We only battle because she wills it. I must help him. I was wrong to doubt you. I too have been a slave to anger. I do not understand, Lord Ring. Your rage was caused by Kronika? Yes, I succumbed to her influence. But then, our confrontation, it unlocked memories. Memories not only from this timeline, but from timelines that have come before. Wait a sec, timelines? Plural? Kronika has restarted time on countless previous occasions, using each timeline to learn and to perfect her plan. The details of each timeline are different. But in each one, events conspire to bring Liu Kang and I into conflict. In each one, he dies. Only Kronika has such power to control time and fate. I don't get it. Why do that? I do not know. But be assured, Kronika will control us no longer. At long last, you see the pattern. The 
the pattern, but not the purpose. Why set me against Liu Kang? Is it not obvious? Your combined power threatens my vision for the timeline. Liu Kang and I will not be divided further by your machinations. <laughs> oh, Raiden. Do you think this is the first time you made that vow? We have repeated this exact conversation so often in so many timelines. I've lost count. This timeline will end differently. We have played out all possible scenarios, Raiden. You cannot win. You are welcome to try, of course. But without Liu Kang by your side. Enjoy these final hours, Raiden. They are all you have. has taken him to her isle. We must leave immediately to save the realms. We must save Liu Kang. A new look? Just for me? You shouldn't have. What do you want from me? You will aid in my protection. Not likely. I have mastered Shinnok's sorcery. I will add your soul strength to mine, and finally avenge myself upon Raiden. My friends, Raiden's armies are coming. They will fight us, and they will lose. beyond the fog. Fairies cannot fight a war. This fleet is under my protection. If Karan falls, our fleet cannot sail. Protect him at all costs. Rapping speed!
fight, but I've got to. For Jackie's sake and mine. Let me help you. Kronika's promises to you are a cruel deception. She is the mother of Shinnok, the architect of your revenant enslavement. But... No. She's Cetrion's mother. Cetrion is Shinnok's sister. In Kronika's new era, Shinnok will be the darkness to balance Cetrion's light. Which will only happen if the realms keep on fighting each other. What have I done? I'm a fool. It is not foolish to fight for your family's betterment. I'm sorry, Raiden. I promise to make this right. is impossible. Yours, inevitable. I will suffer you no more. unfortunate for you. The sea of blood is bottomless. You will fall forever. Now do I have your attention, Raiden? The warriors sinking your fleet are under my command. You have made a devil's bargain with Kronika, Frost. You ignored me my entire life. Kronika saw my talent from the start. Envy and ambition consume you. Such wasted potential. The good she could have done in command of these Cyber Lin Kuei. She commands them, not Sector. If so, she is linked to them. They follow her thoughts. Then let them follow her to defeat. Ah! 
and ho! Time after time, Kronika's schemes have pitted us against each other. That cycle must end, Liu Kang. This time it will! Your power? Is this Kronika's gift? A gift to myself, you could say. You stole your own soul, perverted your own nature. It's a lesson you taught me, Raiden. To fight my enemies by any means necessary. I have conquered the darkness within me. You must do the same. You will have to kill me. I would rather save you. to Raiden. He is part of me, bound to my soul. He made me a god, for now at least. A god? Incredible. Now he's out of her league. My revenant counterpart. I have absorbed his knowledge of the keep, of Kronika's plan. I know where to find the hourglass. We can beat Kronika. Out of desperation comes invention. I had not thought it possible for Raiden to surprise me. Our success is no longer certain. We must make haste.
This means I'm sorry, Jackie. And hell yeah, I'm back. prevent Liu Kang's interference, but you will require more assistance. Whatever happens, I am honored to fight at your side. Likewise, Liu Kang. Me too, brother. May the Elder Gods protect us. Combining with Raiden has the benefit of novelty, but it is also too little, too late.
defend me. Finish him. Earthrealm's Jinsei flows within you. Let it fuel your fire. to harm you. Harm me? You already killed me! My fate was sealed the moment I joined you at Raiden's side. It's a mistake I won't repeat in the new era. Our bond was no mistake. Your ego knows no bounds. I did not ask for this. It was thrust upon me. It should have been me, Liu Kang, from the beginning. Thanks to Kronika, it will be. Still you are alive. Yes, Kronika. You are right to fear mine and Raiden's powers combined. A demigod's power cannot rival that of an elder god. Cetrion! As you wish, Mother. You match me step for step. Because your heart is not in the battle, Cetrion. You fight for your mother's vision. But as a goddess of virtue, you know that her desired balance is folly. Heed me, Cetrion. He lacks our vision and wisdom. Please. No virtue is served by condemning the realms to endless war. The greatest virtue is abiding my mother's will, Liu Kang. I cannot fail her. Your heart betrays you, Cetrion. I have failed you. Dearest Cetrion, you have done admirably. Yet there is one final service to perform. Yes, Mother. I understand.
The realms will not fight your endless wars. Fight me further and your friends are lost. They have no future unless I create it. The future you offer is not worth living. It will not come to pass. finished, Liu Kang. Lord Raiden. I am merely Raiden now. You have proven worthy to take my place as the new protector of Earthrealm, once it is restored. You honor me, Raiden. The honor is mine, Lord Liu Kang. The sands of time are now yours to shape. It falls upon you to architect a new history. The fate of all realms in my hands? Raiden, I cannot do this alone. I shall advise you for as long as my mortality allows. But have no doubt, you are up to the task. Then together, let us begin. Deceit. We will not hear it. In defeating Kronika, you destroyed her crown. Without it, you can't restart history. The hourglass will shatter. All realms will be lost. Pujan, is this true? Kronika's every action was taken to ensure her crown's preparation. She would not dare to restart history without it. Kronika came to each of us. For our help, she offered places in her new era. For refusing her, we were banished to a void beyond time. We could observe the events leading up to your siege of the Keep, but we were powerless to intervene. But then you killed Kronika. The void seal was broken open, permitting our escape via the Hourglass. If you know so much about the Hourglass, how do you propose I reset the timeline? With the crown. The crown is destroyed. Only in our present, not in our past. 
And while I cannot restart history without the crown... You can send travelers back into the current timeline. I see. I must return to the moment before Kronika's defeat. End that battle differently, so that her crown remains intact. That leaves too much to chance. Kronika must never possess the crown. Otherwise, you cannot guarantee victory. What do you propose, sorcerer? That you send me into the past to steal the crown from my island before Kronika sends Cetrion to claim it. I'll then deliver it to Lord Raiden, and together we'll defeat Kronika. With the crown and hourglass under our control, we can restart history safely. <laughs> Why are we listening to this snake? Because I am a snake who's toiled beside Kronika, learning her secrets. I know them. Do you? He has a point, Raiden. Fujin. A word? How is it you conspire against Kronika? Did her promises of grandeur not suit you? She wanted me to be her pawn, not her partner. She sculpted my entire existence to serve her, to collect souls for her crown. When my purpose was served, she betrayed me, casting me into the void. Your grievance does not fool me, Shang Tsung. Then trust that we have a shared interest in breaking Kronika's stranglehold on our destinies. Inevitably, our interests will diverge. This alliance is temporary. Have no illusions otherwise. I understand your misgivings, but it is the only way. But the risk, Liu Kang, will be rewarded. Say nothing to Nightwolf. We will proceed with your plan, Shang Tsung. I must stay behind to operate the hourglass. But Nightwolf and Fujin will go with you to supervise. I welcome the assistance. I will join you. No, Raiden. I need your counsel here. Have faith in Fujin and Nightwolf. If I have faith in anyone, it is you, brother. I will try to send you back to the Time Merger. You should have enough time to claim the crown before Cetrion delivers it to Kronika. Your confidence is inspiring. As the Keeper of Time, I am still a novice, Nightwolf. May the Great Spirit protect us. Pretender's hands, but I've returned, and I will save you from his madness. Only I can rebuild the Empire. All realms will tremble before me. Outworld will again be conquerors, never the conquerors. I'd have had no need for Melina. My sister was an unholy monster. 
Exactly like you, father. <laughs> After the time merger, yes? The battle between Kotal and Shao Kahn. No, look! It's much later than that. This is Kitana's battle with Shao Kahn. Then we're almost out of time. We must escape quickly. Changing this battle's outcome could cause Cetrion to claim the crown earlier than expected. And guarantee our failure. Let's go! His business is none of yours, Collector. My business is collecting what Shao Kahn wants. He will pay handsomely for you. You're outnumbered, Collector. Am I? There's our goal. Kronika's defeat. You will be partners in death. Thank you, great spirit. Shao Kahn. He always had more ego than skill. Come, let us leave while the crowd is distracted. No, we're already here later than we wanted to be. Let's go to your island now and take the crown. No detours. A rather public arrival at the Colosseum makes that impossible. Chronica's outworld allies will inform her of our presence. Go to my island now. We could be ambushed by Cetrion herself. And our combined power won't stop her. We need help. But whose help? We can't recruit any of our allies without altering this timeline's events. Sindel. Sindel's a revenant. Who can be restored to life. And who plays no major part in the battles that lie ahead. We can safely recruit her without disrupting events. <laughs> it's a tactic Kronika is unlikely to anticipate. 
Si was Shao Kahn's empress, his equal in evil. Because he had her bewitched, returning Sindel to life will restore her original, more heroic self. And if we fail? The Sindel I knew wiped out most of Earthrealm's champions in a single battle. If Nightwolf hadn't sacrificed himself, she would have killed them all. And that is the power we need to assure victory against Cetrion. Sindel is the key. And I suppose restoring her will be easy. Anything but. We can use Earthrealm's Jinsei to heal Sindel's body. But to break Quan Chi's spell and revive her soul, we will need access to Outworld's soul chamber. Uh, you have a different plan, Nightwolf? A better one? One hint of betrayal, Sorcerer. And we will finish you. Where do we start? Earthrealm. To acquire the Jinze. Coliseum. How is that possible? It should not be. Those cast into the void do not return. If Sheng Tsung were to... I am aware, Garrus. Take Frost and find them. We must discern from when and whence they came. That would be sufficient. You two may leave. I'll stay behind to secure the grotto. Your aid is not required. These traps are excellent. Who knew the Shaolin was so diabolical? From you, that's high praise. Indeed. Nightwolf, Shang Tsung, come. Kronika is keen to question you. Frost. We've seen it. Join us on the right side of history. The only side is Kronika's. My place in her new era is assured. Nothing is assured, Frost. I am eternal, Fujin. My will and my strength, infinite.
Of all the night wolves I have fought, you are the fiercest. It must be why the Great Spirit chose me to wear the mantle. You are also anomalous. No one has ever escaped the void. You're not fit to survive. Is that necessary? To buy us time. We must be rid of him before he recovers. Fujin, summon the wind. Send him. Chaos Realm. Havoc will keep him entertained. Let's get to the Nether Realm. We're running out of time to find Sindel. Entirely unexpected, given that she did not aid in the Keep's defense. What was her role then, if she is such a formidable weapon? Is it possible that. Ah! Oh. Great Spirit. What is it? My Revenant. He is close. The Great Spirit cannot save you. to the Bone Temple. Uh. Nightwolf. Shang Tsung. Nightwolf. Shang Tsung. Where are we? Shinnok's Bone Temple. Raiden's violence against our lord will not go unavenged, Fujin. Prepare to pay for your brother's sin. Sindel, you look well. Death becomes you. Always the charmer, Shang Tsung. I will enjoy feeding Lord Shinnok your soul. <laughs> but you, Nightwolf. You get the privilege of suffering most. Only the best will do for the man who killed me. I should have saved you. Hopefully we will today. <laughs>
Johnny Sendell. Not without killing my revenant. I'm not going to kill you. <laughs> As Raiden said to Lord Shinnok, there are fates worse than death. I can imagine few fates worse than yours. <laughs> Sacrifice will save the Matoka. Kronika has no love for our people. The Great Spirit is a fraud who allowed us to suffer. Kronika is our future. <laughs> Kronika is not the answer. Soon stop. We can restore him. He wounded me. If I die, we fail. Sorcerer, I'll no, Nightwolf. Shang Tsung must live. Happy now? I am healthy, Nightwolf. That should be your concern. Both of you, please. We must make haste to the Soul Chamber. Then let us hurry. And hope Shiva is as eager to aid us as I anticipate. Escort you and your comrades to the Soul Chamber? Yes. Have you come from the future only to insult me? I am no sword for hire. This request is far below your present station, Your Highness. But defeating Kronika depends on us reaching that chamber. Why? Because we must restore Sindel. My Empress. You've captured her revenant. Together, Fujin and I can restore her to life. Why? To make a slave of her, as Quan Chi did? So that she can aid us against Kronika. But you have my vow. She will return free of all influence. As I recall, you were bloodbound to Empress Sindel. I was her protector for life. How it must have pained you when she died. That was not your fault. You could not save her then. Now you can. Then I... No. We must present this to Kitana Khan. Respectfully, Your Highness. If we approach Kitana... She'll cut Shang Tsung's head off. Kitana never appreciated my contributions to the Empire. Like replacing her with an evil clone? Yes. 
time is short, Queen Shiva. We must act now and beg Katana's forgiveness later. After restoring her mother. Will you help us? By concealing you from Katana, I betray my oath to her. But my life belongs to Sindel. You will be recognized by Kitana's Imperial Guard. True. They won't take to me kindly. That will do. We've made it this far. There's a stairway beyond those doors, and at the top... The Soul Chamber. I feel it. So there he was, neck deep in shit, cowering at the business end of an outhouse. He picked a bad place to hide, and an even worse place to die. Business, Baraka. We're equal partners, remember? The Khan's business is my business. You are not Shokan. I know that scent. Smells like Shang Tsung. How's that for strange bad fellows? What do you say we skip the preliminaries and y'all come with us quietly? We'll have a nice friendly chat with Kitana Khan. There's no time for chat. We must get to the Soul Chamber urgently. And go on and get to it. But we're taking Shang Tsung and that coffin. <laughs> My sincere apologies. Tarkatan blood is shed. You will atone, Shiva. Were you not warned? Tarkatans are all mouth and no ears. You speak when you should listen. Time to spill it. Who's toes up in that coffin? Empress Sindel. We can restore her with the Soul Chamber. Hold up, Shiva. You're resurrecting Katana's evil mama. Whatever your reasons, this ain't a good look for you. Know your place, Outlander. Let's move quickly. What in Argus' name is happening out here? Shang Tsung. I thought I saw you slither away from the Colosseum. 
You always were perceptive. We have no wish to fight, Jade. This is Sindel's Revenant. We can restore her to life, so she can join the fight against Kronika. Please, Jade, we must enter. You have yet to convince me. Even if you do, the Soul Chamber is occupied. Kotal uses it to mend his broken spine. Disrupting him now could leave his injuries permanent. I promise we will not disturb him. Your promises are empty, sorcerer. We will not harm Kotal. As my ally, you should trust me. So much for Adinian loyalty. You will recover. For now, we must... I recall my captivity in your flesh pits all too well. You need more time to heal. I am strong enough to kill him. Today he is our ally. With his sorcery, Sindel can live again. Necromancy is forbidden. You have taken leave of your senses. Reverse the spell you have cast on them, sorcerer. <laughs> Submit to Katana Khan's justice, not yours. Queen Shiva. Katana Khan, 
I... Hold your tongue. Jade told me everything. Nothing good can come from that sorcerer's hands. He will restore your mother, Kitana Khan. For a thousand years, I've dreamed of seeing her alive again. But her soul deserves better than to be corrupted by Shang Tsung. This perversion ends now. How quickly your oath to me has broken, Shiva. I have been bound to your mother for millennia. I must honor her. <laughs> Forgive me, Katana Khan. Welcome back, your highness. It pleases me to see you, too. Am I alive? Is this real? It is, Lady Sindel. A miracle we could not have achieved without your most loyal subject. Shiva? Empress, though today I have aided you, too often have I failed to protect you. I am not worthy. Ah, oh, nonsense. Today, you give me the greatest gift. A second chance. Your duty is fulfilled. I am in your debt now. Thank you, Empress. Where is my daughter? Ah, oh, Katana. It is me, Katana. Your mother. I... I want to feel joy, but... All I feel is... I was only a child when you... You... How could you kill yourself? Why did you abandon me? I did neither, Katana. After being forced to wed Shao Kahn, I ran afoul of Quan Chi. He accused me of distracting Shao Kahn. Then the miscreant murdered me, and staged my death as a suicide. As I had always suspected. But all this time? Everything I've been told about you, it's all... lies? What can I trust? Trust that I loved your father, Jared. Trust that I love you. No, oh, Mother. This reunion is a blessing, but we have little time to celebrate. We must leave for Shang Tsung's island to finish our quest. I would go with you, fight by your side. But Outworld needs its Khan. I know. Rest assured, Kitana, I will come home. Sindel has been restored. Shang Tsung would only undertake such an arduous task if her aid promised a decisive advantage. She is but one mortal. And one of the few who can harm you. I fear no harm. They are at Shang Tsung's island. Your crown. Shang Tsung knows. Then our time for preparation is over. Go to the island now. We cannot win their hearts, so do not try. Do not permit your better nature to compromise you. I understand, Mother.
Have neither of you any compassion? Not for fools who follow you. Are we not following him now? At least we do not follow that fool, Raiden. Then we would surely die. a better plan. There's more to come. to the void. Not even she can help you. <laughs> Expectations. Cetrion must be on her way. Sindel and I will occupy her. You two get the crown. I must ask, sorcerer. How long before you betray us? <laughs> I find your lack of faith amusing. When it happens, we will be ready. and take one giant step back. You too, sorcerer. Makes sense we'd meet again down here. When you caged me up, beat me within an inch of my life. The hell if I ain't gonna return the favor. Always so generous. Fight. You ran away. You are no challenge. You should have fled this fight, too.
Kronika's hmm. promises cannot be trusted, Jackson. Bihar, Kano, Shao Kahn. Look at the scoundrels she employs. That's a card you can't play, Fujin. Not when you're buddied up with Shang Tsung. You are no challenge. Kronika will not heal your wounds, Jackson. Damn it, Fujin. You know what I've suffered. Kronika's my one chance to prevent all that. Not just for me, but for Jackie. For Vera. Shit. You're a god. Ain't no way you get how this feels. You know, the only time Raiden and I ever fought? When I left the Sky Temple to live among humans. Do not become attached to them, Fujin. Sentiment will impede the execution of your duty. But warriors like you and I, we are strengthened by sentiment. We do not fight to kill enemies. We fight to protect our loved ones. That is why it cuts so deeply when we fail. Well, I'll be. Maybe you do get it. Kronika knows your pain. She manipulates you with it. Jacqueline is on her way here. Kronika expects you to fight her. Worse even, break her heart. Is that someone who cares one whit about you or your family? Can you fight? I'll do what I can. Kronika offered the future, but instead you will have none. Blame only yourselves for this fate. It is your fate that should concern you, Cetrion. Well, Shang Tsung, your strategy proved sound after all. Of course it did. Hands open! 
over your head, Shang Tsung. You too, Sindel. That hair so much as twitches. Ease up, baby girl. Dad? How did you get here? We're all on the same side against Kronika. Yes. And now we must bring this to Raiden. Is that a crown? Kronika's crown. Without it, she lacks the power to restart history. About time we had some good news. Now that we have this, we're in uncharted territory. We've changed this timeline for good. Correct. No one can predict what happens next. Not even me. I must return to Outworld to aid Katana Khan. Thank you for aiding us. We will rendezvous at the Sea of Blood in six hours. Until our next battle. Sorcerer. I'll go with the Briggs family to brief the special forces. May the Great Spirit protect you. May she protect you, Fujin, when Raiden lays eyes on you with Shang Tsung. Failure rests on my shoulders. No. I underestimated Shang Tsung's ingenuity. To escape the void. To return from the future. I will face him again, Mother. This time, I will succeed. I must go. With Shang Tsung in possession of the crown, he's become far too dangerous. And I doubt his new allies realize quite how dangerous he is. Your Shaolin masters, they're ready. They will fight until the last man. That is likely what it will take. There will not be a fight if Karon does not help us. Is there any word from Grandmaster Hasashi? No. If we do not hear soon, I will return to the Nether Realm. Wrong Scorpion. This cannot be good. Get Raiden. The Fire Gardens. Rebuilt. The Shirai Ryu are indeed restored. Why are you here, Scorpion? Where is Grandmaster Hasashi? He is dead. And now you have come to finish us. I understand your mistrust, but I am here to assist you. I find that impossible to believe. What is he doing here? We are not together. If you are here to help, prove it. Join me against the Sorcerer. I shall. Fujin? Raiden thought you lost when the timeline was broken, but you stand with Shang Tsung. We have urgent news for Raiden. Please, let us pass. This may be the sorcerer's trick. The Fire Gardens will not be defiled by his presence. <laughs> Why you have joined Shang Tsung is beyond me, Fujin. What has he done to corrupt your mind? Perhaps listen before you judge. Hang 
Thank you, Fujin. The storm is not yet past. Shang Tsung! We must speak with you, brother. We, Fujin? Since when are you friends with this filth? I'm here to save you, Raiden. We hail from your tragic future. In it, Liu Kang defeated Kronika, but their battle destroyed her crown. Without this, a broken timeline couldn't be repaired. Our only hope was to return here, steal the crown, and make use of its power. Now we can change the outcome of the fight against Kronika. We can defeat her and fix time. I had never thought you gullible, brother. Shang Tsung's schemes serve only to benefit him. How could you fall for such lies? Be rational, Raiden. Spread your falsehoods elsewhere, sorcerer. You will not deceive us. Lord Raiden, we should listen. He may be telling the truth. There is only one way to find out. <laughs> Now, Shang Tsung, the truth! Raiden, stop this! Step aside, Liu Kang. Put down the amulet. Its darkness is taking hold of you. <laughs> you also betray me! This is not the way. Shang Tsung is not the enemy this time. The realms hang in the balance, and you form this unholy alliance? <laughs> Enough of this madness. If you both must die, so be it. My brother is my problem. I will signal if I need help. Shinnok's amulet inflames your anger and clouds your judgment. Have faith in me. Now listen, brother. We're running out of time. I am a fool. I have allowed myself to become a slave to anger. I will not allow my temper to fracture our resolve further. Surely you jest, Lord Fujin. Not at all, Liu Kang. Raiden's power makes you a fire god. Of course it does. Unfortunately, I cannot transfer my power to Liu Kang yet. First, I must free his Revenant from Quan Chi's curse. We will face the Revenant soon enough. What else can you tell us about the final battle? We must use every advantage. Enjoying your travels. You have already been defeated once, Kronika. Of course, Fujin. How else could you have escaped the void? If you know this, accept the inevitable. Surrender. But clearly my loss was not your victory, Raiden. If your future savior had gained full control of my hourglass, we would not be here. This timeline would no longer exist. I see no harm in confirming your suspicion. Even if you defeat me, what then? Who claims the hourglass? Surely you realize that Shang Tsung will break your alliance. We are prepared, Kronika. Are you? Have you wondered why Shang Tsung knows so much about my crown? Because he did your bidding, gathering souls to fuel it. Shang Tsung is far too modest. The crown is his design. No one, 
save me, knows more about its power. Had I told you, we would still be marooned at the beginning of time, bickering among ourselves. You must decide, Raiden. Who do you wish to keep time for all of creation? Me, or Shang Tsung? Neither, Kronika. You will be beaten. And if Shang Tsung betrays us, we will finish him. You are a fool, Raiden. Do not condemn the realms to oblivion. Instruct you in its ways. What just happened? Kronika came here to retrieve the crown. We forced her to retreat. We must strike while she is weakened. Let us join the armies massing at the Sea of Blood. Together we will storm Kronika's Isle and take command of the Hourglass. We will rendezvous at the Isle of Kronika. The fools believe victory is at hand. Their misplaced confidence will be their demise. Such a pity my daughter embraces their sentimental values. Having second thoughts in them. Hardly. Katana courts a peasant and obeys the Thunder God. She couldn't be a bigger disappointment. One can only imagine. The Isle. Do not be late. An eternal empire awaits you. Enter. Kitana Khan. Oh, don't be so formal, Mother. You are Khan Katana. Command the awe of your subjects, even me. Oh, I shall never tire of greeting you. Nor will I tire of calling on you. Our battalion is leaving for the Sea of Blood. Queen Shiva and the Shokan will follow as rear guard. May I request something? Mother, you don't have to... Make your request. Shiva, 
Queen Shiva risked everything to restore me. Honor demands that I accompany her into battle. Yes, it does. And that display of loyalty is sure to rally the Shokan spirits. Thank you, Kitana Khan. Chamber will heal your wounds. Then we'll discipline Katana and take back our throne. Empress? Tell me I misheard. Tell me you would not betray your daughter. She takes after her father, Shiva. Jared was a weak king. Katana is a weaker Khan. Weak? She defeated Shao Khan. Yet she lacked the resolve to kill him. Now she will learn. Enemies must be crushed, lest they rise again. That was true once, but now there is a better way to lead. <laughs> Elder gods tremble before me, Shiva. What hope did you have? Kitana murdered your Shokan brethren. Shiva challenged her and suffered this punishment. Swear your allegiance, and I shall see her avenged. the hourglass. Eternity will be our empire. We'll have all the time we need. Shao Kahn, Sindel, come with me. Kronika has need of you. Kronika? Where was she when Katana stole my throne? We'll make a choke on her empty promises. Observe, wife, as I disassemble this construct. Nothing would please me more. Do not invoke Kronika's wrath, Shao Kahn. Fear that gold-plated relic? Ha! I'll pope you and send you back to her in jars. Do you enjoy? 
enjoy this. against us. Perhaps we should send the fleet. No. Shao Kahn and Sindel have unwittingly given us back the advantage. Their army will battle Raidens for possession of my crown, weakening them both. Then we crush what remains of them with strength to spare. The crown once again will be mine. When it is, the new era will begin. Captain Cage reporting for duty, sir. Uh, I mean, ma'am. Whoa there, 90s dad. You've already got one bullet wound too many. I'm healed, Cassie. Raiden gave me one of his Thunder Hands massages. Speaking of, where is Mama Bear? She's over there, waiting for Shiva at the rendezvous. But we cast off in five. Where are they? Gender, or is that sexist? Just zip it and try not to die. Enough prattle, fools. You will bow and serve the Empire. Make us, you authoritarian asshole. Deal with the Jester. I'll school this unruly child. You school me? You know I toasted Shinnok, right? Ha! <laughs> Shinnok schemed because he was worthless in battle. That you beat him only proves that truth. <laughs> <laughs> man is heartbroken. Why waste tears on weaklings? Those women are braver and stronger than 50 of you put together. Okay, bozos. No jokes, no gimmicks, just combat. You want to get nuts? Oh, -ho. let's get nuts. How many of his bones shall I break for you, wife? 
surprise me. Twice you fought in the tournament, and twice you failed. Why Raiden thought you a contender baffles me. Was that your best? Raiden and Fujin have gone ahead to storm the Isle. But we've lost all contact with our rear guard. Commander Cage and the Special Forces, Queen Shiva and the Shokan, and Mother. I am just going to say what we are all thinking. She did not betray us. Let's not jump to conclusions. Look! Is that the special forces? No. Elder Gods, damn you, mother. Not after your epic failure at the Colosseum. That belongs to me, Sindel. Have it. I hope you have more than that for the heir of the great Kung Lao. He and I have unfinished business. I'll find Katana. It's a pity the time merger disrupted the tournament. I was about to snap your neck. Why? Because you were afraid to face me head on? I fear nothing, monk. You're a disgrace to your line. Kulao, snapping your neck would be too easy for you. Tell me, did your masters teach you to swim? Come, Katana awaits.
has Shao Kahn used on you this time? Naive girl. Your mother is not bewitched. She never has been. She had a husband and a kingdom, and you took them away. <laughs> oh, Kitana. My first husband, your father, was a fool. Jared believed that we were no better than commoners. He refused to assert the privileges of our throne. He traded away our powers, our divine rights. Edenia grew weak and vulnerable. Then Shao Kahn invaded, embracing his power, taking what was his. Here was a man unashamed to assert his privilege, and who vowed to protect mine. I had found my true love. And to consecrate our bond, I killed Jared for him. You love Shao Kahn more than your own daughter? Let the women be, chosen one. You owe me combat. It is my destiny to defeat you, Shao Kahn. Yours is to grovel before me, boy. After we kill Kronika, that will be everyone's destiny. Even for you, that is madness. Fight. <laughs> to Outworld. She conspired with Raiden to lead you astray. He seeks Kronika's power. Why? To destroy the Empire. All who follow Katana are complicit in her treason. Your sentence is death. But we will grant clemency now and riches in the new era. To all who renounce Kitana and fight under our command. Now, man the oars. We have a battle to win for the new era. She'll be put in chains. Let her suffer the anguish of defeat. And what of him?
moment. Lead the charge. Go. I'll cover it. Kronika's schemes have pitted us against each other. That cycle must end, Liu Kang. You will have to kill me. I would rather save you. By the Elder Gods! Smashed my legs. Shao Kahn. Sindel and Shao Kahn. I will do it. Save your strength for Liu Kang. No, brother. The crown is our burden to share. Thank you. Your lies are revealed, sorcerer. Shang Tsung? You should be more vigilant, Fuji. Now bear witness, as the power to decide destiny becomes mine. You are trapped in the void. Chronicle was wise to banish me. With this crown, I am her equal. Your evil will not triumph. <laughs>
how does it feel knowing that you will be the last night wolf? The great spirit will choose another. I may die, but the mantle will live on. Fool. The mantle dies with you. His soul is not yours to take. His soul and yours are mine. You think us unprepared? Your treachery is expected, sorcerer. You are incapable of choosing the righteous path. The path I choose ends with your soul sworn to my service. That future is now undeniable. Now I choose your destiny. No. Keep them alive. We can siphon their powers for eternity. All the better. Soon has breached our defenses. Victory is still at hand. We will put down Shang Tsung's defiance, but you will require more assistance. Dearest Cetrion, you have served me admirably. Now there is one final service you must perform. Yes, Mother. I understand. be our privilege to wield it. Please, allow me. Shang Tsung, pretender to my role. Your strategy has been novel. But in the end, you will not prevail. Finish them!
how easily you are felt, Kronika. Once your power's mine, I will rule eternity. <laughs> Killing Kronika is my destiny. Yours is to serve me, my obedient subjects, projecting my influence throughout the realms. You're drunk on the crown's power, Shang Tsung. In your stupor, you forget your place. He is a dog who betrays his masters. Come, let's put him down. My service to you is over. prefer to be wiped from history. Sculpting the sands of time requires great power and skill. You may wear my crown, but you are not a titan. Destiny is mine. You should have accepted my offer, Kronika. I would have allowed you to wield great influence. Surely, service is better than death. I do not serve. I am a titan. <laughs> you were, Kronika. Liu Kang, I thought your duties required you stay behind. A lie, something you know well. I see now. The hourglass showed that only I could wield the crown against Kronika successfully. You let me win. And to ensure victory, you sacrifice the lives of your friends. How deliciously cold-blooded. They are not gone, Shang Tsung. They will live again in my new era. Your new era? You underestimate my prowess, Chosen One. I have the crown. I have absorbed Kronika's power. You may have attained godhood, but I am the keeper of time. You are no match for me. Kronika said much the same, Shang Tsung. You will share her fate.
Now hand over the crown. This is your only chance. My only chance? This is my triumph and your final moment. Your worthless existence is at its end. Make no mistake, Shang Tsung. You have chosen this fate. will be twisted by your evil. Lao. Where did you... Who... Who are you? I am Lord Liu Kang, God of Thunder and Fire. God of... Forgive my disrespect, my lord. Enough, Kung Lao. You are humble, not like the Kung Lao I knew. The Kung Lao you knew? A story for another time. I have chosen you as my champion, Kung Lao. We have work to do. You must be prepared. Trained. Trained? For what? Savor your death for eternity. You are mad, Shang Tsung. Your visions are nothing. Delusions of an adult mind. Your soul is weak. Existence ends in shame. All the power that was once yours is mine. Forever.
speak, minions. My lord, your will is done. Outworld, Earthrealm, the Netherrealm, all are conquered. Per your command, Chaos Realm and Order Realm are next. All realms will soon yield to your influence. <laughs> it has begun. I began work, painting over the darkness. After eons passed, I sketched out the realms. After eons more, I brushed them in with life. In my new era, all beings will have the opportunity to find peace. Whether or not they do will be their responsibility. For my power only permits me to begin this endeavor. It is the duty of mortals to finish it. is about to be rewarded for I have saved the best for last I have recently discovered a cure-all of unrivaled potency it will soon be on the shelves in every home of Outworld this elixir is crafted from an ancient recipe it has Patreon flowers Margovian nectar powdered teeth of an Arctican dragon all this and more, infused with powerful Lycorian magic. There is a village in the next canton over, where everyone has purchased this miracle cure. Overnight, all diseases, even Tarkat, have disappeared. Now magic this potent is expensive. And I am sure you're asking yourselves, can I afford it? But the true question you must ask is, can I afford to be without it? You lie, Shang Tsung. Your cures are useless. I'm sorry, you are. Someone fool enough to have believed you. My daughter was dying when you came to my farm. You promised a miracle, and I gave you all I had. But only days later... She was dead. <laughs> that is impossible. My magic could not have failed her. There was no magic! I took your elixir to an Imperial mage, and you know what she said? <laughs> it's nothing! Just Borjang tea! The mage is mistaken, kind sir. My elixirs are of superior quality. Their efficacy is guaranteed.
backwater folk are far more likely to trust a kindly old man. You're on behalf of a dissatisfied customer. If it's revenge you want, have at it. If it's restitution, there's nothing left. What I want, Shang Tsung, is to elevate you. To make you the great sorcerer that now you can only pretend to be. A generous offer. Why me? You are uniquely resilient. Who else could eke out a living traveling Outworld's hinterlands, selling quack cures and fake magic? <laughs> a living? It is barely survival. And you were meant for more. To live among kings, not peasants. But since before you were born, you have been conspired against by those who fear how formidable you could become. How do you know this? Who are you? I am your deliverer, Shang Tsung. Join me, and I will put the realms at your feet. Good harvest, Kung Lao. Yes. <clears throat> it is a blessing, Raiden. You would rather we starve? No, no, of course not. But we've worked these fields since we were kids. In 40 years, we'll still be here. Stooped and feeble like old man Wei. <clears throat> as long as I've known you, you've dreamed of leaving Fengjian. Why can't you be happy here? Our ancestors fought in great wars. They died with honor and glory. Stories of our great adventures <laughs> will be passed down for generations. It may not be glorious, but what we do helps the village thrive. I know. But is it so wrong to want some excitement? If that's what you want, may I suggest a bet? Dinner at Madame Beau's tonight. Last to fill their cart pays. You work faster than me? Ha! Since when? You're on, Raiden. I am starving. I wonder what Madame Beau is making tonight. For you two, whatever you want. Thank you, Madame Beau. You spoil us. Like the sons I never had. Have you two been practicing my lessons? As we can. The harvest leaves us little time for martial arts. Since your first words, Kung Lao, you've mouthed nothing but excuses. If you fail to prepare... Your preparations will fail you. Good. You haven't forgotten. But we'll see if I make you anything special tonight. I'm glad you're paying. Madame Bo might just pad the bill with her anger. I am paying? You finished work last. But I delivered my cart first. Delivered? Huh. The bet was filled. That's not what I remember. So that's how it is, eh? What do you say we settle this man to man? Hmm? <laughs> Wait, you mean fight? Yes. Right here, right now. Madame Bo can watch, critique our form. Best two out of three? Fair enough. We must be careful. 
Madame Bo will kick us out if we break something. <laughs> oh, this won't last long enough for that to happen. You will be down in no time. Beaten me yet. The day's coming, come now. <laughs> Keep telling yourself that. You were hungry. <clears throat> oh. Everything was delicious, Madame Beau. Thank you, Raiden. You boys are always a pleasure to cook for. Madam Bo, the Lin Kuei await your answer. I have been busy, Smoke. The Lin Kuei? Who are they? Don't know, but I don't like where this is going. What do we do? Stay ready. Madam Bo, it is a simple choice. Pay for our protection or risk harm to this fine establishment. You'll get nothing from me. That, Madame Bo, is unfortunate. Against us, you are in over your head. We don't care who you are or who you are with. You will not menace Mad Bow. Now who's in over his head? This was you? Honestly, I'm surprised too. Come on. Let's help Madame Bo. How does he do that? I have no idea. You interfere with Lin Kuei business. Leave or face our wrath. Abandon Madame Bo. Not happening. Get over here! Want more? I have plenty. You should have fled when you could. Prepare to regret ever crossing the Lin Kuei. It is you who will regret crossing me. before I put you down like the rest of your Lin Kuei. You haven't a prayer against the Lin Kuei's Grand Master. Are you sure you're a Grand Master?
interesting. Kung Lao, over here! Madame Bo, she's out cold. Oh no, is she... Dead? Not yet. Madame Bo, how are you... Kung Lao. So, Madame Bo, are they ready? A bit thick in the head, perhaps. But they are ready. His eyes are glowing. I am Lord Liu Kang, God of Fire, and Protector of Earthrealm. God? Earthrealm? Madame Bo has been preparing you for this moment since you were boys. Today, you have proven worthy of joining my champions. This fight was... a test? Of your ability and character, yes. Li Han, Kuai Liang. So these two aren't thugs? The Lin Kuei is a centuries-old clan dedicated to Earthrealm's defense. You keep saying Earthrealm. Don't you mean Earth? You boys have so much to learn. Earth is only a part of Earthrealm. Earthrealm itself is one of many realms. Together, they comprise the whole of the universe. The realms can be fierce, bitter rivals. That's why we need champions to defend ours. The time draws near for the Grand Martial Arts Tournament between Earthrealm and the Realm of Outworld. Held once each century, it allows each realm to demonstrate its strength. While our realms are at peace, there are Outworlders who would prefer us to be at war. Our victory in the tournament will temper their zeal. I've taught you everything I can. You must finish your training with Lord Liu Kang. More training? These two couldn't defeat us. <laughs> <laughs> what? They were pulling their punches. Had we not held back, you would not have survived. Come. The monks at the Wuxi Academy await to continue your tutelage. I am ready, Lord Liu Kang. And you, Raiden? Leave Feng Jian? I'm needed here. Earthrealm needs you, Raiden. You'll best serve the village by being one of its champions. I understand. Excellent. I will join you soon. First, there are other champions I must gather. We're off the map. We should go back, recheck the route. It's this way.
Turn them off. And we're definitely getting warmer. How are these still burning? Oil bubbles up from the ground. The chamber channels it somehow. the floor that's not just any metal it's liquid mercury shit that stuff's toxic fatal only step where I step huh? what did I say the explosives that's our bridge do this right it'll fall across Time to die, crazy lady. You okay? Yes, we ready? <laughs> Physics for the win. Let's go. Museum. Now where's that shield? I am not yet defeated! Yes, you are. Time to go home. Kai! Freddy! I knew it! Ooh. I felt that one. You felt it too, right? Temple of Kataravala, take 39. Tail slayed. That's a wrap. Steven, this was fantastic. Thank you. <laughs> oh, just like the old days. And these props. Jimbo killed it. <laughs> you did too, Johnny. 
Hey, uh, about my pitch. You know, the karate zombie thing? I'm thinking four films. Maybe a streaming series? Johnny, I don't have... You're right. Not here. I'll swing by your office after I change. Mm, I can't. Uh, have to be with the editors. Marsha will call you. Great! Have your assistant call me. That was great, Han. Wasn't it, though? We need to celebrate. I'm thinking private party. But, Johnny, we need to talk. You're not the martial arts megastar you once were, honey. You're lucky Steven owed you a favor. I'm telling you, Chris, we're fine. Can you join me in the fact-based universe just once? We're broke. We have to cut back. Cut back? On what? Step one is selling this place. Mm. I need a refill. Johnny, we can't keep this up. You spent 10000 on that sculpture, 30000 on that drone, and this damn sword. Three million dollars? Hey, Cento is history. That sword comes from... Ugh, that's not the point, Johnny! Chris, honey, the parts, the money, they're coming. Steven's movie is just the beginning. That's why I can't cut back. To be a success, I have to project it. If I don't, Johnny Cage is done. I didn't marry Johnny Cage. I married John Carlton. I'd give anything to have him back. Chris, come on, Chris, where are you going? Fuck! How do you like that, Mr. Haylist? Thank God. Oh, Chris, honey, I... Where's my wife? What did you... Your wife left. She's fine. You will be too, if you cooperate. What do you want? Sento. You some kind of hired gun? Or do you know Sento's history? I know it. It's my family blade. No. No way you're Tyra clan. They've been dead for centuries. Not dead. Hiding. With Sento in my hands, I'll lead us out of the shadows. That's a great plan, stranger. Except for one thing. Sento's mine. And I won't give it up without a fight. My house, my rules. So, you have a name or what? Kenji Takahashi. <laughs> I knew you weren't Tyra Clan. You know nothing, Cage. 400 years ago, the Tyra Clan were one of Japan's first families. They lost Sento after getting slaughtered at the siege of Aomori. There were survivors. They hid themselves by shedding the name Tyra for Takahashi. They joined the Bakuto for its protection. The Yakuza's predecessors. From first family to crime family. I will break us free of the Yakuza's corruption. Reclaim our name and our position. But my clan won't follow me unless I prove that I can lead. That's why I need Sento. And that's Malibu's finest. It's a great story. Bullshit. <laughs> but great. You should seriously consider becoming a screenwriter. What in the actual fuck? Good evening, Johnny Cage. I am Liu Kang, protector of Earthrealm. May we enter? Uh, nothing's being shot here tonight. Uh, you sure you're in the right place? Yes. We come on a matter of grave importance. We must speak to you and your guest. 
What? How do you know about him? Because I am the god of fire. Chris, you vixen. Nicely done. Sure. I, I come right in. Glowing eyes are a nice touch. Kenshi Takahashi. A tragic figure with a noble cause. Your actions this evening do you no credit. Who are these people? You tell me. They're your scene partners. I also know of your struggles, Johnny Cage. I am here to offer you both a path forward. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> oh, come on, guys. Let's call this. Chris was a doll to set this up, but as pranks go, this one's a bit obvious. This is no prank. Behind, Kui Liang. If you please. All right, all right. <laughs> I'll play my part in this uh, martial arts LARP. The missus ought to get what you paid for. Ah. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> hey, you. Uh, wait, wait. Hey, you. Get your damn hands off him. I said, get your hands off him. <laughs> Was that necessary, brother? To put him in his place. That was a Hichuli. One of a kind. All right, I don't care if this is a damn prank. You cross the line. And scene. I hope you're insured, because you're paying for my Hichuli. Imbecile. You have no idea with whom you're dealing. Enough. Ah, uh, that's no special effect. Indeed, Johnny Cage. Kui Liang. Okay, let's go back to one here. Who are you again? Lord Liu Kang, protector of Earthrealm. God of fire. Well, that last one tracks. But what's an Earthrealm? All will be explained, Johnny Cage. For now, what is important is that you both have been chosen to join its champions. Why him? Or me, for that matter. Because I have faith that you will rise to the challenge. And because your service will change the arcs of your lives. That is not a good idea. It is genius, Raiden. The next time we see Sub-Zero, I will have to thank him for inspiring it. Ow! See? It won't be effective. Maybe it's too effective. Uh, we just need to get on with it. We've been cooped up here for months. I can't base a cinematic universe on Outworld's monsters and magic if I don't ever see them. That's why you're here? Liu Kang said this gig would change the arc of my life. That's how it gets done. My ex will rue the day she gave up on me. <sighs> so selfless. Oh, please, Tattoo. You're just here to get your sword back. We all have our reasons for being here. Some better than others. But we are not here to fight among ourselves. We are here to fight for Earthrealm. It's about damn time. And today, one of you will be chosen to fight for it at the tournament. 
Only one of us, Lord Liu Kang? Isn't Outworld fielding several champions? The tournament's rules give the host realm that advantage. And it is Outworld's turn as host. You know, I don't know why I've never asked this, but, uh... <laughs> what's our record at this tournament? Earth Realm and Outworld have long been evenly matched. But Outworld is gaining strength. Should it win, its more militant factions will be emboldened. I thought you admired Outworld. It is a place of great knowledge, wealth, and beauty. But our realms do not share goals and beliefs. We coexist peacefully, because Outworld respects our strength. Should we show weakness, our rival will become our enemy. I will not lose, Lord Liu Kang. First, you must win the right to represent us. Whichever one of you outlasts the others will be chosen. Raiden, step forward. <laughs> Good call. Call the weak first. You shall face him, Johnny Cage. Ready for your close-up? All right, let's do this. But remember, farm boy, I'm a global martial arts icon. I don't think you can handle this much boom. I am ready, Johnny Cage. My mind and spirit fight as one. This fight was an honor. You're welcome. Kenshi Takahashi, you are next. You have skills, Raiden, but you're inexperienced. Whatever experience I lack, I make up for in heart. It's nerve, not heart, that wins fights. I should know. I've been in hundreds of them. Do you still question my nerve? I do not. Yours was a well-earned victory. You may rest, Raiden. This evening, you will face your final opponent. Fifty bucks says Kung Lao wins. Make it interesting. Bet me Sento. <laughs> Not on your life. Raiden, Kung Lao. The winner of this match will represent Earthrealm against Outworld. It is a grave duty, not to be undertaken lightly. You may step back now and suffer no dishonor. I choose to fight, Lord Liu Kang. As do I. Then may the best person win. <laughs> Concede, Raiden. You have never beaten me. That won't change today. No. If the monks have taught us one thing, it's that the only constant in the universe is change. There is a first time for everything, Kung Lao. Although you have all trained well, Raiden has excelled. This outcome does not surprise me. How could I have... Congratulations, Raiden. For the tournament, you will need this. Forged by the Elder Gods, it gives the wearer power over lightning and thunder. Go ahead. Try it. It is incredible, but...
but is it necessary? In addition to possessing great might, the outworlders you will face also wield great magic. The amulet levels the playing field. You must be careful, Raiden. You could get hurt, even killed. No tournament participant has ever been grievously injured or killed. <laughs> I would never send my champions unwittingly into mortal combat. We leave in seven days for Outworld's capital, Sundo. The tournament will be held at the palace of Empress Sindel. Outworld can be both alien and intoxicating to Earthrealmers. Do not become drawn in. You must focus on the task at hand. Sindel's daughters, yes. They do not disappoint. We are Earthrealm's ambassadors, Johnny. We'll show them respect, not unwanted attention. Lord Liu Kang, welcome. Thank you, Princess Melina. You remember my sister? Of course, Princess Kitana. May I introduce Johnny Cage, Kung Lao, Kenshi Takahashi, and Earthrealm's champion, Raiden. I hope you're prepared, Raiden. Our champions are determined to win. None more so than me. It's been too long since we've known victory. Princess Melina, we should be on our way. Empress Sindel awaits. Thank you, Tanya. Follow me, please. Six-armed beings are not Nodens. The monks described them, but seeing them in person? I see that Her Majesty once again spares no expense on the festival. Should she not? It commemorates my late father. I admire, Princess. I do not judge. As did all of Outworld, I valued greatly Jared's fellowship. <laughs> Our route was to be clear. This couldn't wait. Should I allow Tarkatans to infect the city, Your Highness? Those arrested were harboring some here, rather than report them for quarantine. The Earth Realmers cannot be privy to our secrets, Li Mei. As Sundo's first constable, you must show better judgment. Perhaps that's too much to expect. Princess Melina doesn't seem to like her very much. Li Mei used to lead the Umgadi, the palace guard. It was on her watch that the princess's father was murdered. <laughs> Worry expends energy for no purpose, Raiden. But the tournament, if I lose... Focus on your actions, 
not the outcome. It is all you can control. Red alert. Incoming stock villain. General Shaw. Do not let him go to you. <laughs> is it me? Or is Earth Realm's champion scrawnier than usual? Would you care to test his strength? Raiden will. Will prove himself soon enough. Have you still not told most Earth Realmers that Outworld exists? It is safer that way, General. I suppose so. Your people's frail minds couldn't handle the truth. You presume them frail, General. Should you? Given how frequently they win this tournament? We will destroy your champion, Liu Kang. He will taste no victory. Welcome, members of the Royal House. Welcome, our esteemed Earthrealm guests. We gather once again to honor my late husband's legacy, to continue the tournament that he founded with Lord Liu Kang in hopes that it would foster peace among realms. May Jared's soul watch over us with pride from its resting place in the living forest. Lord Liu Kang. Empress Sindel, it pleases me to once again be your guest. Here, you are always welcome. Now, let us meet your champion. Earthrealm's champion is Raiden, your majesty. He has earned his place by embodying the very best qualities of Earthrealm's people. You seem nervous, young man. I'm a stranger in an unfamiliar land, here to compete against its greatest fighters. Yes, I am nervous. As you should be, you have a difficult path ahead. It has begun. As tradition requires, Outworld's initial competitor will be Sundo's first constable, Li Mei. May she defend our realm's glory, as well as she preserves our capital's order. Your Majesty, I will honor both the Royal House and all of Outworld with my combat. If so, you will vastly exceed my expectations. Remember, were it not for Jared's tradition, you would not be here. All you need do is your best. The rest will take care of itself. Yes, Lord Liu Kang. Shall we see what you can do? Hopefully, this will be the first of many victories. I will prevail, Earthrealmer. This fight is more important to me than you can ever know. Thank you for the match, First Constable. My compliments, Raiden, on a well-fought match. We'll see how you fare in the next. General Shao, whom have you chosen as our next competitor? Your Majesty, I have chosen Reiko, my second in command. As a boy, Reiko was orphaned during the Kafala War. Though captured, his spirit remained unbroken, 
He scratched, clawed, and survived. After the war, I took him in. Molded him into the perfect soldier. Few others are as well versed in the ways of war. <laughs> In whose army have you served? In what wars have you fought? I have done neither. Then you are woefully unprepared, Earthrealmer. This will be your last battlefield. Felled by a simple farmer. I am ready for my next opponent, Your Majesty. Whom shall I face? Patience, young man. We are adjourned until first light. I hope to see you all at this evening's banquet. I'm sorry, you're 10,000 years old? Oh, talk about aging gracefully. What do you see in him? He is a hero, Raiden. Though he may not yet know it. Do you recognize everyone here? Most, yes. From your descriptions. Except for him. That is Rain, the High Mage of Outworld. Not his given name but one earned due to his mastery of water magic. Are you unwell, princess? Uh, I'm fine, Tanya. I know I'm to fight Melina, but will I also face Tanya? By tradition, you should not. If you did, you would be tested. Why? Umgadi, like Tanya, are warrior priestesses, selected from the firstborn daughters of Outworld. From infancy, they are trained to defend the royal family. Outworld must see much conflict if the Empress needs such protection. Its past has been difficult, though the last thousand years of Empress Sindel's reign have been a true golden age. The memories of that strife still linger. My husband, Jared, believed that the future of our realms lay together. Let us move forward in open dialogue, letting no secrets tear our bonds asunder. Your Majesty, it's an honor to be here and to meet your people. I can already see there's more that joins us than divides us. <laughs> our peoples could not be more different, champion. Excuse me? You heard me. Earth realm is a devoid of all. That's enough, General. My apologies, Your Majesty. Perhaps I've enjoyed too much of this excellent wine. With your permission. You may go. It is bad enough we may lose to the Earth Realmers, but then you go and drunkenly insult them? You needlessly stain my honor and your family's proud military tradition. May I speak freely, Your Majesty? <sighs> Again with this? If you must. We must act on the Sorcerer's prophecy. He warns that Liu Kang will conquer Outworld. And his predictions are usually impeccable. But I've no proof of Liu Kang's ill intent. His interventions have kept Outworld at peace for centuries. He herds us into compromises, shackles our independence. If we could meet our enemies in battle, we'll take- You would consign us to endless war. Better that than be Liu Kang's lapdog.
If I see evidence of the prophecy's accuracy, we will act. But only then, and only at my command. Did not your illustrious father teach you that war is the last resort, not the first? He did, your majesty. Do not forget that, General. Come. You asked to see us? I saw what happened this evening. Uh, there was nothing. Was something I ate. Was it? I can't chance it, can I? If you fight tomorrow, the symptoms of your disease could manifest. Katana will take your place. What? There are already whispers she should replace me as your heir. This will make them screams! Your illness is your fault. Why you left the palace that night unattended is still beyond me. I just needed time alone, away from all this. I never thought that... That's your problem, Melina. You never think. A mother is only trying to protect you, sister. If your disease becomes known, you will be banished to the wastes. For you to hold the throne, we must keep your secret. <sighs> you continue to surprise, Raiden. Among others, you have defeated Kotal, Motaro, and Shiva. Only two fights remain. Are you ready, Earthrealmer? I am, your majesty. Then next you face my daughter, Katana. Your majesty, this is unprecedented. Raiden's next opponent should be your heir. Melina is unavailable. She's away on pressing Imperial business. But I have not prepared him to battle Katana. He's already demonstrated great skill. Can he not improvise? Do not worry. I can do this. Very well. I will be no easier to fight than my sister, Earthrealmer. I suffer under no such delusion, your highness. I will win this fight. For her, my empress, and all of Outworld. You fight well, princess. As do you, Earthrealmer. Surprisingly so. I hope we meet again. Under different circumstances. It's time for the final match. It's a testament to your abilities that you've made it thus far. But now you must face General Shao. Victor of the Tavarian War. Conqueror of the Quatan Plains. Defender of the Navala Coast. As has his family for generations, General Shao defends us with zeal and tenacity. All of Outworld is grateful for his service. That's a notable list of accomplishments, General. It is a mere fraction of them. A full recitation would take days. It's over. I have done it! Congratulations, Raiden. Earthrealm wins. <clears throat> May I assist you? Stay away, Earthrealmer. Well done. You have exceeded my greatest expectations. Thank you, Lord Liu Kang. Because of you, the Outworlders who would disturb the peace will once again be held at bay. Come, let us bid our hosts farewell and return to Earthrealm. All right, yeah! That was great! Very impressive. Friend. It's 
been eons. It's good to see you. Likewise, Lord Liu Kang. I have watched you with the hourglass. You are relishing your role as Earthrealm's protector. It suits me far better than being Keeper of Time ever did. I never wanted to replace Kronika. Being history's architect drove her mad. I had no wish to share her fate. Which is why I am forever grateful that you volunteered to safeguard the Hourglass. Despite my having relinquished its power, the new era has unfolded as it should. You created me in your own image. Duty is my highest calling. While I am glad you are here, you are not one for social calls. Is there trouble with the Hourglass? With something it has shown me. What, Geras? When you restarted history, you altered the destinies of certain malefactors to neutralize them. At least one of them is defying that destiny. Shang Tsung. Go on. He has escaped his meaningless life and is on his way to becoming a powerful sorcerer. He has already infiltrated Sindel's court. I saw no sign of him during the tournament. But if that snake is in Sindel's ear... Your vision of peace may already be compromised. I appreciate this warning, Giris. I will investigate. Please return to the Hourglass and see what else you can learn. So we find him in Outworld and bring him here for questioning? Yes. If what I fear has happened, he is a grave threat to the realms. Anything else? Shang Tsung is a master of deceit. Do not trust a word he utters. Sounds a lot like my first agents. It's a tricky mission. I'd rather Raiden go along than this one. Hey! This one is up for the job. This mission must be done quietly. I am breaking my word with Empress Sindel by sending you into Outworld without her knowledge. Due to the tournament, Raiden is now a familiar face there. Sending him will only increase your risk of being discovered. This talisman is attuned to Shang Tsung's Qi. Follow it to him. And be careful. May the Elder Gods protect you. How old are you, five? What can I say? These boots weren't made for walking. If that is the most pain you feel today, consider yourself lucky. Oh, I'm already lucky. I've got Sento strapped to my back. I will reclaim it, Cage. Got three million? It's yours. You know I don't have it. I bet you your Kuz pals could come up with it. Oh, that's right. You blew him off. Ah, if there's one lesson Hollywood's taught me, it's never burn bridges. You never know who can help. The Yakuza are leeches, bleeding out those too weak to resist. I grew up in that life, and I never understood it. Why my gain required others' pain. I got out. I need my clan out, too. We can't be part of their crimes any longer. What's your precious say? That Shang Tsung is among those... things. Oh, uh, my fans are gonna go nuts cosplaying them a cage gone. Hold him. 
him still. If he squirms, I cannot extract marrow. That's Shang Tsung. Let's jump him after he's done. Oh, in fists of iron? We did this thing where, like, we're not basing strategy on your movies, Cage. Let me go! You can't do this! The wound will heal in time. It is a small price to pay for progress. On second thought, this scene's playing fine without us. <gasps> yeah, I say we let him finish it. We have to save Shang Tsung. Liu Kang needs him alive. How did he do that? I get why you'd want to, but you can't. You're one of his minions. You'll die in his place. Now please, let me explain. Uh, you got us in this. How about getting us out? I know what this looks like, but we don't work for Shang Tsung. If not, why save him? Because Liu Kang... Earthrealm's protector wants to question him. He thinks Shang Tsung may be a threat to both our realms. I'm Kenshi Takahashi. <laughs> our kind do not shake hands. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to offend. Don't you know what we are? No, we don't. We are victims of Tarkat. The disease is not easily gotten. But you can't risk more close exposure. It disfigures, then debilitates. In time, it will turn us all into bloodthirsty monsters. So you weren't always like this? I was once a rich merchant. But when I became ill, I was banished. Now I run this colony. I am Baraka. What does Shang Tsung want with your bone marrow, Baraka? I don't know. But he comes here each month to harvest it. Release us, and we'll capture Shang Tsung. And we'll find out why he's been coming here. I promise. Let them go. Thank you. We won't let you down. This was guiding us to Shang Tsung. Now we can't find him. His laboratory is near. I'll take you. Any idea what to expect? No. I've never been inside. Stay here. We'll check it out. of crushed chitin larva proved an inspired choice. In testing, outcomes improved significantly. I have modified the formula since the last time it was administered. It uses several new ingredients. This new serum is exactly what we need. Its effects will be immediate and long-lasting. How can you be sure? Because it is brewed from freshly extracted Tarkatan marrow, it couldn't be more potent. He is infecting Melina with Tarkat. And he's got two of Sindel's top dogs in on it. No wonder Liu Kang is worried about this guy. We need to stop him. 
Save a distressed damsel? <laughs> sure thing. Get away from her, you bitch. Excuse me? You know, the movie. Tiny girl, ginormous alien. Bradley! No? Seriously? <laughs> Earthrealmers. How did they find it? They've already seen too much. I need time. Buy it for me. Liu Kang sent you, didn't he? Sent you to learn our secrets. He sent us here for Shang Tsung. But it looks like he's just part of the problem. The High Mage is brought low. I thought Umgadi were loyal to the royal house. Yet here you are, scheming against the princess. You trespass in Outworld. Interfere in Imperial matters. It is you, not I, who is the schemer here. Your plot is over. Step away from the table. This is twice you've been a thorn in my side. You Earthrealmers do have unhealthy habits. You heard him. You're not infecting her with Tarka. I am trying to protect her, not infect her. We've heard about how you lie. Excuse us if we're skeptical. Cover him. Princess, are you all right? Uh, is it over? Yes, you're safe. We've stopped Shang Tsung. Stopped him? Why? Princess! Princess, what's wrong? What did you do to her? It's what you've done, fool. Let me help her before it's too late. Time to finish more serum. Johnny, a hand? We got pages for this? Or are we winging it? Whatever we do, we can't hurt her. Her? I'm worried about us. <laughs> Princess, we can help you. Your blood. I smell it. How sweet it will be to lick off my fingers. Johnny, Kong Lao, help hold her down. It's now or never, Shang Tsung. men were sent to disrupt your sister's treatment and scandalize Outworld by revealing her illness. What? That's totally fake news! Princess, we were... Thank you, Goro. I have no stomach for Earthrealm lies. We should detain the Earthrealmers and the Tarkatan we found outside. At least until the Empress is ready to respond to this incursion. Agreed.
But you must realize that this incident proves Earthrealm's bad faith. We must strike them now to protect ourselves. No. No, they would not do this. There must be a misunderstanding. It is no misunderstanding, Princess. It is a confirmation of my prophecy. Left unchecked, Liu Kang will conquer Outworld. I apologize for not arriving sooner to defend your sister. I am glad she received her treatment. The Princess is safe, but the threat from Earthrealm remains. Yes. Quan Chi, when do you anticipate they will strike? Soon. Today's events were foretold in the final quatrains of the prophecy. Then I am right. We must act now, Princess. I will take your concerns to the Empress. It is for her to decide. Rain, Tanya, assist me. What truly happened here, Sorcerer? That the Earthrealmers interrupted the Princess's treatment was happenstance. They were here to capture me for Liu Kang. You? Why? That I must investigate. For now, let us revel in our good fortune. The Earthrealmers' serendipitous arrival has given us ample evidence to convince the Empress of the truth of Quan Chi's prophecy. Conflict with Earthrealm is now inevitable. Not necessarily. The Empress has never been eager for conflict. If she resists, she will be replaced. Outworld needs a steadfast leader. A leader like you, perhaps. If my realm requires it of me... Kill the Earthrealmers. They cannot report back to Liu Kang. Oh, their deaths will also feed the ire between realms. Two birds, one stone. <laughs> Our benefactor will be pleased. She needs the realms at war, not at the brink of it, in order to conquer them both. Only then will we rule at her side. Before she found me languishing in the mines, I would not have thought such a thing possible. But soon, Sheila transformed us from serfs into scions. You've been at that for hours. If you could see, you'd know why. That's not happening, is it? Keep talking, will ya? To keep my mind off this. Tell me about life before you got sick. I was doing well. Trading goods up and down the far top coast. My family was comfortable. Happy. <sighs> then... Tarkat came. It took my wife, then my children. Cruelly, it lets me live for now. I think it enjoys ravaging my body more slowly. Ugh. This hangover. Oh. Can she? God damn it. How bad's the pain? Excruciating. You saved me. I won't forget that. But you may just regret it. What are you doing? Oh. What in the... F when did we take the left turn into survival horror? 
This is Shang Tsung's real laboratory. We're beneath where we were before. That was a false front. Reminds me of this cheap-ass film I did in my early days. Flesh Pits. God, that was trash. Who's that? Our jailer. How is he? His eyes are gouged out. Guess. That will dull the pain. You're vile to be part of this. You are Shang Tsung's prisoner. I am his slave. He has my family. He'll kill them if I don't obey. Shift. He learned that from you? We saw him do that. It was unreal. So how does it work? You just shape shift in anything you want? I can shift only between this and my natural form. You're Zetaren. Your race can shape shift. None can except me. Are they ready? It's time. Time for what, sorcerer? Replication experiments. They begin with your vivisection. I'll use your harvested parts to build new creations. The process is fatal, of course. Liu Kang won't let you get away with this. <laughs> that presumes he will ever learn what happened. But when I am done, there will be no trace left of you. I shall return soon to check progress. I have other matters to which I must attend. You don't have to do this! It's either you or my family. Put them in the chamber. Soon, Baraka. I'm ruined! Shang Tsung will punish me for this by torturing my family. You'll pay. We are leaving. Then kill me. If I die, maybe he'll spare my family. No. I won't murder you. It's mercy, not murder. Not that what I've done deserves yours. You were protecting your family. I would have done the same. What has happened here? Size off, you fool! You've let them ruin everything. Liu Kang would like a word. I cannot be apprehended so easily. Magnetic! 
got a bad feeling about this. I bid you all farewell. Cheer up, Sizoff. I'm reuniting you with your family. They're dead? You killed them? Many moons ago. I do hate loose ends. We gotta get out of here. What's wrong? The door must have sealed when the gas was released. Stand aside! Test your might. Just slow you down. What? Shang Tsung finds you, he'll kill you. Look at me, Cage. I'm useless. Don't risk your lives to save mine. Hey, you are not giving up. The Tyra need you, remember? We are gonna get back home and figure out how to help you. Got it? We can't linger. We'll be captured. We need help getting Kenshi to the portal at Sundo. I can take you only to the city's gates. Forgottens are forbidden inside. I'll see you the rest of the way. It's the least I can do to make amends. God, this reminds me of Wicked Planet. We had this forest in the second act. The Manticore battle. Yes! It was a pain to shoot, but man, did it come out epic. I can picture it exactly. This is the living forest. Aren't all forests living, Baraka? No others have trees that house the souls of the dead. Whoa, whoa wait a tick. We're talking ghosts? Good ones, not evil. You guys know anybody in here? Some distant relatives. You will find no Zaterans. Why not? The warm bloods don't welcome us. So we keep to ourselves, living underground in Sikander province. Then how did you meet Shang Tsung? That I could take human form made me a freak among my people. I was terrorized and run out. Starving and beggared, I joined a traveling carnival. Turned out there are many who would pay good money to see my gift. Uh, back then, Shang Tsung was a, a huckster. We crossed paths, and he saw what I could do. When he began to learn real sorcery, he asked to study me. When I declined, he took my family hostage. Well, that's an offer you can't refuse. He is dangerous. And he has plans. He, General Shao, Rain, they are conspiring. To do what? I can't say for certain. I've only overheard fragments. She sends more demons? Wait! We're not! With each of you I kill, my absolution grows nearer. Shedding your blood brings me closer to the light. Whoever you are, we are not demons. If not demons, what are you? He's a Terran. I am a Denian. Or I was before my Tarkat affliction. Outworlders? Apologies. I'm glad I've caused neither of you permanent injury. <laughs> what is that? Just keep swimming. So, who's our femme fatale? I am Ashra. 
demon of the Netherrealm. Demon? You look human. Mostly. What's a Netherrealm? The monks covered that with us. Did you sleep through every lesson? That one, apparently. <sighs> Netherrealm's hell, but real. No shit. I appear nearly human because I've purged most evil from my soul. When I'm done, the last vestiges of my demonic form will fade away. Why were the demons after you? They were sent by Quan Chi, my former master. I was part of his sisterhood of shadow. He wanted, still wants, dominion over the realms. I renounced him when I realized that I could not help him defile them. And now he wants you dead. Precisely. I followed Quan Chi from the Netherrealm here. He's building devices that steal souls on a mass scale. He's testing the first on the dead that reside in the forest. Why steal souls, Ashra? To harness their power. To what end, I don't know. But I do know that it's to aid the designs of another sorcerer. Sheng Tsung. Damn it. That guy's everywhere. You're sure Quan Chi is here? My Chris senses him. He's nearby. No, no. We're getting you home. We have a job to do. Quan Chi could lead us to Shang Tsung. Your Liu Kang is right. Shang Tsung's a danger that must be dealt with. I will aid you. As will I. Uh, well, I guess the eyes have it. Motion carries. Ashra, lead the way. She is close. The emanations of his evil grow stronger. That is a powerful weapon. And my perfect ally. As I smite the evil it finds, I am further purified. Now I've done steps, so I'm all for self-help. But since when does a demoness want to be less evil? I had spent eternity damned to the Netherrealm. I had assumed that's all there was to existence. But then I saw Earthrealm, saw Outworld, saw there was a better way to live, and that to have it, I needed to cleanse my soul. My sister demons were furious at my change of heart. Kia and Jataka were the first to hunt me. Quan Chi is also a demon? Actually, he's an Outworlder. But he mastered the dark magic needed for unfettered travel to my realm. Any idea how he buddied up with Shang Tsung? They share a common benefactor. She plucked them both from obscurity, taught them everything they know. I've never met her, but there's no question that she is a sorceress beyond compare. Quan Chi is near. Contributions. Excellent, Natara. I need yours as well. Darius and I have been thinking, sorcerer. Do not try to renegotiate, Havoc. We need proof that you'll deliver. That he's delivered for Natara's Veternians is all the proof you need. Serena's right. Because of Quan Chi's magic, my realm's people are no longer poisoned by sunlight. We've finally escaped the shadows. Rest assured, the spells you will receive will bring down Order Realm's government. When will we have them, Quan Chi? After the attack on Earth Realm, which could be called off if the Soul Stealer's efficacy isn't demonstrated promptly. Thicker. 
Earthrealm is in grave danger. Just one soul stealer can kill hundreds of thousands. If he unleashes a battery of their money... Millions will die. He must be stopped. I will deal with Quan Chi. The four of you subdue the others. Whoa there, big fella. This stops where you get off. You heard her. Millions could die. Which is why we don't want you tripping us up out there. Now, give me your sword. Why? Just give it. What? I can't. Not when you've you saved my life. It's yours. Again, you evade capture, Ashra. And now it appears you've found allies. We are joined against you, sorcerer. You won't be stealing any souls. It was forged to destroy evil. It's slain many of your vampire kind. We can't help what we are. That we feed on blood doesn't make us evil. I am one step closer to redemption. Kusimaratov! <laughs> If I'm to liberate Order Realm, I'll not let him fail. Killing one realm to free another is a heinous proposition. One I won't let you fulfill. Fight! <laughs> Take your chaos elsewhere. I always feared you would be trouble, Ashra. You are not compliant like your sisters. And now they're dead by my hand because you sent them against me. I'll never forgive you for that, Quan Chi.
When I'm finished here, I will finish you. <laughs> Now has his power. That was unexpected. You're telling me. Shall we finish this? Let's. This fight's not over. I'll defeat all of Quan Chi's minions. We are many. You are one. We will destroy you. Resistance is never pointless. We are many. You are one. We will destroy you. What's wrong with him? Combat must have weakened the magic that binds his souls together. Sindel, I'll find you. What was that? Watch him. I'll shut down the soul stealer. Since that didn't kill you, I will. Go, Ashra! He's too dangerous to let live. Liu Kang needs to question him. He knows Shang Tsung's plans. <sighs> Very well. Well, clearly I underpaid for that. Did you know what it could do? The legends never mentioned mystical powers. The souls of my ancestors live within it. They intend to guide me. Just don't forget who gave it to you, Takahashi. I won't, Cage. Now, let's get him to Earthrealm. I know home's here for you, Baraka. But size off, Ashra. You can come with if you want. I'm sure Liu Kang will welcome you. I've never had a home. That would be wonderful. Report, Shang Tsung. The Soul Stealers are under construction. Quan Chi tests the final components as we speak. And the army? 
will obey your every command, once it's been fed sufficient souls. I've also conceived the plan to break the Lin Kuei away from Liu Kang. Instead of defending Earthrealm, they will betray it. Excellent. You have learned quickly, Shang Tsung, and well. You will soon reap the bounty of what you've sown. these earth roamers we're looking for you have their descriptions you can at least tell me why they're here what they've done state secrets not for your ears yes princess fetch us water please Entanglements with Ungadi are forbidden. You know their vows. Who told you? No one. I have eyes. As to the snakes at court who would cheer your downfall. The Ungadi's rules are ridiculous. And you can change them when you are Empress. For now, you cannot jeopardize your ascension. Night, night, sweet Prince of Darkness. Oh, perfect. You'll fit right in. You couldn't steal a more functional hat. What? It hides your face. And honestly, it suits you. I still don't know about this. Carrying him around will attract unwanted attention. Look at it out there. It's like Mardi Gras. People will think you just party too hard. <clears throat> What's the word? Go toward the stage, then right to the portal gate. But there are soldiers and constables everywhere. Are you sure these are enough? One person spots us, and we are dead. And that's why I'll create a diversion. They're out for you too, Sizoth. To catch me, they must see me. Damn. You didn't tell me you could go full predator. Princess, unhand me. I'm going nowhere. Douse the fires! Find who set them! Stand down, General. This is my problem, not the military's. Look. Size off. You know him? Who is he? Unimportant. But it means the Earth Realmers are here. Rico!
get him. Blood? You're Zaterran. How can you... There is much you don't know. Like what the General is truly up to. Surrender and I'll hear you out. I can't if you resist arrest. You arrest me, he'll execute me. That's not how I intend to die. Know that I am sorry for disturbing Sundo's peace. Ludicrous. Princess, no. You could be hurt. Insurrection from a Zaterran? This is a day I never thought I'd see. You misread my intentions, Princess. Sadly, I've no time to explain them. Soon, you will know the truth. Take the princess and go. My fight's not with her, or you. It is now that you've laid your hands on her. I will take your life as punishment. My sentence is suspended, Umgadi. Saved by a plucky comic sidekick. <laughs> if we die today, we die together. Not comic, but definitely plucky. It's unlike Shang Tsung to leave loose ends. Now that I'm free of him, I'll reveal your conspiracy to all of Outworld. <laughs> You'll do nothing of the kind. Dead men tell no tales. Fight. You won't silence me, General. We must go. Now! Boom. Johnny, Kenshi, Kung Lao. You have safely returned. By the Elder Gods. Yeah, we had a run-in with Princess Melina's inner demons. She took my sight, but Sento, in its own way, restored it. I am glad that Sento bonded with you. Though my hope was that the means would be different this time. This time? Forgive me, Genshi. I misspoke. The monks will tend to your wounds. We found Shang Tsung, but he got away. I can see why you're twitchy about him. He's neck deep in some serious shit. Rest, eat, then we will discuss. Can I also get a martini? Shaken, not stirred? Ah, I'm sorry. 
Meet the newest members of the Earth Realm players. We wouldn't have made it back without them. Astra and Sizos. You know us? As Earth Realm's protector, there is much I know. Do you also know of my former master, Quan Chi? He colludes with Shang Tsung. A new deadly alliance? Come, all of you. You must tell me all you know. Well, so much for that martini. Shang Tsung and Quan Chi again conspire against Earthrealm? What Johnny and Kenshi report should not be possible. You witnessed how I rewrote history. I gave the sorcerers meaningless lives. They should have never gained power, let alone joined forces. And your work was flawless. Such would their lives have been, had someone not interfered. Interfered? What do you mean? Both sorcerers were visited by this person. It is her intervention that bent the arcs of their lives. Who is she? Unknown. Her identity has been obscured from the hourglass. Who could have that power? Is it Kronika? Somehow resurrected? Impossible. Titans once destroyed cannot be revived. That someone else must have survived the previous timeline. Someone with a vendetta against me. It is the only plausible theory. You must determine its validity, Gears. The fate of the realms may depend on it. Expected to linger. Patience, Bihan. There are many demands on Liu Kang's attention. Were he here, Father would advise us to wait without protest. But now he is gone, and I am Grand Master. His teachings did not pass with him. They should still guide us. Guide us, yes. Shackle us, no. We can't abandon tradition. Mind your place, Tomas. Father may have taken you in made you one of us, but your blood will never be Lin Kuei. Lord Liu Kang can see you now. It is about time. Shang Tsung is here, at the ruins of Ying Fortress. His soul stealers are already under construction. You must destroy them, and capture Shang Tsung before either can inflict harm upon Earthrealm. We will leave immediately. And we will join you. You are not Lin Kuei. You would only hinder the effort. Raiden and I are more than- We're trained differently. It takes years to master our ways. You and Raiden have my full confidence, but you are needed elsewhere. Go to the Wuxi. The monks must prepare you for war. The only way in is over the walls. We must find a less guarded section before attempting an ascent. Finally, we face a worthy foe. Victory will bring us glory. Glory? We fight for duty. Does our father's ghost possess you? All I hear is his voice. We must honor his vision, Bihan. Vision is what he lacked. He was blind to our superiority. We settle for defending Earthrealm when we could help lead it. Our clan doesn't govern. It serves. That is our past. It won't be our future.
As a boy, I heard tales of battles against your kind. I had fought them tall ones. All Earth Realmers will soon know of Eternus. My realm starves, and it's coming here to feed. You will end this day hungry. What is this? We are charged with defending the fortress. None will escape us. Test your might. You are Quan Chi's creation. Liu Kang warned about you. I had hoped for the chance to battle your dark magic. You are not so fearsome. You're both unharmed? We are, brother. Good. After our years of idleness, it pleases me to again face combat. I will be pleased when we complete our mission. Continue working. I must oversee production of the remaining basins. That's Quan Chi. The other sorcerer Liu Kang described. Kawhi Liang and I will capture him. Stay here. Do not let them activate the Soul Stealers. Soul Stealers be completed on time, Quan Chi. Yes. Our benefactor's guidance has proven most helpful. If we break it, we'll halt their construction. Agreed. Sends no other way. Your failure was inevitable. This is so unnecessary. What I can offer you. You won't decline. 
Unless it's your surrender, I am not interested. I had hoped for a worthier enemy. Perhaps now you wish to entertain my offer. How would you know what I value? We are strangers to each other. I know that you wish to break free of Liu Kang's control. To gain your clan unrivaled power. I offer the means to do both. Ignore him, brother. He promises only corruption. Grandmaster. I am sure you're asking yourself, can I afford to trust a man I have never met? But the true question you must ask is, can I afford not to? in common. We both feel the pull of Liu Kang's leash. Once Outworld rules Earthrealm, you will be free to remake the Lin Kuei in any manner you see fit. Bihan, don't listen! We must stop them, not- Silence, Kui Liang. But brother- Obey your Grandmaster. Can you win this war? Soul Stealers are deadly, but they're not enough. You only think so because you don't understand their true purpose. Explain. Emperor Ying built this fortress during one of Earthrealm's most turbulent periods. Enemies beset him on all sides. He built a great army to protect his empire. He built a second one to protect him in the afterlife. This is Emperor Ying's dragon army. Impressive. But does this history lesson have a point? These statues were constructed and enchanted by the great mages in the Emperor's court. by fragments of souls. Once alive, they fight tirelessly, unburdened by remorse or pity. As our ally, you will be given command of several battalions. Few in Earthrealm could then resist the Lin Kuei.
Turn in his grave if he saw this. He was a doddering old fool. He did us a favor having that accident. And I was right to let him die. Let him die? You said you tried to save him. A lie. Because you couldn't and still can't face the truth. Father had doomed the Lin Kuei to mediocrity. Now, we will achieve greatness. <laughs> Neither of you are up to the task. Do not let Kwai Liang escape! Decline Shang Tsung's offer. I assume your brother has not. The sorcerer tempted him into forsaking his oath. He can be convincing, can't he? Spurning him is a grave mistake. The mistake is yours, Outworlder. What have you done? Kuei's flame is not easily smothered. Split up! We must find him! What happened? Where's Bi Han? He's betrayed us. We're all in imminent danger. Letting father die. Forsaking Earthrealm? He's abandoned all reason! I knew Bihan's frustrations ran deep, but I never thought they could inspire such madness. We can't let his corruption spread. Whatever it takes, I am with you. Thank you. We may not share blood, but we are brothers. Do your oaths mean nothing? It's your duty to obey my will. Not when it betrays Lingfei principles. 
we won't sacrifice them to serve your ambition! My fight. End this, brother. Embrace the future. I want no part of it. You pervert all that it means to be Lin Kuei. You are my grandmaster no longer. What are you doing? Once he's exposed, won't you be made grandmaster? You forget Cyrax and Sector. Their loyalty to Bihan is absolute. They'll sooner abet his corruption than follow me. We must chart a new course. One that both honors our father's legacy and serves Earthrealm. Help me. We can't leave him here to aid Shang Tsung. You arrived not a moment too soon, Gyrus. What have you learned? In scrutinizing Shang Tsung's first meeting with his benefactor, I made an important discovery. Her life essence, the very time crystals that make up her being, are not of this timeline. Not of this timeline? How could someone from a previous timeline enter this one? That cannot happen. If that cannot happen, then what has happened, Gears? There are no other timelines than those that have come before. All evidence points to the presence of a second timeline, which exists concurrently with ours. Two timelines, side by side, moving forward simultaneously? Never in a billion lifetimes have I seen this. But that does not make the other timeline any less real. There can be no doubt that Shang Tsung's benefactor hails from it. Hmm. And who she is, why she's here, where she's from. All questions we need answered, which we can't, or we are under attack. I will go to Sindel. Convince her to withdraw from Earthrealm by showing her how history is being manipulated. That will require revealing to her your prior role as Keeper of Time. The situation gives me no choice. I will need your help, Gears, to prove my claims to the Empress. Return home, Lord Liu Kang. I am to let no one pass. I must see Her Majesty. She must call off her attack on Earthrealm. Her decision was unwise, but she no longer seeks my counsel, and I doubt she's interested in yours. The Empress has been deceived. Shang Tsung and General Shao have fomented this crisis as a means to steal her throne. General Shao? I knew he was hiding his true intentions. But join Shang Tsung? Ugh. I knew he couldn't be trusted. Were I still Umgadi, he would never have breathed the same air as the Empress. My palace sources told me he arrived out of nowhere and immediately had the Empress's ear. He gained her trust by treating Princess Melina's condition. Tragically, she is afflicted with Tarkat disease. Tarkat? 
The Empress must be beside herself. If Shang Tsung found a treatment, no wonder she embraced him. I have shared this with no one. I trust that you, of all people, will keep this secret. Of course. Were it made public, it would bring down the royal family. Li Mei, Empress Sindel needs our help. Will you join me? Emperor Jared's death, the pain it caused Empress Sindel, has always haunted me. I failed the royal family once. I won't do so again. Everything now makes sense. My Umgadi contacts had said the general soldiers had been encroaching. But still, I, I can't fathom it. General Shao committing treason? It is the fruit of a poisonous seed planted by Shang Tsung. He played to the general's vanity, inflamed his prejudices to convince him that he alone could save our world. He may be unstoppable. The Umgadi don't have numbers, and my constables aren't trained for war. Know that I, too, will aid in the Empress's defense. Driver, what is it? I may need that aid right now. Return Liu Kang to the portal gate, Li Mei. He isn't welcome in Outworld. I won't support the general, Reiko, nor his plot to usurp the throne. Then you won't live to see the new regime. They have us surrounded. I am Earthrealm's protector, Li Mei. I am no stranger to combat. Then let's get out there. You should have joined us, not the constabulary. We could have used your own gaudy skills. Enough! I've no use for a traitor's compliments. You and your accomplices will face judgment, Reiko. We must leave. Reinforcements will be on the way. Word of his arrival precedes you. Surrender if you wish to remain unharmed. Let us pass, Tanya. The Empress and her family are in danger. He brings word that Shang Tsung and General Shao plot against them. The General? Are you so easily taken in by lies? Once again, you prove incapable of protecting the royal house. I'm sorry you made that necessary. Priestesses. You know who I am. Of my deeds when I was one of you. I may no longer be welcome. But in my heart, I am still Umgadi. I will always honor my vows. He's here to end a threat to the Empress. Stand against us, and she will lose the throne. Stand with us, and we will save the Empire. Why didn't you kill me? Because we mean you no harm. And that you live will help prove that fact to the Empress.
How dare you, Li Mei? It's not enough that you let Jared be murdered. You'd let Liu Kang destroy the rest of my family? My heart broke when your husband died. I lost not only my emperor, but you, my closest friend. I know you may never forgive me. But don't be blinded by anger and grief. We are here to help you. <laughs> No, daughter. Your condition. Your faithlessness astounds, Li Mei. How can you side with Earthrealm against us? I'm acting for your family's benefit, and for Outworlds. If you took a moment, you'd realize it. You must be smarter, princess. No, Melina. I forbid it. I must. If I won't risk my life for the throne, I'm not worthy of it. I remember teaching you that, Princess. You were but a girl. <laughs> that was long ago. Much has changed. My loyalty to your family hasn't. Trust me now, as you did then. Please, Princess, just listen. We shouldn't fight. Forgive me, Princess but I won't allow you to hurt yourself or anyone else. Tarkat makes victims of us all. I am in your debt. No, your majesty. There can be no debt between friends. I am glad she is safe, and that our conflict has ended. It is paused, not ended. Li Mei has earned my goodwill. Whether you do remains to be seen. I seek only peace, your majesty. Is that why you send minions on secret missions into my empire? You've proved yourself the enemy I was long warned you would be. I understand your anger, but I had reason to believe that Shang Tsung posed a threat to both of us. Until I confirmed them, I did not want to burden you with my suspicions. And now? They have proven true. Shang Tsung, Quan Chi, the General. They conspire to conquer our realms. A serious charge. Where is your proof? At Shang Tsung's laboratory. If what you see there does not convince you, I will surrender Earthrealm without a fight. Could I have so misjudged them? For Shang Tsung to indulge in such depravity, for General Shao to condone it. They are not the men I thought them. Despite my best efforts, neither man nor Quan Chi are who they were meant to be. They're not your responsibility. They're outworlders. But it is I who crafted their destinies, along with those of all other beings, at the dawn of history. You created the realms. I is your mind addled, demigod? I am a mere demigod now, but eons ago, I was more powerful than all of the Elder Gods combined. I was a Titan, and the Keeper of Time.
This is Gyrus. Your Majesty. Your Highnesses. Gyrus is the guardian of the Hourglass. A celestial object which lies beyond the realms. The Hourglass regulates time and destiny. When I wielded its power, it was upon me to craft all of existence. Which I did when I restarted history. Restarted? This timeline was preceded by billions more. Though this is the first of Liu Kang's design, the others were designed by his predecessor. Kronika was obsessed with equalizing good and evil. When a timeline veered too far to one or the other, she would halt it and restart history, tinkering with lives and events in the hope of achieving her golden balance. Prior timelines, Kronika gave Shang Tsung and Quan Chi mastery of the most vile magics. Shao is not a general, a tyrannical ruler bent on conquest. You, Sidel, were his ruthless wife, who would do anything to preserve your privilege. When I took the hourglass from Kronika, I vowed to do better. So in this timeline, the sorcerers would not gain their dark powers. Shao would be your loyal follower, and you would rule Outworld firmly, but fairly. But someone has interfered with Liu Kang's design. Shao, Shang Tsung, Guan Chi, all have been groomed by an unknown entity to be the villains they were in previous timelines. Where to begin? Am I to kneel to my creator? Do you expect worship? No, Your Majesty. My prior role was thrust upon me by circumstance. I am in no way divine. You had power over all of creation, yet you gave it up. Because I saw how it drove Kronika mad, I knew I would fare no better had I kept it. dare you conspire against Outworld? Not against Outworld, but against your misguided rule. Your deference to him leaves us all vassals. So you sanction these unspeakable horrors? Lie to me about the threats we face? Thanks to you, Earthrealm blood is already on my hands. Bloodshed, without cause or provocation. Don't move. Empress, everyone, stay back. What is it? The Amulet of Shinnok, a weapon of terrifying power. It should not exist. Its maker is powerless, as Liu Kang designed. Yet more proof of foreign interference. Enough, Prattle! You both bend a knee to Outworld's new Emperor. Put down the Amulet. Its evil is beyond your control. <laughs> do you think I do battle not train with my weapon? I am more than prepared. So General Shao casts his lot with Outworld's enemies against me. You're no better than Shang Tsung's monstrosities. Tanya and your daughters, they are not dead, but trapped in the amulet. We can still save them. that you are party to Shao's treason. Know that it will cost you your life. I owe him mine many times over. Sacrificing it in his service would be an honor. Your rebellion is doomed. Your betrayal hurts most, Rain. I thought of you as a son. 
I've outgrown you, Empress. Shang Tsung's taught me that I've scratched just the surface of my power. To explore it, I can't be bound by your limits. You are forever dead to me. Your reign is over, Sindel. I remember the weak, sickly boy you were. How your father fought to push you past your infirmities. Now you repay him by spitting on his ideals? Your revolt shreds every value he held dear. You are relieved, General. The amulet, your majesty. I hate to disrupt, but we must act quickly to save Earthrealm. Is that the command of my creator? No, your majesty. It is the request of a friend. And the Soul Stealers. Keep them running. I am sure we'll find a use for the Collected Souls. No. Those are the General's most loyal lieutenants. They must be neutralized if we are to shut down the Soul Stealers. Yes, they do. We should split up. together. Closer, and you'll feel the points of my blade. We are many. You are one. Your souls will become part of our collection. You'll have no part of me, Ermac. Amazing, Melina. In another life, you could have been Umgadi. <laughs> I prefer this one, dearest Tanya. Yeah. We must leave. Quickly! Melina, wait! Uh, father? Father, is it 
truly you? Yes, Melina. This body was created from the living forest souls. Mine was one of them. Your attack broke the spell that binds us. Now, I am in control. Father... You are Umgari, but not Li Mei. I replaced her after your death, Your Majesty. She left the Order rather than accept punishment. Punishment? It was not her fault. A discussion for another time, Father. We must go. Greetings, Jared. Liu Kang, my friend. We meet again. It is good to have you back. We once again find ourselves in challenging circumstances. And once again, we will prevail. As always, Sindel, I am yours to command. Unaware that the Soul Stealers are shut down. We are deep within the mountain. From here, they couldn't tell. Look at them conspiring. It is history we should not be repeating. We must take the crown. Without it, he can't raise more warriors. Our odds will improve if we can surround them. I'll distract them while the rest of you get into position. Leave it to me, Mother. Princess Melina. I bring news from Outworld. Sindel is deposed. General Shao now rules. And yet you are still free. To succeed, the General needed help on the inside. I provided it. The heir to the throne gives it up willingly. <laughs> it is a burden I've never wanted. The realm is better left in General... Uh, Emperor Shao's hands. A most mature perspective. Outworld benefits from your wisdom. Yes, Shang Tsung, it does. But not in the manner that you expect. Gambit Princess. It is an impressive display of guile. Who knew she was so capable? You count yourselves among my doubters. I will count you among the dead. <laughs> there will be consequences for forsaking Outworld. <sighs> Thanks to the princess, this fight is ended. The fight, perhaps. Not the battle. True. Until your benefactor is caught, the realms remain threatened. Who is she, sorcerer? <laughs> Speak of the devil. Liu Kang. Meet Damashi. Damashi? You are 
are the victim of deception, sorcerer. You're not Damashi. You're me. More correctly, you are me. A poor facsimile, anyway. Made lesser by Liu Kang's meddling. What's happening here? Who is he? This Chang Song is whom I battled for the Hourglass. I thought him dead. As I did you, Liu Kang. It turns out our battle released mammoth energies which ripped apart time's fabric. The fight had two conclusions. In one, I was the victor. In the other, it was you. It was eons before I discovered this. Once I did, I knew the path forward. I took this form and infiltrated your timeline. I elevated these wretches, giving them great power. Together, they sowed discord among the realms and assembled for me the Dragon Army. I led them to believe they were aiding my conquest of Earthrealm and Outworld. But my intent is to exterminate all life in this timeline, and then merge it into my own. You promised us realms. Now you leave us to slaughter? You were pawns, not partners. Your purpose served. You will be sacrificed. We served you loyally, built you the Dragon Crown. This? This is a toy. I do not need it to control the Dragon Army. Only the souls contained within. Goodbye, Liu Kang. Neither you nor your timeline will be missed. It appears our interests align. For now. Know that I trust neither of you. I will finish you both at the first hint of treachery. Wrong. Serum wearing off must stay in control. You attack my family, I will make you suffer. Further resistance serves no purpose. This timeline will be destroyed. Fight. If you dare, I will finish what Raiden could not.
Your tenacity is to be admired. Until our last breaths are taken, as long as blood flows through our veins, we are not beaten. <laughs> Noble sentiments, which in the end matter little. None of you will leave here alive. child lose her mother. If my mother dies, she won't be the only send out to perish! Mother, you can't go. It's my time, dear. At least we had a few hours more. I will cherish them. Mother. You are now Empress. Rule well. I will, Mother. Father and Katana will help me. Of course. Father, what did you do? I collected your mother's soul. It resides within me. She is safe. Hurry, everyone. We must withdraw. To move an army that large among realms, he'll need a portal, yes? More than one. You will need a nexus of portal gateways. It must be nearby. We follow them, they will lead us to it. Agreed. But we cannot strike until Raiden and Kung Lao arrive. That the Lin Kuei won't aid us is unforgivable. Li Han has corrupted them totally. When this crisis ends, we will deal with that one. This is but the opening battle in a longer war. Titan Shang Tsung has prepared his entire timeline for it. We cannot match its strength. My counterpart said that your battle with him ripped time's fabric, creating two timelines. But how do we know that it wasn't torn further? If there are two timelines, can't there be more? Why the thought experiment, sorcerer? You said we lack strength. We might find it in other timelines. How would we do that? We gather allies from across timelines. Other Titans to build an overwhelming force. If they exist. We have no proof that they do. We must fight the battle in front of us. We can't stake our survival on pure conjecture. If Liu Kang is right, the battle in front of us is already lost. This may be our only hope. Yiris, your thoughts? It is possible. But as I am only the Hourglass's steward, such a search is beyond me. It can only be undertaken by the Keeper of Time. And I no longer wield that power. You may be able to regain it. What? How do you mean? When you gave up control of the Hourglass, I worried that one day you would find you needed it. So rather than let your power dissipate, 
I collected it. To this day, it remains safely stored. Why did you never tell me this? Because the process of restoring your power is likely irreversible. Returning to the life you have now as Earthrealm's protector, a life you cherish, may be impossible. And you did not want me tempted to make that sacrifice unless it was absolutely necessary. Correct. Thank you, Giris. You have saved us with your wisdom. Now, where have you stored my power? We must retrieve it. It is at the Fire Temple, stored in the Jade Jaguar gifted to you by the Great Kung Lao. Yes, Giris. Liu Kang has proven more resilient than anticipated. He and his comrades have escaped the fortress. Forget the others. Find Liu Kang. He alone threatens my plans. You could have picked no better vessel to store my power, Giris. I have always treasured the great Kung Lao's gift. It reminds me of his meticulous nature and his generous heart. Once we retrieve the Jade Jaguar, we will proceed to the Hourglass. There, we will transfer the temporal power stored within it to you. It now occurs to me that all along, you have had unfettered access to the power stored within. You could have taken it, become Keeper of Time, but chose not to. Why? Because I have faith in your vision for this new era. I am content to be its guardian. Thank you, Giris. Now, this process you propose, you are sure it will restore my power? As sure as I can be of one that has been neither tried nor tested. But even if successful, it is not guaranteed that you will find any other timelines or allies. They may not exist. <sighs> I pray this is not a fool's errand. I hate leaving the others behind. Your champions will bolster their strength against the Dragon Army. It is sure to be the mother of all battles. May the Elder Gods protect them. My ex was so wrong. The 30k I spent on this seems like a steal right now. This magic is incredible. Not magic, your loveliness. Technology. Either way, it's clear what must happen next. The gateways and the dragon army have to be destroyed. Scorpion, have you a plan? We must divide our forces. You, Shang Tsung, Quan Chi, will use your magic to attack the portals. As you do, Kenshi and Jared will grind down the Dragon Army. The rest of us will attack our Dark Doubles. If they're defeated, it will hopefully throw the Dragon Warriors into disarray. An astute strategy. Truly, I could not have devised a better one. Enough with the empty flattery. If you want our trust, give us actions, not words.
That is unfortunate. The battle continues, Shang Tsung. Quan Chi, with me. I, for one, am not pleased we were double-crossed. It is an ire I share. May I suggest we harness our anger and use it to obliterate my doppelganger's minions. This pair will trouble us no more. There are more who acquire our attention. Welcome, sorcerers. Is it me, or is that Raiden becoming insufferable? You are not wrong, but it is tomorrow's problem. Let us first solve today's. Problem solved. It's progress. Now on to the next. His life force is feeding the portal's energy. We kill him. We close them permanently. These meddling minions grow tiresome. Let us finish them. So much for fire and ice. Hours. Army's trapped. All of the other realms in this timeline are safe. Never forget, Raiden, that we risked our lives to perform this service. One that wouldn't have been needed if you hadn't conspired with the other Shang Tsung. They will fight to the last man. Come, we must help the others. Yes. 
search. Ready enough. May there be other timelines and titans to find. Gyrus? Liu Kang? Easy, Katana. You are among friends. What's happened? Where am I? A long way from home. In a different timeline, to be precise. What? Are you also a... A keeper of time? Yes. Both of us? How is that possible? The battle for Kronika's Hourglass ripped apart time's fabric. Where there once was one timeline, there are now many. Each new timeline represents a different possible outcome of that battle. In mine, I became Time's Keeper. In yours, it was you. In others, it could be Jade, Sindel, even Kano. The possibilities are endless. If many timelines sprung from one, and we were both part of it, then... You are... You are my... Liu Kang. The same one who battled you in Shang Tsung's courtyard. Who fought at your side at the Colosseum. Who beamed with pride when you became Outworld's Khan. Why does fate seem always to conspire against us? Deny us life's simple pleasures. I don't know. Perhaps in one of the many timelines, they are ours. I would like to think you brought me here for them. But I know you well enough to know better. What duty beckons us? I will tell you. But first, we must gather more of our old friends. Shang Tsung, Titan, wielding the power of the Hourglass? Yes, Kung Lao. He is a threat to all timelines. He is not yet aware of any beyond his and Liu Kang's. For now, it is only a matter of time. I had hoped my victory over Kronika would end the endless cycle of combat. Sadly, it begins anew. We have no choice. We must stop Shang Tsung. The millions in my White Lotus Society will aid us, if needed. Thank you, my friends. He is here. have found allies. Titan allies, in fact. How oh, could I have been so blind? Of course our timelines aren't the only two. Retreat to yours, Shang Tsung. Your attempt to merge timelines has failed. Yes. Your comrades proved most resourceful. Thus, I have resigned myself to simply destroying your timeline. Knowing that others exist to conquer makes that choice much more palatable. Once I destroy your hourglass, your timeline will cease to exist. I will take great pleasure in finishing you one last time. how I remember. I know what you'll do before you do it. Likewise. Let's hope our advantage proves decisive. 
How I've missed fighting by Katana's side. Musa will go! Let's rip the flesh from their bones! Artanya's of all timelines this evil. Mine is no better. You should meet mine. She's a vast improvement. I'd like that. Should we survive this battle? Are you the best Shang Tsung can do? It has begun. This timeline will be destroyed. You quickly, my friend. This battle ends with your timeline obliterated. Your final moments will be torture and pain. I do not fear your bravado. I have bested twins far more evil than you. Go back to your timeline, brothers. We have little time. The hourglass is failing. Then let us end this now. Be good girls and kill them, won't you? As you command, Shang Tsung. Katana and I will fight them. You save the hourglass. Yes, Liu Kang. <laughs> Fool. You cannot save it. I don't know which of them is worse. Both are cracked reflections of me. They are abominations. Neither will survive this fight. Once Shang Tsung is finished, you will be too. Thank you, everyone, for your aid. This battle was won together. Shang Tsung is gone, but he's not defeated. He will be back to renew his campaign. Not only against this timeline, but against all timelines. Our choice is clear. We must take the fight to him. Destroy any power he has to make war against us. Agreed. Cheng Sung is likely already gathering allies as I gathered you. We must best his efforts. Assemble an overwhelming army from across all timelines.
to run, Shang Tsung. Nowhere to hide. We have banded together to rid all timelines of your evil. The threat you pose to them ends today. Such certainty, Liu Kang, that this battle will end in your favor. It can end no other way. Because across all timelines, the arc of history bends toward justice. Does it? In this timeline, it bends toward me. Behold, Liu Kang, the hell I unleash upon you. Now hurry. There's no time to waste. You face the greatest warrior who ever lived. you burn <laughs> <laughs> 
Assist me, Quan Chi. Scorpion, you are almost there. You won't like how this ends. Further, Scorpion. Follow me. Your defenses have failed, Shang Tsung. This is over. I do not think so. Realize, Sorcerer, that you've brought this on yourself. Avarice and Ego have again proved your undoing. We have no choice but to eradicate you. It is you who will be eradicated. You and your followers. And once you are dead, all timelines will be mine. Your position is precarious. To survive, you must submit. Yes. The question you must ask is, if Liu Kang couldn't finish us, how possibly could you? And they called me the Chosen One. I am honored, Liu Kang. Shall we finish this? You have done more than enough. Please permit me to end this. May that be the last we see of you. What's happening? Timeline. Without Shang Tsung to hold it together, it's falling apart. You must return to your timeline before this one collapses. Thank you for your aid, Scorpion. May we one day meet again. I'm telling you, the locations we found here are money. I mean, look at this. Don't the rainbow colors on these mountains just scream, Outworld? I cannot believe you'll be telling our story. 
about how we defeated Shang Tsung. Well, the studio thinks it's fiction, not fact. <laughs> but I don't care, as long as it's covering the budget. <laughs> I assume you'll be the star. Nope, I'm behind the camera, writing and directing. Time to let someone younger and prettier take the lead. You know, I've written in parts for all of you, if you want them. Us? On screen? I mean, they're cameos. But like they say, there are no small parts. Thank you, Johnny. But we must decline. But Raiden! The new initiates arrive tomorrow. We must return to the Wuxi to begin their instruction. Of course, you are right. What about you, Takahashi? I need a blind swordsman. And no actor can do what you do. <laughs> I would love to. But my work to revive the Tyra is starting to pay off. I can't let up now. Well, I know better than to ask you. Your plate is always full. Indeed, Johnny Cage. Which is why I must now depart. Off to Outworld? To advise the Empress? Between her father and her sister, Melina is receiving plenty of good advice. And with the sorcerers and the general imprisoned, there are few threats to her rule. Is something wrong, then? I am simply shoring up our defenses. As you know, Bi Han and his Lin Kuei have abandoned their roles as Earthrealm's guardians. His brother, Kuai Liang, has agreed to build a new clan, the Shirai Ryu, to take its place. I must go aid his efforts. Is there anything we can do? Not yet, but I will call upon all of you when the time comes. Madame Bo, once again you have served an excellent meal. That's kind of you to say. Enjoy the rest of your evening. And thank you, all of you. You have served well as Earthrealm's champions. No, Liu Kang. Thank you. Joining up with you really has changed the arcs of our lives. I am glad. All right, gentlemen. If you're finished, there's only one thing left to do. Which one of you gets the bad news? Whew, not me. I'm still three mil in the hole on Sento. How uh, thick's your wallet, Takahashi? Thick enough. But seems to me our hosts are on the hook. They did invite you us. You think we have money? The Shaolin live modestly. Don't worry, Sean. I've got this covered. Besides, my business manager tells me I can write this whole thing off. The realms are in safe hands. He struggles. Everyone who fought today did so fiercely. <laughs> Had I not been here for it, I would have thought it impossible. Warriors from across timelines clashing in combat. <laughs> the blood, the death, the chaos. Yes, Lord Havoc. It's unfortunate it all ended so fast. The next time, it won't.